Ooh. Ooh, I gotta move that over now that I've changed that. It looks weird with that just popping out of nowhere. Hey. All right, hold on. Let's move that camera so it doesn't look so weird. And... Yay! Right there, I think, maybe... That looks about right. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. All right. Hello, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Okay, you're almost MR14. Nice. Congrats. Congrats. Hey, Blaze. Hello. Hello. Skeleton. Sean. Mr. Math. Rosa. Mizu. How are we all doing? Ah. Uh, it is a day, yes. So, um, today we are going to be hanging out with Lady the Laddie later. Uh, they are on Pacific time, so they'll be joining us a little later. So we'll just uh, hang out, knock out, pop some relics, uh, I don't know, steal path incursions, whatever. All sounds good. We got, uh, we got some time, we got options. So I hope everyone's doing okay today. Finishing off some work. Nice. Nice, nice. Been doing some more testing with the uh, Rhino. And I definitely agree. Subsuming over Rhino Charge on a build that wants to really focus on Parasitic Armor and Iron Skin is not the best idea. Um, use just swapping that to... Subsuming over Roar and putting an Ironclad Charge instead of the Augment for the four. Going from like 30, 40k Iron Skin, I've been able to get like 130k minimum to about 190 regularly if I put a little more effort into it. So, seems like a big increase, like just a big increase. Definitely seems worth it. Hey, Strikers, how you doing? Hello, hello. Alrighty. Let's see what we've even got for incursions. Nagler on Eris. I think I've already completed Eris. Yes. Lua we've completed. M Prime on Mercury. I think that's been done, but we haven't completed Mercury, so maybe not. Yeah, it has been. Okay. Um, Void we've completed. Selkie on Setana. I think that one's done. Yeah, we've only got Naki and... Vodianai. So. Oh, you're about to get your operator? Nice, Strikers. Very nice. How do you get the Archon mods? Easy. You have to be in the Drifter camp, not your... Not the orbiter. You gotta come over here and talk to Chipper. But in order to get the 
ranks that you need to be able to purchase them from Chipper. You have to have done, I want to say, either two... I don't remember how many call missions you have to have done. It might be two... I don't think it's three. I think it's two. Maybe it's one. Maybe it is just one. Hey, Bear Kitty. Yep. No worries. Yeah, it, uh, it does require interaction with Chipper. Yes. Which is, is not Bear Kitty's favorite character for, well, stereotypical reasons. Yeah. So, hey, Bear Kitty. Other than us having Chipper on screen there, how you doing? Yeah, no problem, Blaze. No problem. I don't think there's a mute chipper option. I think you can mute all voice lines, but then that's obviously all voice lines, so... You were trying to sleep but gave up. Ah, sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Well, you want to run some relics? As long as you can't sleep? There's a Neo Survival Fisher on Steel Path. You can hang out there for a bit. Hey, yes, Gauss Prime should, unless they swap the order with Grendel, should be coming after Wisp. Let's see what we've got here. Why? Why do you sort by name? Stop sorting by name. That's not what I t have ever told you to do. Ah. Uh, well, up to you, Bear Kitty. Up to you. Hey, Identity. Ah, space saving, nice. I'm gonna stick with that. Do we wanna go? Maybe we'll go this route. Let's see. Alright. So anyone else down for popping some relics? Holy crap, 16 terabyte network attached storage has less than 600 gigabytes free? Oof. I don't even have 16 terabytes of storage available to me. That is crazy. What kind of media? Are you, do you have, uh, you storing like all like TV shows and movies on there then? That'd do it. That would do it. Yeah, I am hanging in there. That's about all I can say, Kai. But what do you say a noise to? Bear Kitty storage capacity or something else? storage yeah i mean network attacks having your own network attached storage is pretty sweet that's for sure i 
That's terrible. radiation on this. Plus crit damage, that's one of the things I want. Hey, Flutie. How you doing? Sixteen terabyte network attached storage, Fluti. That's what Bear Kitty got. Don't know if it was recent though. Plus crit chance is something I want, but that's not better than my current ribbon. At least it's getting the idea to do z minus zoom is the negative. Like, yes, that that's that's what I want when you actually give me other good rolls. You're you're getting the idea there. Oh, oh, chat, is this better? It's only three positives, but is it better? Plus, plus crit chance, plus crit damage are two of the three positives I'm looking for. Plus mag capacity, I don't care about. I'd rather have, like, multi-shot, but... I don't know. That is so hard. That is, that is so hard. Reload speed is one of the ways I'm building it, but it, I wasn't going to build it in a way that I needed it on the Riven. Plus, damage doesn't scale well into high levels. It's not bad. It doesn't scale well. Plus, toxin is kind of nice. I forget if I'm using that currently to make viral or not. Plus, weapon recoil is a harmless negative on this if you aren't using... Anything to make the magazine capacity double up, which this shouldn't make it double up, but it doesn't matter because this doesn't have plus recoil. Huh. Hey, Spellheim. Welcome. Oh, you're at work, Jester? Appreciate it. I don't know, chat. This is a this is a toss-up. Hmm. Yes, it's a toss up. Cheers to the work the yes, the work lurk, exactly. I actually think I'm gonna go with this one for now. It's closer to what I really want out of the ribbon. We're gonna go with this. Hmm. All right. Yes, plus zoom. That's what I want. This is not a sniper. Come on. Not a sniper. You have an earbud in. Ooh. Look at that. I warrant an earbud. Ooh. -hoo. Ah. Uh. 
so chat sorry i was running a little late today um ran into yet another issue with inter intermittent internet but i'm pretty sure it has to do with my routers i think i tried something that i think should help but we'll see we we will see Hey, Frank, hanging in there. How about you? That is a nice crit chance, but I don't care about plus zoom. Dead from college? Ah, taking a toll. I'm sorry. It can get rough, that's for sure. It can definitely get rough. Come on. Give me a goodie. Give me a goodie. That's no. Seriously? Plus zoom, minus crit damage? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you, Riven? Ooh, like minus... Yeah, the only time I want minus crit chance is on an incarnate weapon. I know that was crit damage, but still. Usually we want crit. Plus zoom yet again. This is not a sniper. Does the game understand that this is not a sniper? I don't think the game understands that. Um, plus crit chance, plus crit damage, plus something else useful like multi-shot ideally, and then a harmless negative like zoom or, uh, you know, increased recoil, something like that. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's all RNG, so it's not that the game doesn't understand. It's like, it's just luck of the draw, but still, you're like, the, the fact that it keeps showing me the same thing so many times, I'm like, this is not a sniper. That's not what we want. Like, I know it's not the game screwing me over, but it's fun to complain about it sometimes. Game does want me to snipe with it, that's for sure. marbles um maybe we'll do some more giveaways soon but no plans today sam that is not what we want Snipe with Tonkor for Eidolons. I mean, crit chance, crit damage, you never know. Maybe. Could be useful. Unfortunately, there's no... Like, faction mod for sentience on rifles. That Then it would really be a potential. Like, if there's a faction mod for sentience, yeah, then... We could probably see it. Well, hell, Belberith is out there using the Convectrix. I think technically you can use anything and potentially get a 6x3 if you're good enough, but... Innate Blast Damage, which the Tonker already has innate Blast Damage. Hey! Let's double that up. Oh yeah, they definitely are. Oof. That's a woof. I'm going to go to 180 and then uh, shift gears here, I think. No, oh, not great. <laughs> Creepy. 
How you doing? So I'm the smartest <laughs> of the group. Do you understand how <laughs> catastrophic that's going to be? Yeah, most of the Riven rolls, it is just... Like, you gotta go into it knowing you're just having fun. You're probably gonna get a crap roll. Um, holy fucking hell, what? Ah, I hate it. What? Something on my phone, when it updates, every time it makes a little more progress on the update, my watch vibrates to tell me, hey, new notification, but it's not a new notification, it's just it made a little more progress on updating. Like, makes me want to take the watch off and just toss it across the room, honestly. Like, how can you be that dumb, you stupid piece of technology? Yep, we are staying with crit, which it's two-thirds of the positives I wanted. It doesn't have a negative, so... We're not there yet. I don't know. It's it's nice. It's not as nice as my Archiplasmor that doesn't have a negative. Like, it's nice, but I don't want plus magazine capacity on that weapon at all. This one is at least crit damage, crit chance, and damage. I mean, if you're only going to give me three positives and no negative, I'll take that. I would have preferred multi-shot over damage, but I'll take the damage. Yeah, it's not horrible at all. Let me go double check my build on that. Make sure I wasn't relying on the toxin that was there before. Ah, I was. I was. Okay. How do we want to play with this then? Hmm. Um, I haven't used the Bubonico a ton myself, but it if you invest in it, it is a pretty good shoddy. It is definitely a good weapon. Hmm. So how do we want to play this? Because there goes Viral. But we have a lot better crit now. So Malignant Force and Infected Clip are my only ones that are going to add it. Huh. I don't know what I want to lose here. We need that crit. We need that crit. That is our faction mod that helps with the damage multiplier. Multi-shot we definitely like. Um... Eventually, we want primed fast hands when I actually have that available to help with the fact that this is a single magazine capacity gun. So it feels like a rock and a hard place on the build here. Yeah, Kuvatankor actually for a while has, has already been one of the, the better AoE weapons out there. For sure. My Riven, it is now plus mag capacity, plus crit chance, plus crit damage. Oh yeah, Kuva Nukor is great too. Hmm. We could just take Cryo Rounds off and ignore trying to make Viral altogether. What does that do? Oh, that is a massive drop in our radial attack. I don't... I am not a math guy, but looking at those numbers, I don't think that's going to work out in our favor. Hmm. Hmm. 
So losing toxin on this was not ideal. I suppose the other positive, rather than being multi-shot, could be toxin to be useful. Crit damage, crit chance, toxin, harmless, negative. I think for right now we just do... I think we go with this at the moment. We'll see how it goes. I think this is what it looks like for now. Yeah, if I take the reload speed off that, it really hurts because it's a single shot magazine. So losing reload speed, like I actually want primed fast hands so that I can increase my reload speed. So, yeah, we could... So basically for our, our other positive here, instead of mag capacity, we really want either reload or we want toxin so that'll take care of one of our two desires out of this honestly if we get toxin there that's going to be better because prime fast hands exists and on the rifle world we don't have a prime toxin mod so ideally we get toxin crit chance crit damage i guess well options we're done rolling that one for now we'll kind of play with it as is see how it does without the viral all right oh yeah true i could just now that i think so thank you to know that reminds me I could just change the innate element on my Tonkor. I think I've got an impact Tonkor right now because Fiery hooked me up with a Tonkor. And I, knowing I have shit luck at getting a good percent element, it's like 58%. So I could just go get another Tonkor and make it toxin and then problem solved. And then I don't have to worry. I, I don't have to worry as much about what the uh, yeah reload speed, nice damage, crit damage, minus damage to corpus. Yeah, that's a solid one. Completely forgot about that. Yes, that would be that'd be nice. Yeah, you got hunter munitions there, so you have reload speed there. Okay. Gotcha, yeah, so you've got a very similar thought process. Okay. Very similar thought process. Um, if you want a little more capacity so you can pump up Cryo Round, swap Vital Sense and Prime Firestorm, by the way. You're definitely missed opportunity there. Could get cryo rounds a lot. Uh, you could actually finish cryo rounds off if you do that. Oh no, just when you do have endo. Yes, thank you for reminding me. I forgot that I have a base impact Tonkor. Yeah. Oh, it's 57, not 58%, but still. Huh. Yeah. All right. See, and that's why I've been, that's also a re, I also forgot, that's why I've been rolling the Tonkor Riven, because I kind of want to land on the Riven, and then go finish off my Tonkor, because whatever I get for the Tonkor, that'll be enough to put it to 60%, and then I can just be done with it. Um, because I have multiple loadouts for it, Wizza. If you notice, Corpus, Grenier, Infested. So I just, depending on the mission I'm going into, we've got a different Bane on each one. Uh, eventually, I want Bane of Corrupted, and then I'll either get another config slot, or I'll just replace Infested, because they tend to be the squishiest of all the factions. 
Yeah, the cor the corrupted faction mods drop very rarely. I think I've got a non-primed melee one. And that's the only one. And I only have one copy of it, too. They're a really low drop rate. Yeah, 420 ammo drums. Nice. All right. All right. Oh, I don't know how I wasn't aware of this before, but... I just realized that Excavation has, like, three exclusive arcanes that you can't get anywhere else. And suddenly I kind of, that makes me... Did I say Excavation? I meant Arbitration if I said Excavation, just looking at that. But kind of makes me want to do Arbitration more. I had no... I just didn't realize it had exclusive arcanes there. But yeah, um... If anyone needs Cryo... There's an excavation arbitration at the moment. Otherwise, I'm down to pop some relics. Got anything important going here? Nah. Relic any relic popping anyone? Hmm. Not sure if I want those there. Those might be moved. As long as it's not Axie. Alright, alright. Barricade's down for relics. Okay, okay. Nora's got the goods for one lucky dreamer. Who's it gonna be? Okay, Vomer Foss and Cambion, rare servo fish. Like that one will be super easy. Survive over 30 minutes in Kuva survival. Doable but annoying. And we're out. Alright. Frank. Uh remind me, you do not have Steel Path, correct? Updating the game, I haven't played in a bit. Yeah, yeah, I get it. University will take a lot. A lot of your time. Hey, nice. Dunno, very nice. Yeah, I, I serious, it's... I seriously forgot, like, I have been trying to roll that tonk or and land on what I want it to be so then I can figure out what I want my ultimate element to be. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, because if I get toxin and then a harmless negative along with crit chance crit damage on that i don't need to have it be a toxin encore we can add another element in there we can go like i don't know something weird like viral magnetic and then blast because of the radial attack or maybe we'll go viral radiation i don't know i'll have to think about it what i want to do if that's that's why i'm on the ribbon first honestly Alright, Frank's updating. Barricade is getting online. Also need to maybe look at alternative builds for Rhino 2 because... Well, yeah, because he's still going to need one more Forma if I want to actually max out mods. And I don't want to commit to another Forma Unless I have an idea what I want my other builds to look like, so I know what it should be and where it should be. Ah, uh, Endo, you are a heartless bitch. So many mods, not quite maxed out. 
Oh yeah, uh, Frank, the last update was pretty big. That's for sure. It's not too bad. It just depends on your connection, your speed, all that. Welcome back, Bear Kitty. How's the optimization going? All right, if we're doing relic popping, let's do this. Let's actually get a little more focus for it. Maybe hit that million, get my next cosmetic thing. I like it. I like it. Oh yeah, we all need so much more endo than we have. That is a common thing, Trumps. Very common. Here's Bear Kitty. Uh, so Frank is still downloading the update. Your connection's... Cr shit, oh crap. Frank might take a while, so we have one more spot. We might have a couple so we can get going while Frank's downloading the update. But anyone else want to pop relics? Open to regular steel path, void storms. Nothing if not flexible, figuratively anyway. Hey, Chief Sven. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Uh, your in-game name is clown underscore rejects, right? Ah, that should be you, yes. 27%. Yes, Chiefs fan, this is you. Hey, neutral. We were on yesterday, but we started super late because uh, we had a Comcast tech out. Starting late again today because more internet issues, but I am online. And that's what counts, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. It was... I don't know. I was getting ready to go live, and then all of a sudden there were massive latency spikes, like worse than when I called to have the tech come out. And I think, I hope I figured it out. Wait, you're already in a clan. Okay, you didn't, either you didn't leave the clan or you got back in when there was a delay because I forgot to put in the resources to build the upgrade, so... Uh, I can't shoot the invite. <laughs> yeah, Trump, so far it seems good. It's most, mostly it's been huge latency ping spikes. So. All right. Anyone else down for popping relics? It's really weird, but there's a small part of my brain that looks at that 197 Thermia fracture sealed and wants to get it to 200. Just exactly 200. It's like, that looks so weird. You can fix that. You know you can fix that, right? Let's see, Trump's working, Flutie's working. Hey, Nixus. Um, like, I, like I was saying, I am... Flexible, depending on who's in the squad, we can do regular Void Storms or Steel Path. Um, the things I'm looking for in Relics are all really vaulted at this point, so it'd be down if either we want to... If we all want to run some Prime Resurgence, we can talk about that, or if there's something someone else is looking for and I happen to have the Relics, I'm down for trying to help, but mostly it's just Prime Junk, Barrow's coming. Doesn't hurt to have stuff for Barrow.
You know your protovirus challenges? All right, Dino. Good luck on them. In the farm for Ivara Prime. Uh, I have a decent amount of Prime junk, but I've been visiting Barrow regularly and trying to pick up at minimum the primed mods that I'm missing, unless they're really shit, like, you know, a primed one for puncture or impact damage, you know? Um, yeah, I've been trying to pick up all the primed mods I've been missing, trying to pick up the weapons generally for MR. Now it's less of a priority because I hit my goal. I don't care that much if I hit Legend Rank 1. Um, and then any any cosmetics that really stick out to me. What mastery rank am I? I don't know. What mastery rank am I? Oh, you've been sitting at MR18 for years. Hey, MR18, you're still in, like, what, the top 7% of people who play the game on the Steam community, I think? I think it's around that number. Yeah, most of the junk I have is bronze and worth like nothing for ducats. I've got a few silver, and then I've got some other stuff that's actually like full sets that I either want to sell on Warframe.market or save for giveaways, something like that, you know? So. Oh, I know neutral, but there's. The only big thing for hitting Legend Rank 1 or Legend Rank 2 is getting a Legendary Core, and that's just not a huge draw to me, I guess. Like, the biggest the biggest draw was all the bonuses that you could get at MR30. I got those. Now it's like, ooh, Legendary Core. Yeah, MR16 gets you, unlocks access to everything in Warframe for some real legacy stuff on certain platforms that didn't get updated. I heard MR18 is needed, but generally you're probably not going to counter encounter that legacy stuff. I think it's just some really old Rivens that didn't get updated. Um, other than that, yeah, M MR30, like you get a lot of loadout slots, you get a lot of Riven slots, you can do blessings, and then you can also... Like, you have all your capacity from the beginning when you get a new weapon or Warframe, or if you form of them. That's super nice. So there were a number of nice advantages for MR30 that appealed, but beyond that, I don't feel the need to grind anymore. Hey, Inked, how you doing? Dang, Flutie, 12 days. Yeah, my, my goal was also MR30 by my B-Day, and we got it last... Tuesday, so like five days before. Oh, you bought you bought all the slots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Do we not have that? We don't have one mother, one other person who wants to hop in. Y'all are really giving Frank time to get in. Bear Kitty, we could just go with some randoms in the meantime until Frank loads in. Sure, Nixus. All right. That's not what I'm looking for. That. There we go. Commands. That's how we do it. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I turned that off. I. Hold on. Crap. Hold on. Crap. Hold on. All right, let me fix this. I think I need to change. Firebot didn't. All right, what is that? We need to change that command. All right. Let's make that exclamation mark. Squad, there we go. 
And let's enable that. Okay. Now let's try that. There we go. Shoot me a whisper. We'll get you in. That's what I was looking for. All right, Nixus, if you are if you are hopping in, uh, I don't believe Franks, who we've been letting uh, update the game and spoke up earlier about hopping in. I don't think Franks has access to Steel Path. Um, I know we can technically taxi to Steel Path Void Fissures, but that really depends on if Frank's going to be comfortable with that or not. Oh, yeah. Hey, Inked, uh, pop in some relics, and then when Lady the Laddie gets on, we're going to be playing with her, and uh, I don't know. Honestly, it's whatever people want to see at that point. It's just, you know, talk some bullshit, hang out, all that. You fine without Steel Path? All right. Yeah, uh, shoot me that whisper if you saw that command, so I... Because I don't have you, I'm sure, we haven't played together, so I'm sure I don't have you on my friends list, so I need to send you an invite somehow. I don't know your in-game name. Yep, sounds good. Yeah, didn't actually mean to use that Cuba just yet. I literally forgot I had set that up yesterday, honestly. That one's new, we're still going to be... There we go. Ah, same name. Nice. Invite. Also add you as a friend, so that way, if I'm playing on friends only, if somehow you get disconnected, you can join the session. Hey, Black Raven. Yeah, if you've got the time and you enjoy the game, definitely. It is a nice way to spend some time and meet some people. Frank's good with anything. Let's see if Frank's online yet. We'll go friends only. Not yet. Still loading up, it looks like. Okay. No worries, Frank. You maxed out your orbiter capacity? Oof. Wait, what is this stupid thing on the vessel here? Like, I just want to get this stupid vessel finished off, and I have no idea what that is. It changed. It was different than the last one that was there. And it, I, I don't know if it's supposed to rotate like that. Like, it's like, hey, you made no progress on this. Here's a new one. Like... I have not Spellheim. It's been one of those. I didn't realize what it was going to be when I started it. So once I figured it out, I'm like, okay, this will just happen as we're doing other things. I'm not in a rush. The wiki will. The wiki will answer it. But that also feels like cheating. But then if I ask chat, that's also cheating. <laughs> So, I don't know. I'll probably just end up going with a wiki and being like, let's just be done with it. We'll probably get to that point. And then, on the bright side, these Vosfin glyphs that you get from the uh, Focus School cosmetic shops, they work really well with my decor. And that's cool. You're on? All right. You are on. Okay. Thank you. 
try to do something with it. All right, let's see what we've got. So Frank doesn't have Steel Path. Let's see, if, we, if anyone still has the uh, Night Wave daily to have an excavator finish without getting interrupted, there's a Lith Excavation. Few mobile defenses, disruption. Not a big fan of disruption. If we want an endless, there's defense and excavation that are both lith. You still need it? All right, do we want to start with excavation? Then if we get bored, we can uh, extract. I know, inked. Yeah, I have. I, I, I got the the key for um, the suite there. For some reason, I spent faction standing on that, and I haven't vis visited it since I got that key. So you know, definitely a good use of faction standing. All right. Also, it lets me safely level up this Rhino that I just formed again. Yeah, anything uh, anyone in the squad is trying to work on. I know, I think Bear Kitty's got at least uh, one copy of every primed thing. And the things that I'm missing are, they've been vaulted for a while, so I'm not expecting anyone to have or want to pop those. You're on speed, Nova? Meh, we kill them faster then. Whatever. Leveling up core prime. That's a plan. All right, let's, let's let Frank load in. I think Frank's got a bad connection, so let's make sure Frank loads before we get started. Go to the dig site. There are void fissures in the area. Use these to crack open a relic. A fissure. Defend yourself and use reactant to open relics. Make sure we don't lose Frank. Oh, hey, there's Frank. Cool, cool, cool. They're dropping We're good. Reactant. We Is are golden. Forget the reactant. You need more to open that relic. Excavator is ready to go. Keep it powered and protected from enemy fire. On it. Ah, Citrine. I love it. If I wasn't leveling Rhino, I'd probably be on Citrine for this. Oh, it is, but it's been a very popular song decades before CSI Miami. It, it definitely is the theme song, but it was popular long before that. Yeah, not ideal for excavation, but I mean, whatever. Excavator deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. Oh no, we get to put my new ribbon to the test. Oh no. Oh, bees over that way. Excavation complete. Look what we found. Oh, look at that. Night wave. Ah, 
Ajá. Yeah, depending on how long it's been for you, Black Raven, it's gonna... I mean, there'll, there'll be a little bit to relearn, but... Depending on how much you played before, it's probably gonna be just like riding a bike. Probably be another hour or two before we hear from the lady. That's right. Die, die, you bastards. Extraction is available if you choose. See, there's a power source. Forma it is. Hey, Bao, how you doing? Oh, I didn't mean to set off iron skin there, but whatever. I bumped it. Excavator is ready to go. Keep it powered and protect it from enemy fire. An artifact has been located. Proceed to the dig site. Hey, Savage, how you doing? Happy Wednesday. Reactant, come to me. There we go. Boom. Hey. Danya King, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. How you doing? I wouldn't exactly call it hard work. We definitely were doing things. But hard is not the word I would have necessarily used. What do you mean, Nell no Prime Law? You don't have Nell no Prime and you want it, or what? Excavator is ready to go. Keep it powered and protect it from enemy fire. Yeah. 
speed Nova is kind of funny here, no lie. Dig complete. Your hard work has just been rewarded. All right, we'll take that. Yes, new frame. She's pretty good. I've been enjoying her. Go the kids to school, eating breakfast, snowing. And you got to teach the wife how to drive. Is she not familiar with driving in the snow? Yeah, it is snowing here too. We're supposed to be, I should probably warn everyone. So we, uh, National Weather Service actually issued a warning about the ice storm that is in my area that started an hour or so ago. Um, so if I lose connection, there is a possibility I could lose connection if the ice collects on lines, uh, certain boxes, that kind of thing. Like it could damage it and just drop my connection. So if I just cut out that's probably why. Excavator deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. Look what we just uncovered. Yes, the overlay is a lecker frame. That is correct. We need another power cell for the excavator. The scanner has picked up a target. Go to the dig site. <laughs> it's just a different type of mission, Sean. You'll you'll figure them out. They're they're not that bad in terms of the mechanics. Oh yeah, a Leka frame is incredible. Aside from helping when you're just picking stuff there, if it is great for inventory management. Uh, when Barrow comes, I I literally pull it up and go through all my spare prime parts, and it I can compare the ducat value to the platinum value and figure out if I want to trade something in or not. Because if it's more valuable to me selling it, you know. So it's it's incredibly useful. It helps you track if you're trying to hit, you know, if you're trying to uh, grind mastery rank. Helps you figure out what you're missing, what you can focus on. Highly recommended. Mm -hmm. They are both going to barrow whatever i pick so hey anything uh, anyone in the squad is working on that you want me to try to get like are you going for that phantasmus part there because I have some of those I could be investing in. Try to get you what you need. Bratton was also... Ready to go. Keep 
keep it powered and they were the same amount of dockets weren't they bister <laughs> Hard work has just been rewarded. Wait, really? How much was the Bratton then? Proceed to the dig site. Titanium Prime. Excavator deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. Excavator destroyed. Protect the remaining Wait, what? dig sites. Which one was destroyed? Got another one going, huh? I mean, they were both silver. They shouldn't... Like, what did you think the Bratton was? Blueprint was 25? Are you kidding me? Did I get a 25 ducat item? Fucking hell, I hate how there's no consistency. Did I really just waste that pick on a 25 ducat item? Excavation complete. Look what we found. Well, that sucks. Titania it is. You don't expect them to be that different, though. They're silver. It's like, I just expect it's going to be the same, because why wouldn't it? Like, literally, why wouldn't it? Exactly what you needed? Nice. Like, literally, the question I ask there is not, how did I miss that? It's, why should I have to look for that? I mean, that is one of the things that... Um, a lack of frame is going to be great for. But the question is, why should I even have to look for that? They were both silver. Why do they have different ducat values? Hundred seventy K hundred seventy five K iron skin noise. And whose fault is that? Like, why? That's all, uh, that still supports my issue of inconsistency, right? Like, if it's silver on one, why isn't it silver everywhere it appears? And why should I have to just know that? Like, if you don't have a Lecker frame, you don't know you're handicapping yourself by picking that one. And then if you do have a Lecker frame, you have to just know, oh, there are some that appear in multiple different rarities so they don't actually give you the same number of ducats like it's just dumb like it is just absolutely dumb like i feel like as a player i'm being punished for a really weird design choice you know excavator deployed protect the unit while it extracts the artifact the scanner has picked up a target. Go to the dig site. Look what we just uncovered. Again? 
if I was one of the many players who didn't use a Leka frame, it's not being punished for not being observant. It's being punished for a really weird design choice. Because you would not know the ducat value without a Leka frame, though. What tooltips? There are tooltips when you're in the few seconds you have to make your selection. You really think people are cycling through tooltips when they're making those selections? If the information is hidden and you've got a timer, the information doesn't exist. to see statistics on how many people act like they i'm sure they they can track who actually looks through tool tip tips in those areas i'd love to see statistics on how many people actually use them because i don't think many do what yeah i don't i don't i don't see it i don't see tool tips I vaguely remember reading that in the, uh, patch notes, Fister. And I also vaguely remember stating that I disagreed with that choice, but, you know. Excavator is ready to go. Keep it powered and protect it from enemy fire. An artifact has been located. Proceed to the dig site. Yeah, but why are, why are they doing that, though? I think it just doesn't make sense. Oh, thanks. Like, if it was gold, why is its value getting dropped? Why Why are we not just being consistent? I don't know. I just vehemently disagree with it. They have inherently... At, at its base, they have assigned ducat values to different rarities. So then making a bunch of exceptions and expecting players to either just know it or keep track of it because, you know, that one, that one or three off exception might pop up. Like, it's just... it's annoying. Doesn't make this it doesn't make the experience enjoyable. Like I'm I'm sitting here arguing with you all over it because it's annoying as fuck. It doesn't make it enjoyable for me. Yeah, the fact is we shouldn't have to look out for that though. They should just be consistent. I mean, if, if something has less demand, then rework it all the way. Don't just say, all right, from here on out, it's going to drop a level. Like, just rework it all the way. Like, I definitely understand overestimating what rarity something should be. Like, you know, suddenly, like, put it a rare and people are like, this is a crap weapon. Why am I going to spend all this time farming for it? But... Could be bow, it could be. No, 
don't know. Regardless, there's not an argument you can put in front of me that's going to make me hate it less. As a player, I feel it's not something I should have to track. When you train me that certain rarities have certain values, I shouldn't have to be on the lookout for exceptions. That's my main complaint. The game has trained me to think one way, and now there are just a handful of exceptions that I have to now just be vigilant for, you know? That's what pisses me off. It's not really... I feel like it's not really the frames. And I could be wrong, because I don't know all the exceptions, but I feel like it's not really the frames that have the multiple rarity levels. I feel like it's usually weapons, right? I feel like it's usually weapon parts. Oh, I know it's been that way since before I started playing. I doesn't mean I can't still say it. I disagree with it, and it, I don't think it should be that way. Believe me, I know it's been around. Excavator has run out of power. Find a cell. Hey, Savvy. Uh, just the stupidity of having to keep track of exceptions to duck at value on different prime parts. to go. Keep it powered and protect it from enemy fire. The scanner has picked up a target. Go to the dig site. Cyber, please stop saying that. Clearly, you're coming in late to the conversation and not paying attention because since you've been here, you've seen a Lekka frame up on the screen. So saying that is not helpful. I'm saying you should not have to because especially for more casual players, like, they're probably not going to be using a program like that. Excavator deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. I understand what you're saying there, and I, obviously because I have the overlay, I can't verify it. I'm sure that's true, but again, that's not the point. That is literally not the point I'm making. My entire argument is we shouldn't fucking have to. Like, literally, it trains you one way. And then says, by the way, there are all these exceptions, which we just saw right there. We had one that was 25. We had one that was 25. Excavator 
Excavator destroyed. Protect the remaining. Yeah, sites. Cyber Soul. Apparently, if you hover over each item at the bottom, the, the tooltip will tell you what the ducat value is. So that part's already in game, but obviously, Electro Frame has a lot more uses than that. got nullified. My iron skin is gone. Whoops. Alright, I'm just gonna change the subject because I'm talking just basic game design here and getting arguments like it's been there, so what? So, I'm just done with the conversation. I do not have the mental capacity to bash my head against a wall for the rest of the stream. So, anyone have anything cool for the current meal in their time zone? That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll ordered inside. Sonic. Nice. All right, all right. Hey, Nurtured, how you doing? Hello, hello. All right, let's get some shoutouts here. I am excited for Hildren Prime. The one Hildren I actually built, I put in the, the helmet. So I want to I want to actually play with Hildren. She looks like a solid frame. All right, so we gotta start working on those shoutouts. If you are not already following Nurtured, definitely drop those follows. Hello, Warframe content creator, awesome person, great community, and if you like Eidolons, guess what? He's a freaking pro at him. Raise. Uh, Crazy enough, he can do a 6x3 and tell you what he's doing as he's doing it. Yeah, I, I'm lucky if I can do a 5x3 with a squad. He can solo a 6x3. And while I'm doing it, uh, I struggle to tell you what I'm doing as I'm doing. So, you know, dude's cracked. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Wait, wait, wait. There's a there's a free Facebook slots game you can play tokens for with Konami that gives you free food for Sonic? Really? Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Fire fiery. Rude. Rude. Yeah, but again, it promotes gambling, so not not ideal, Bao. Yeah, I definitely get that. Definitely get that. Interesting. They used to have a partnership with Starbucks and you abuse the system. Nice. Look what we just uncovered. Alright. What do we get? What do we get? What do 
Another Titania part. Okay. Won't say no to that. Especially, especially since the alternative is 25 ducats. Three feet of snow. Dang, Darkfire. We are... We're in the midst of an ice storm right now. All right, catching up on shoutouts. If you aren't already following Katie, you should. She does the Warframe, she does the variety. Very cool, very chill. Definitely enjoy hanging out in her chat. So go click those follows. Oh yeah, we had our ice and snow started coming uh, about two and a half hours ago. So if I lose connection, it was, we were told it's an ice storm, like honestly, bunch of schools canceled last night before anything had come down. Um, our public school system canceled and they are one of the last to cancel because they always want to make sure that uh, their students have a hot meal because sometimes they are the only hot meal that uh, some of their students get and they canceled so it's gonna be bad having to clear ice from the windshield assumes that I go anywhere fiery how dare you assume that Stop assuming about me, jeez. Oh, what were you doing wrong, Zephyr? Protect the unit while it extracts that the fiery that thought. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. Excavator destroyed. Protect the oh. remaining dig sites. How am I the only one who got it? What? I'm confused. Do we need to extract? What? What's happening here? I'm so confused. I'm... I don't... I'm confused. You want to extract? Oh, okay. Yeah, it looks like time to extract. All right. Admittedly, I'm not on the ideal frame for excavation, so, you know, it's not like I'm helping protect them in any additional way that would be actually useful. I'm just powering and killing stuff, so. Not on a Zephyr, not on a Frost, Gara. Nidus, any other good frame to help with the defending. So, to the extraction chambers. Need another power cell for the excavator. Boom. Yeah, it's all good. At least we can't fail it. Like there's not actually a fail condition for it, so hey. Okie dokie, I got some food, so camera's going off for a bit. Yeah. We still got some good stuff. Okay, it's not like you've brought me any food when you've had it, Fiery. Ah, you're right now? Yeah, thanks for hopping in. It was fun, too. Hopefully, uh, that cryotic helped. I think you said you needed some, so... 
And you did get that titania part you needed, so that's cool. Nice, Frank. Yeah, my rhino's almost back up there, too. All right, catch you later. All right, anything good? Disruption, interception. Nope, I said good. What's wrong with that Tonkor skin? What is wrong with that skin? Hey, Eggmoji. Tenant Diplos users in the house. I have not farmed that yet. How good are they? Is that the skin you want, Fiery? That's the one you want to see? Diplos for profit taker. Hey, Shamel. Yeah, sounds good, pal. Have a good one. We'll catch you later. Oh, you have a tenant Diplos ribbon, really? Nice. I literally uh, have not even farmed them yet. What platform you on, Eggmoji? That'd also help us narrow it down if there is someone who's interested. You're on PC. All right, that's where most of the player base is. So we do have a variety of consoles in the chat as well, but anyone on PC really enjoy Tenet Diplos and looking for a ribbon? Of course you do, Shamel. All right. We have another slot that freed up. If anyone wants to pop in, do some relic popping. Again, uh, Franks does not have access to steel paths, so it would be either regular or void storms, but we still have plenty of options. Shamel, you want in? All right. All right. Squad, you all have a preference? Do you want to do void storms, regular void fissures? What are you feeling? You do vampire? Nice. I do enjoy steel path. I definitely do a bit with it here, but also like to include people who haven't gotten that far yet. So sometimes we take, you know, we uh, do the regular stuff. Let's see, Black Raven says, I have a question. Can we farm the new frame? At the moment, uh, we did a ton of that last week when she dropped. I'm sure we'll be doing more because I know I don't have all of the arcanes. 
and I haven't gotten a second one for to throw in the helmet, so we'll definitely be doing that more. Um, depending on what we want to do later, when Lady the Laddie comes in, we might be open to to doing that because uh, I know we're both pretty pretty fluid in terms of just seeing you know what chat wants to hop in for, what chat wants to see. So at the moment, I'm just uh, we're trying to pop some relics because Barrow will be here this week. And people can always use some prime junk. I didn't realize there was a, a Mars disruption. Hmm. That'd be another one we could go until, uh, you know, we just get bored. Or we're, for some reason we're not doing well. So if we want to try that, maybe. I'm honestly trying to like Disruption more. I'm not a big fan of Disruption, but I know a lot of people are. I am trying to like it more. Uh, Franks, the new node is Mars. It's Tiana Pass right here, just off of Augustus. Hmm. Well, they're doing that. Screw it. I feel like Glaive Prime. Still new? How are you still new when you've got Steel Path? I don't think you can call yourself new if you have Steel Path unlocked. You just haven't farmed as much. It's probably a little more accurate. Steel Path is generally not something new players have. Ah, Darkfire decided you like having abilities, huh? Welcome to the club. Hi, kid. Inaros is fine, but a lot of people obviously uh, prefer other frames for reasons. Put the key in, and you can pull the shinies out. Trick is, you got to wait to open. Something happens to the conjure before you can pull the goods. You don't get oh, I knew this one was here. It's been used for the Archon Hunt. Just forgot it existed. I should have swapped this over to the Grenier faction for Encore. This isn't your regular old job. Allied V sold the conduits with interference routines specifically designed mm, Jester. Don't you worry, though. Zephyr. Ah, uh, Zephyr. Are carried by high rank Dropping the white one in. Mucks. Knock them down. See what they've got. A fissure. Defend yourself and use reactant to open relics. Use that reactant to open a relic. Demo unit incoming. Don't let them near the conduit. Keep fighting. Look for more passwords. <laughs> Sounds like you're doing okay, passwords. Hello, hello. All right, be careful about Zoom too many of these too quick. Make sure everyone has their reactant. Wow, well, we're already on our third one, so. 
Notice Shamel's only got two reactants, so watch that before we do the next one. Let's make sure we're not going too fast and people don't get to unlock their goodies. Alright, so there should be 10 around. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. With an incoming routine. How's that feel? Oh, put it in? Okay. Yep, Frank just needs one more, so we're looking pretty good. There we go. Nice. Before the system resets, we can take them again. Game? Fiery, what's that? Nice, Shelth is in. Okay. Not gonna say no to that. Forget what I was using. Was it this one? It was this one, I think. Eyes open, sunshine. Here we go. Demo unit coming in fast. That thing bows, and you can kiss a conduit goodbye. Oh, yeah, I was trying to uh, figure out what that one meant in my head, too, honestly. I was like, I kind of want to respond. I'm sure I agree with it. I don't know what the intended word was, though. Carl, yeah, the call missions are solo. Beeping, that's the problem. There he is. Pizza's in the oven? Alright, Spellheim. Catch you later. Thanks for hanging out. What kind of pizza, by the way? Oh, seriously, Beavis? Alright, now that's completed. Awesome. I appreciate it. Yeah, we'll we'll check that out. All right, all right. He is coming from this way. I think. 
Oh, I'm crazy. He's not coming from that way. I was wrong. I swear, directionally, that's where I heard it coming from, though, so... I see 45 ducats. Hey, thanks for the lurk, Nick. I appreciate you. I have the cyan key, but, uh, Feels early to pop it in when we've already done like two of them. Conduit down. Wait, wait, wait. Why did we start so many and not defend them? I'm so confused. What the hell? Hey, Blaze. Yeah. Is today to the day? I thought uh, it was still... It was like the 28th they were doing the work. Shalthazan. I'm back this way. The relic has been cracked open. He's up there. To find out what's inside. Go. Alright, I've got the cyan key. Or oh, someone already put it in. Hold on. Someone put it in, but they're not around it. Okay, let's let's not drop keys in if you're not gonna defend. That is a weird choice to me. had issues last night. Oh, crap. That sucks. Must have been after I went to bed. Was it during the hunt? Hope it wasn't during the hunt. Ah, oh, Nick, I appreciate the support. Thank you. It was during the hunt. Oh, I'm sorry. Right. They're back. And they're yeah, I appreciate the support. Definitely, my friend. More of the old ultra violence. Keep your back to the objective all night. Lock it down till she pops. Oh, we're getting lower drops at least. I got the cyan one. Died for two hours? Oh. So did you stop and restart the stream or did you just call it a night? That is that's awful. I'm sorry. One of the things I forgot to ask the tech about, because I was asking if they were ever going to install fiber, and basically the answer was no, they can 
they can get those speeds with the current infrastructure by just upgrading rather than installing all new. But I forgot to ask him about the difference in download and upload speeds because with fiber, I've only ever seen it where your upload speeds match your download speeds. And that is not the case with cable. My upload speeds are always a fucking fraction of my download speeds. Take a look inside. Oh, uh, where's the blue one? It's over there. Okay. That's what you've seen too. So that concerns me if they have no plans to swap over. That just means I'm always going to have trash upload in this neighborhood. Which sucks. The fact that they don't even advertise their upload speeds with any of their packages on the Comcast website tells me as a company they don't value that as a service at all. Got it. Alright, I got the blue one. I'm gonna drop that in. Minefield, that should be fun. You got Fios. I would love to have that as an option, but my only options are Comcast and AT&T. And AT&T isn't really an option because they just charge more for slower service in my area. Did I go through a nullifier? My iron skin is just completely getting removed constantly. I don't remember going through a nullifier, but I think I went through a nullifier apparently. Oh, the Demolists have a nullifier. Okay. You can tell I don't do this mode much, so... Thank you for clarifying. Appreciate it. Ah, there's the field. I see the nullifier field. Yay! The game and I have reached an understanding. One more concept unlocked. The relic has been cracked open. All right, Bear Kitty's missing a couple, but other than that, we're pretty good. Iron skin is being removed because you're using a good moisturizer, obviously. Nice. 
So chat, I was thinking now that we've got uh, Ion Life on the docket there, for Friday do we want to do short, see what Barrow's got, get get that, uh, pick some stuff up there and then switch over to High on Life, make it the variety day? Arrow it is. Fake MR30 shaking my head, not my streamer. Nice, fams. I would know it if I actually enjoyed this mode. I haven't I played I haven't played it a bunch because it hasn't really spoken to me, but I'm trying I'm trying to like it. That's why we're doing it. I am trying to like it. Huh. Yeah, it looks like a lot of fun. So I'm looking forward to playing it. It looks like a ton of fun. And I definitely feel like I could use a laugh. Safety's off. We kicked a clown car. Here we go. Ah, shelf's in. 1700, 1,702 out of 1,700 traces. Ah, yes. Thank you, game. Bam. Killed him dead. There's a pole. There we go. Only 60. There it is. Under 59k. I've had bigger, but I didn't really do the charge that much there. So that's not surprising. Why do I have so much shield on Rhino? That is the augment for his one uh, combined with parasitic armor and then doing iron skin or I'm potentially taking damage during its invulnerability period. It, it'll charge up just like uh, warding Halo on Nezha, but it also compounds off the armor that you have going into it. So if you can charge up with the augment on the one, you can boost it with parasitic armor, and then when you cast it, take some damage too, you can get it really high. Nope, nope, no, 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 not the nullifier field. Fuck. Don't take it out, don't take it out, don't take it out. You didn't take it out. Yay! Nice. As if you're not seeing the poll, you may have to refresh the stream, but there's definitely a poll there. 100% there's a f pull. So far people are like, yeah, we don't need to see Barrow. We can figure out Barrow on our own. The longer we stick around, the more likely we'll get our asses handed to us. Still, with great stupidity comes great reward. What do you reckon? Pull might have been too short. We only got four responses. <laughs> Hmm. Okay.
Now it shows up, but it's ended. Sag. Wakey, wakey. Here we go. Good kill. Uh -huh. Can't do anything about that last interference routine. You'll just have to wear it. Maybe I can catch the next one. Round two. There we go. Yes, only four people saw it before. Now, more responses, more time. Tic tac toe. Tic tac toe. You put that in as an option, sir. Got him. I'm dropping the red one in. The relic has been cracked open. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. Over where the red one was, uh, there might be a couple more reacting for you, Bear Kitty, if you haven't been over there recently. I thought I heard you over here. You want to change your vote to tic-tac-toe. <laughs> Refreshed. Vote finally counted. Nice. Worm Prime Cerebrum. Frank, you probably want the Worm Prime Cerebrum. It's vaulted and it's worth the most. There we go. Why not? Uh, Zephyr really wants that mukbang stream, don't you? Right. They're back. And they're well pissed off. Right. They're having a go. Keep the demos away from that conduit. Eh, Dark Chester. Oh yeah, we're not gonna like stop streaming Warframe or anything, but variety is the spice of life. And you know what? It looks like a fun game and I could use a laugh. have the cyan key. Might as well go pop that puppy in. Just something about the jawline action, Kadoma. Nice.
Nice. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. I've seen uh, some people I follow playing Atomic Heart. What's that one about? I hadn't heard a thing about it before I saw them streaming it. And I haven't really been able to watch them stream it because they often stream when I'm streaming. So, what, what's this Atomic Heart? Is it kind of like Resident Evil style, like shooter horror? I'm guessing. Yeah, you're coming from over here. He stripped my iron skin. Damn it! All right. Shoot me. Well, that's not quite as soon as I wanted you to shoot me, so that doesn't help. Getting a little hot. Gloves are coming off. Got another round in ya. Let's see. Ships have been planning to people, a lot of them to control robots with thought. Oh wow. Fallout crossover with Bioshock, okay. Oh, Bow Prime. Hey. Bioshock esque. Okay. Wakey, wakey. Here we go. All right, I've got the red key. Next first, same as a first. Mind you, don't get flanked. Oh, we're doing two. Not coming from that way. Nice. Nice noise. Seventy bucks. Oh, damn. I mean, games games have been at 60 bucks on release for, god, at least a couple decades now. So I guess I'm not surprised to see them finally increase, but still. At a time when everything else has increased and some things just because they can get away with it, it feels like a kick in the nuts. I definitely get that. Definitely get that. Not saying that it, they're not due... It just sucks when not everyone everything else is. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. Okay, that was weird. 
My light just flashed on and off for a second. Go buy a new game for 20 bucks on your PS2? Yeah. Uh. Nice. All right. Baruch Prime stuff. I think he's got something on Lith Relics. I have. I'd have to double check. I do not remember. Safety's off. We get to Clown Con. Here we go. You're about due for more of those boxes. Interference routines. Demo units too. All right. I missed, I missed it. It flashed for a second there. What What was the winner on that one? Was it Warframe and... And then High on Life? Warframe variety, yeah. Alright, alright. That's more what I expected. I was like, people really don't want to see Barrow. Okay, okay. I mean, I can just do it on my own, whatever. Hey, introverted vet. Welcome. How you doing? Got nullified there. And let's see. Okay, where's that's it? Ten point eight K iron skin. Yeah, I did that in the wrong order. Damn. I got all turned around in my head. That's what happens when you change the order abilities are in. The relic has been cracked open. Finish your mission. Hidden lore on Gara. Uh. Carter with the sub. Welcome, welcome, my friend. Thank you for the support. Did any Tell me, did you all hear the, the notification? Because I did not, which is annoying. I didn't think I'd have to double check that before this, but I apparently didn't need to. Boop, boop. Thank you for the support. I appreciate it. All right. You didn't either. Okay. That's a problem. That's, that's cool. That's super cool. All right. Uh, let me see. Let's test something. Let's test something. Alerts. Test follow. Didn't do anything. Really? Okay. Uh, Streamlabs is broken. Streamlabs is broken. That's awesome. Yeah, that should be weird. Okay. No, I something's wrong with Streamlabs. I've never had this before. I just did tests and it didn't do literally didn't do anything. 
It's like, yeah, no, you didn't press any buttons. Um, well, crap. I'm sorry there wasn't an alert for that, Carter. There should have been. Um, but I guess I'll have to see after we extract. I'll see if there's anything I can do, because that's weird. Uh, would you like me to wear one of the hats, a wig, anything to uh, thank you for your support? That is really weird. Streamlabs just randomly decided not to actually work today. I feel like it's just, they called in sick. It's like, bitch, mental health day. Don't bother me. Which I respect, but still, you know, you're a bot, so fuck you. I mean, we respect the mental health days here, but, you know, with organic beings. That's it. You open Labs your and elements have been having problems. Yeah. Well then. You're coming from here. Mental health year, don't we all? Feels like after 2020, everyone is like entitled to a mental health year. Yeah. Which hat? You want the fedora or the tiny cowboy hat? I'm back home, so I have more options now. Wait, what was going? The defense was failed? What? Energy drain, okay. I didn't realize we had another one going, shit. Kyle. You and Zephyr seem to be the only ones who- Okay, you, Zephyr, and Bard seem to be the only ones who want that. Where's this guy? Nope, failed that one too. Ooh. Are we still going or are we extracting? It's clearly we didn't do well there. Hey, 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 Turtle, how you doing? The only way to confirm I'm not an advanced AI robot is to see me actually eat. Really, is that... Is that your plan, huh? Oh, they're going no relic. We're extracting. All right, sounds good. That works. Yeah, it feels like when you uh, start failing more than one conduit, you probably didn't come in with a great setup and it's time to call it. We got as much as we're Which, again, we are a vapor trail. I was leveling Rhino, so he's not the ideal frame for this. That's true. I did... Yes, sh she delivered a cookie, and then I looked, and there was a freaking bite taken out of it already. Like, what? Who does that? Okay, wives. But who's, who besides wives do that? That's only one thing. Oh, it actually explains why there's a barrier around the planes. Bear Kitty, you hopping out? Alright. Not just explain it's there because devs wanted it like this. 
You haven't even used your primary. You were always holding a spare key. Nice. Alrighty, Buse. Sounds good. You're going to go to sleep? Yeah, definitely understand. Big time difference there. So, hey, thanks for popping in, Frank. It was nice to see you again. Have a good one. Hopefully, university uh, takes a little easier on you. Hope to see you again soon. It just lands on me. Thank you, Frank. Have a good one. You don't want, like, an unrolled ribbon or anything in return? Oh, crap. I gotta see how to remove that. Uh, I don't know if that's Nixus or Inixus was... Uh, they actually already hopped in and played. So I gotta figure out how to remove that. about a shoddy shoddy for shoddy right I have some rifle that's the one I have the least of pistol oh you want pistol yeah that sure yeah rifles I have the least of pistols yeah we can do pistol Mr. Matt. <laughs> All right. Got a... Thank you, thank you. Much appreciated. We'll have some fun with the Trumna. That was that one will be getting some form right now. Uh, you have all shotgun ribbons? Gotcha. All right. Let me see. So that one, that Q thing, play with viewers... I decided instead of just, you know, trying to remake the wheel, there had to be something out there. And turns out, yeah, there's an easy Twitch extension, so I just have to learn the commands for it. So one second. Let me go see what I need to do to remove them. All right, let's see if that does. Nope, that's not what we wanted. This and boom. All right, I need commands. Where are my commands? Here they are. Position Q, hide Q. Ah, I got you. Okay. All right. I think I got this. There we go. Ha ha. We got it. Uh, no, Bister, that was actually a, a new viewer who hopped in with us earlier. There we go. It's just a matter of learning the commands. Yeah, it's uh, exclamation mark join if you want to hop in. 
That's how it works. Exclamation mark join. And then if you decide you you know where your position is, you can't wait for your turn. Uh, it's exclamation exclamation mark leave to get out if you can't get if you uh, won't be able to stick around for your turn. But obviously, as you can see, I can remove someone from it. So, you know, worst case scenario. This is not the one I wanted to go into. We are not researching anything. Okay. Oh, no, we are. Wisp Gray. Oh, Dargan Pilots. Right, 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 right. He did say that. Ah, Mr. Math testing it out. See? It works. It works. Yay! Wow. I was like, why am I rewriting this all from scratch? There has to be something. Some Korra lore, really? Korra lore, huh? That all trumps eating, right, Shalthazan? Okay, that's... Thank you for that posture check. Two-toned, by the way. All right, let's... So now we've got a, a little break here while we're getting ready to do our next thing. Let me... Make sure Lady... Ah, we do have a message from Lady. Stretch! Stretch! And let's see if we can fix those alerts. Because it's really weird that we can't hear anything. We don't see an alert pop up. That is not ideal. At all. Is what from the SM Club on Iron Wake? Wait, you did hear it? Okay, we heard Stretch, but uh, that's different. That's not. So that is a channel point redemption. That's through Firebot. My alerts for follows, for subs, um, that kind of thing, are through Streamlabs. Hey, lady. Hello, hello. This is our co streamer. Don't worry, right now, uh, your timing's good. I was just trying to solve some Streamlab issues because apparently they're not even playing my alerts. I got a sub earlier and it was just like, eh, who cares? Didn't even tell us. But if y'all haven't checked out Lady the Laddie, go drop those follows, send some love. We're going to be co-streaming very soon. Another awesome Warframe content creator. Uh, love talking to them. Very entertaining. Go drop the follow. All right, so let's. I am going to test a follow one more time. Let's see if anything happens. Not a damn thing. Okay, that's that's sweet. Um, I'm really happy this is happening right now, chat. Super thrilled. Like it didn't even. It's not that we didn't hear it. It just didn't even pop up. That's just crazy. Okay. I love when things break, when you don't change anything, you know? Haha, <laughs> lady. Ah, yes. Fractal. We are partnered with Fractal Design now, which, if you aren't familiar with them, they are a very good manufacturer of PC parts, cases, cooling, um, fans, and was the last one my brain is only halfway there power supplies that's what it was 
power supplies. Uh, honestly, looking at their stuff has made me want to do another build. I don't know about the rest of you, but I love building computers. You only get to do it very rarely because, you know, they're freaking expensive. But it's like adult Legos, you know, with a much better payoff. It's so fun putting them together, like clicking on, seeing everything work. Yee. Ah, I got you, Shelton. When you said, oh, what did you think it was a command for? Well, Turtle, your case is from Fractal. Nice, which model did you get? Oh, well, it sounds like uh, you have your, you do something related to IT, Shamel. So that I get, because you were talking about uh, doing some server work the other day. Mesh of I2? Nice. System integrator. Oh, okay. So you get to do a lot of the installs and everything. So yeah, you get to do it a lot. Nice. That sounds fun. But I don't think I have the background for that, unfortunately, because I would enjoy that. Wouldn't be able to be remote like uh, I have been, but you know, it would be nice. All right, let me, let's see, let's see here. I'm going to pull up, where's my alerts? I'm going to pull this up here. You just had to help get your brother's PC working? Nice. Ah, yes, server work. Burn it all down if it looks like spaghetti and start over. Yep. I was looking, the North series looks nice. All right, let's see if that... Let's copy the URL, copy. Paste, yeah, it hasn't changed. That's so weird. That's weird. Just follow again. Nothing. Okay, let me try logging out and logging back in. That might be... That might help. Streamlabs, let me log out. Let me log back in. Yes, with Twitch. That would be handy. Authorize. That Shalthazan. I mean, were you complaining? All right, test follow. Nothing. So Streamlabs is just effed right now. That's cool. Let's just double check. So we have volume. And the alerts are enabled. Um, shoot. So, yeah, I apologize if we get other subs or follows today. It's just not going to pop up, and that's a Streamlabs thing. And I don't know what else I can do that I haven't already done. I think it's on their end, not mine. Well, that's unfortunate. At least I know it's not something I screwed up, though. So that feels good. All right, you are offline. Let's go take a look at that Trumnet ribbon. Plus zoom, plus damage to Grenier, plus crit damage, minus status chance. So. Definitely needs some rolling. It needs some love. It is not usable out of the box, but that is fine. Nice, nice, nice. Complaining? No. Did it take you longer because you kept smoking and forgetting what step you were on? Like eight. <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious. That's honestly hilarious. Oh. 
All right, what do we got? Alerts. Defense. Oh, the arrow bonus. Right, Carnage? All right, let me see. Yeah, ladies still getting around. Sure, we can do something beforehand. Just to make sure, do we have a Q? He was empty. All right. All right. Closing the queue for now because when Lady gets on, we'll be pulling obviously from both communities. So I don't know. We'll probably maybe we'll open it back up. That's still probably not a bad way to you know, get people in, but also it depends on what we decide we're doing too. So we can open it back up, try it. <laughs> Blames brother than the Ganji. Hey, it's gotta be someone or something's fault, right, Carnage? Come on. We have any surprise good invasions. Bunch of them with weapon parts, if any of you are missing some of those weapons, but nothing with like form of blueprints or anything. What's the sortie? It's a spy, mobile defense, exterminate. Not a bad sortie. That might be something to, to do with lady. Some incursions. We got options. Night and nine. Ever since I I need to I need to hunt still so I don't get out of practice. But ever since the volt bug, it has had a lot less appeal. Like I need to still hunt, but it's just had a lot less appeal. Wait a minute, did those change? You see that down in the in the corner there on both sides? The teal outline doesn't line up. I swear that used to line up. Maybe I just never noticed before. Could be wrong. Need a few more fragments for the lore? Ah. Yeah, I really thought that lined up before, but maybe not. Maybe it was always like that, and I just never noticed, which... I mean, you all have been in the stream. There, there are clearly a number of things I've never noticed. Hey, Henry, how you doing? All right... In the front window. I mean, this is the railjack window. That's where the railjack would be. Doing well, Henry. I mean, hanging in there. You're definitely alive. All right, what about it? Yeah, that's pretty sweet that you can always see a railjack at any point. Oh, I've got a cyst? When the hell did I get a cyst? Let's remove that. I had no idea.
Yep. It just spreads on its own, basically. Uh, Prince, if you can use it to create a helmet charger. So if you go under Kubro breeding, once you click begin incubation, if you if you do it with a warframe that has a cyst, there will be an option to either do a regular one or to drain the cyst. If you do that, you'll create a helminth charger, which it's good for MR. But outside of that, it has no purpose. All right. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, I didn't even realize I hit max on Perrin again. Okay. Welcome to our family. What, you got it from the Howl of the Kubro quest? Really? Weird. I should have given you just a regular one. So you actually... So you had... You had assist and you just chose to drain it there when you were doing that? Interesting. Okay. All right. Screw it. I guess while we're waiting, I can work on Sands of Anoros. All right, Wiki, here we come. Yeah, we're cheating a bit. Who cares? That's what she said. <laughs> oh, so it was initially a Denial Bursa, and now it's a Juggernaut. All right. So it did change, and it's only five kills. All right, so juggernaut. Wait, it's so it's infested. What, literally a juggernaut infested. Okay. Will a Deimos Juggernaut count, or is that different? Cambion Drift should count, then. Huh. Interesting. Hey, mage. Oh, I'm looking at the, uh, just... Getting Sands of Inaros done to be done with it. Yeah, the capture mission. Isos should work, right? Yeah, Isos should work. Alright, how about if we're doing that, if we're making it the capture, let's do Titania. Okay, let's do it. Let's get this stupid thing done. Eris, Isos. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Dang, Shalthazam, congrats. You have been grinding. You are here on a capture mission. You must find, capture, and extract our target. Oh, we're going the other way. You go around here. That's the door we need. Hi. Hi. Please keep dying. It makes me happy when you die. 
found a target. Capture them quickly before they escape. We cannot let our target know we're here. Track them down quickly. Mission complete. The captive has been escorted to the extraction point. Well done. Come on. Need to kill a ton to get the juggernaut spawn. Come on. Die for me, please. Yeah, there it is. That was a juggernaut. They were lured out by the death of infested. Lay low and it should go away or amp up the fight to draw it out. Come on, kill. All right, we got one coming. The juggernaut. I think you made it angry. Good work. And we just got to find it. There it is. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. Okay, we did kill it. Good. That's one. Glass. Why is it always so clean on these tile sets? Can someone explain that to me? Who was here cleaning the glass? Legitimately, who is cleaning this glass? I mean, Yarel is actually not a terrible frame. People really don't give her enough credit. Nice, Shalthazan. You are, uh... It won't be too long before you surpass your old account. Future space game, you guess the ship does? Okay, that... You might have a point there. Silversins, thank you for the follow! Normally we have notifications, but uh, Streamlabs is broken, so much appreciated. Hopefully it'll fix itself in the next day or so. It was working yesterday. Technically I've already surpassed it in some ways. Nice. All right, it said five kills. That looks like... I don't think that's 20% done. What a transparent super material. Mm. Uh, no. Um, so I actually use OBS, not Streamlabs, to stream, but I've got my alerts set up through Streamlabs. And Streamlabs, for some reason, just, even though it's linked with my account, I logged out, logged back in, it is just not playing the alerts at all. I got everything set up correctly. It's just not playing them. You are here on a capture mission. So. You must find, capture, and extract our target. Found a target. Capture them quickly before they escape. Excellent work. We'll interrogate the captive back at base. Your part is done here, Tenno. Come on. There it is. That Kills, please. They were lured out by the death of infested. Lay low and it should go away or amp up the fight to draw it out.
Yay, we pissed him off. The juggernaut. I think you made it angry. Good work. And I just gotta find the bastard. We found him. Oh, was it Twitch that changed some API stuff? Because it was working yesterday. So it's a Twitch thing? Awesome. I wasn't aware of that. If that's the case, that'd do it too. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. Lovely. Not right, Kyle. Uh, Carter was saying Streamlabs and Stream Elements have been having issues lately. Hmm. I mean, I guess at least I know it's not something I screwed up. That's the big thing. Like if it were something I did on my end that I'd have to fix, it's like, okay, then I feel stupid, then I fix it. Well, I guess then I could fix it is the, the downside. Like, if it was something I did, I could fix it. Now I just feel like I'm stuck and waiting for them to fix it. Well, that looks better. That's more progress. Okay. I see why people just kind of rush through the Sands of Anaros quest, because... This is kind of annoying. You are here to find our target and bring them to the extraction point. Happy hunting. Target located. Bring them in. Mission complete. The captive has been Look at it ran through a fast at Bobbin for all the cats. Yeah, nice. I did scan a ton of the cats, so that was useful. Come on. Show me the flash. Can I see the flash? Flash me game. Come on. There it is. That was a juggernaut. They were lured out by the death of infested. Lay low and it should go away or amp up the fight to draw it out. Anyone? Things to kill. I need things to kill. Fuck. This one's going to be wasted. There we go. There we go. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. The juggernaut. I think you made it angry. Good work. And we just gotta find it. There you are. Hey, buddy. Need two Nidus Prime Neuroptics? What do you need two for? Um, it's easier to do with an actual K drive rather than just the default one that you get, Mage. I assume you're doing Wave Rider, right? 
Yeah, it's definitely easier. Oh, and one for building, one for new local rank five. He Oof. Probably not gonna bother, yeah. Honestly, when I decided I was gonna do it, I just checked out what the um what the special K drive they had was, because it comes it gives you a vehicle slot, it gives it comes with a potato in it. Um, and then I just got that. It was a reasonable price, like 40-something platinum. What do we got? One, two more? Yeah, one or two more runs will do it. You are here to find our target and bring them to the extraction point. Happy hunting. Bye, please. Thank you. The uh, hell are you taking me? Over this way. Gotcha. Our target is in the vicinity. Find them. Target located. Bring them in. Mission complete. The captive has been escorted to the extraction point. Every well single faction needs a rare part to get their max rank, so I wouldn't count that out. And you'll definitely... Like, when you're newer, it feels like it's impossible to get the rare parts, but if you run enough relics, you will get multiple copies of rares, for sure. Alright, pissed him off enough. Score. Ah, I didn't mean to do that. Hey, Alexandra. Hanging in there. How are you doing? Where's my juggy? Here, juggy, juggy. There you are. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. New free pack on PlayStation. Ooh, nice. What dropped on PlayStation? Just him off. Yeah, just slap enough. That'll do exactly. Hey, Cha the Living Planet, welcome in. Uh, I don't remember the name. Let me go check for you one second. Yes, Empress. It's the Empress skin, you're right. Devstream March 3rd. Ah, nice, nice. Hopefully that means mid-late March we get Duviri. That'd be very nice. Yes, it is the Emperor skin. All right, one more run. One more run and we got this. She's great. She's super versatile. This one's primarily a capture, so that's why I'm running her. Just get to the end and then we just base <laughs> more or less pistol whip the juggernaut when we get him to spawn, so... You are here to find our target and bring them to the extraction point. Have I mean, obviously we're not literally pistol whipping him because, you know, we're not hitting him with the butt of our pistols, but hey. You 
found a target. Capture them quickly right. before they escape. Hi. Bet you weren't expecting to run into me there. Guess what? Excellent work. We'll interrogate the captive back at base. Your part yeah, I appreciate the work, Lurk, as always. Not nearby, it will only attack when it senses high concentrations of infested blood. Slow the fight if you want it to go away. No. Oh. Bring the pain. Where's this bastard? Don't hide from me. That's what I want to hear. That did it. Here comes the juggernaut. Now we just got to find him. You got Frost Prime crafting? Nice. There he is. Oh, killed him. That should be the last one for the Inaros thing, so then we can go do the actual quest portion. Get the last blueprint and call it good. Oh yeah, it's over here. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. No, there's not. Not if we're not there. Hundred eighty platinum on Necros Prime. Dang. Oh yeah. But here we don't want to rush to the extraction because we're trying to get that juggernaut to spawn. But we got it. That was the fifth one we needed. So that quest is almost good. Almost. Brothers making Gara Prime? Nice. Oh, that reminds me. I've got a really good Gara. Hold on. We've got a really good Gara Invigoration available. I'm going to go grab that. And then we're going to go do the Sands of Inaros quest. Plus 200% ability strength, plus 75% ability efficiency. We're going to take this. All right, let's feed. What do you need? Synthetics. That night ampule, yes. And then you also need bile. Huh. Yeah, we'll give you some more fix, why not? How do you do that? Um, so to have invigorations, you need the... There's a helmet segment you can get from Deimos for achieving rank 5. That's what did it. Alright, lady is ready. Hello, hello. Oh, a few weeks to oh hi sorry <laughs> hold on so something's messed up on my audio settings again one sec oh you're fine i need to push to talk i was just like monologuing <laughs> there we go now i hear you hello oh great great that means that you um didn't hear me monologuing <laughs> well i did say hold on something is messed up on my audio settings so yeah, I mean, I heard you, but you like when you joined in and said hello, I was like mid rant. I mean, it was it's not uh, like rant. I was just explaining how like I w people were saying like, oh yeah, Dufour was gonna come out in February. I was like, no, it wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> no, it was always gonna be like m late March, early April. That was my guess from the get go. And I think that yeah. still stands. <laughs> that is fair. That's fair. Alrighty. 
So, anything in particular that you wanted to knock out today? Uh, I mean, I just got on, so the only thing... I mean, I literally just do Nightwave. Like, that's literally all I do. <laughs> I do Nightwave, and then um, beyond that, I'm just kind of like, who wants to jump in survival with me and, like, grind relics and get Steel Essence? Um, gotcha. But, yeah, I mean, if you haven't or feel like it, uh, I've got Sorty. I st yep, I, w I put off the sortie. I thought that was something that you might want to do. I also haven't done the incursions either. I have and not then, done I mean, those, and I have not done the Archon Hunt either. All right, yeah. We, uh, that just started, actually. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait, no, it's Wednesday. <laughs> Sorry, I'm it's like... It's Wednesday, and you haven't done the Archon Hunt? Yeah, because I wasn't on Monday or Tuesday. Oh, true. You're right. You're right. You're right. Yep, you weren't. And like, so like, my my entire like week is kind of screwed up in my brain because I've like I've I schedule these things kind of, but like usually Monday I get on, I clear Nightwave, I do like the Archon, you know, I do all the weekly stuff, and then gotcha. I move on. So now I'm like, oh wait, it's Wednesday, but I haven't done Monday stuff. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm I'm flexible. You want to start with Sorty? I don't. I mean. Yeah, I'll start with Sorty. Is is she done? Or did I? All right. Oh, how's I the volume now? Her. I was messing with the volume on Ladies End there. Chat. How's the volume now? Does anyone on your side want to join? Uh, good question. Anyone here needs Sorty? And same to my squad. Anyone that want to join for sorty? Ah, beat you to the invite. Take that. Oh yeah, I was building my uh my citrine that I forgot to start building. I was like, oh yeah, I can throw her into Hellmint now. Nope. I have not finished farming the second citrine. I had enough to get it from the pity. Um, but instead oh, I, I got... Did. Yeah, I got a bunch of arcanes and then um, some other weapon parts. Figuring, hey, we'll eventually... We'll get a giveaway going at some point. Yeah, no, I was like, pity. I'm done. <laughs> yep, just got the helmet called it. All right, uh, I got someone on my end who's down for the sortie. Cool, cool. Uh, no one has said they want to join on my end, so... Yeah, worst case scenario, we can always go three. for... Oh, with, like, a random in the fourth slot. I mean, it's sortie. We don't even need a full squad, let's be real. That's true. That's true. Oh, we'll I got one more. A mobile defense and exterminate. Cool. Yeah, sure. Fill it up. There we go. Yeah, spy. So we're gonna we're gonna swap to another frame quick, cause spy. Boom. Right. There you go, Blaze. Oh, Blaze is joining. Cool, cool. Yep, there we go. Let us begin our hacking. Yes. All right, the sorty. You actually have to hack it yourself. Yeah, it'll no, happen. What are you no talking worries. about? I have purse capacity. Ah, nice. No, like, like, legitimately, when I saw the OG list for helmet abilities, and I saw auto hack ability, I was like, oh my god, best ability in the game. No more ha having to manually hack in sortie. Like, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Yep, guaranteed success on your next one. I love it. Yeah, it's just twenty-five energy, so like, or something like that. It's pretty low. So, like, I just throw it on Limbo, go into the Rift, passively get up a little bit of energy, hack done. Tenno, nice. I yeah, I should actually make a spy frame and use that, because that is absolutely what that's for, and I just haven't bothered yet. 
Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. Honestly, you can spy on like any frame. I've, oh, I've, yeah. <laughs> I've just like thrown it on Robin because I'm no bored and just feel like doing it a little different. But yeah, my go to is Limboy. But my go to for most things is Limboy, let's be real. Um, I'm gonna hit the A. I'm looking right at it. <laughs> All right. Kind of figured someone would have A covered, so I'm heading towards B, C right now. Yeah, I'm A because I'm I'll amazing. I'll hit A. Yeah. Okay, you're B because you're beautiful. I like it. I'll take it. That's right. You take what I give. All right. Killed Ooh, you, so, so that counts as being sneaky. Haha, -ha, who needs Loki when I can just turn invisible when I hack stuff? I'm done. Nice. Is anyone on C? Uh, I think uh, Flamey was going to C. Unless Flamey's already in... Yeah, I think Flamey's going to C. It is so weird to play this after playing Overwatch like all day yesterday and Back for Blood and Left for Dead. I forget how high <laughs> the sensitivity in Warframe is. <laughs> Something to adjust to. Yeah, you'll be fine. Oh, I will be. It's just like... I always have one of those oh, moments crap. when I'm like, uh-oh. Oh, oh, that right. was me. Oh, I know that it was, was me. It was, it was the beautiful B. Wait. How, how close are you? You got it still? Uh, I might be fucked. Uh, okay. I'm pretty close. I might be able to... Yeah, I'm here. So I might be able to... Save it. We'll see. Okay, I can auto hack it. All right, I'll let you in. Boom, done. You got it. Nice. Teamwork makes the dream work. Nice. Thank you for saving me. I didn't take out the security camera like I normally do, and then I just walked right in front of it. So, oh, well, yeah. we all have those moments. Everybody has those days. Sometimes it's I just like I knew there was ages. something I was supposed to be doing, and I just didn't do it. Yeah, you know, like sometimes, sometimes I just watch the lasers because I know I have an auto hack or a cipher. So I'm just like, screw it, whatever. Yep. And even the best stealthers will trigger alarms every now and then. Oh, for sure. Oh, I'm second to extraction. That's actually surprising. I'm usually last. I'm the last, and I'm on Titania. That's just sad. It's truly just sad. But 42% damage dealt in a mission that doesn't care about damage dealt, so there's that. No Vobin on the team. What is wrong with y'all? Was that Sander? Nope, that was Kyle Alamode. Oh, different, different Vobin stan. If it makes yep. you feel any better, Vobin is my second favorite Warframe, so um, I do quite enjoy my Squish Daddy. See? Oh, there you go. There you go. So Limbo's number one and Vobin's number two. Yeah. Oh boy, Best um, be cybro ship. Just think of it. Engineer, you know, like the, like the physical, tangible, practical science, and then the theoretical rift science dude just being scientists together this is fair this is fair no it makes sense i probably have thought about this way too much honestly i mean nothing Speaking wrong with of, that. i'm gonna switch to vobin for this one because we are on a corpy map and i'm gonna bring out the gym OC. Oh my god, no, it's the Citrusy. But I don't care what D I don't care what DE has put in red tags. It is the Citrusy. She is a fruit. She is full of vitamin C. There will be no space scurvy. Before you can be rich. You <laughs> oh, I love it. Give unto the void. Or Atlas's little sister has also been pointed out. Atlas's little sister is acceptable, but um I don't know what they did to her because she is split wide open. That's true. That well, is... I don't know, Alice. You might have you, you kind of you might have dropped the ball a little bit. Yeah, she's almost like body horror frame. She is. 
if, if, mm. if I stare at her too long from the front, I'm just very much like, wow, this must have been what those people in those old, you know, like Renaissance era dissections felt like. You must yep. Payloads and defend a number Definitely. Of I break into the network. Uh, Henry is asking how to get Corafel. Same, uh, you go to Tiana Pass, the same area that you farm Citrine. Blueprints drop pretty frequently in the first couple rotations. The other parts, um, have a bit lower drop rate, but you can always, if you're collecting the gem parts, you can always trade them in. I'm in, Tenno. This will take a moment. Yeah, you can trade them into Otak and the Necrolisk. Yeah. The pity system is great because, like, honestly, you can just <laughs> do a few rounds and have enough for, like, a part. Yeah. It's really like, nice. Especially if you go on Steel Path. Yeah. Steel Path, you're getting, like, about 100, 150, depending on your level you of efficiency. Per four rounds. Yeah, sounds about right. When we would go eight rounds, we were generally leaving with about 250. Yeah. But even if you're not on a steel path, you're still you're still gonna get at least like a hundred. And four rounds if you're efficient. Yup. I think I usually see it like between like 100 and 110. Yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a reasonable farm. I, f I do feel like Citrine's drop rate is lower than Baruna's, but I could be wrong. I need access to um, it might just be personal bias. I don't know, because I literally, I got her blueprint in the first run. Um, and then I just did like 12 more run. Not like, like... Tw 12 rounds if you consider each like four. Reached. And then I just yeah. bought all the other <laughs> Wait, right. no, I think I, I think I did. No, what happened was I got her blueprint, I got her chassis, and I bought her systems and her um, head hole for optics. Her head hole. Yeah. That one. So she's not going around like the headless horse. So yeah. she's halfway there already, let's be real. Yeah, she kind of is. Especially with her alt home. With her, like, random chicken nugget rock brain. I mean, seed brain. It's a seed, not a rock. Yeah, I definitely like her alt helm better. I don't really. I feel like it looked like I would like it, but I feel like it's too small. Like, I feel like really? the, the, like, the horizontal width should be extended a little bit and it'd be a little taller like i don't know something about it looks like a bit like a shrunken head to me uh, i just like it i i don't know her her base helm looks odd to me like i know they're not mandibles but the parts that dangle down in the front look like freaking insect mandibles see i don't me. get mandibles i get like you know like those like like the egyptian like pharaoh things that they would wear mm. Like, it kind of has, like, that effect to me. It feels very, like, that, whatever that is. <laughs> it's probably a term, and I don't remember it. I can see that. I forget the name of it, but someone in chat last week pointed out that it kind of resembled the helmet for a Cobra character from G.I. Joe, and I don't remember the name of the character. That would track. That would track. Here is a terminal. Get me in. And get ready to defend. I'm in, Tenno. This will take a moment. You only use melee, Henry? I believe it. I, the only thing there about only melee, melee is, like, for me, <laughs> um, yes. when I would do 
Because I do, I do melee a lot, usually. But I try to, like, mix it up, because if I do, like, extended runs, then, like, my fingers just get tired, so I need to start shooting. Yep. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. Oh, you don't have good guns yet? Gotcha. Yeah, melee will always be... Well, I probably shouldn't say always, but most likely will always be very, very solid in this game. Very likely, yeah. It's basically the only way to do damage when you're a new player. That's for sure. The odds were against us, Tenno, but we did it. I mean, the Mark One Paris is great. Don't listen to what I said earlier, chat. I mean, I'm trying to think what did I use. I mostly just used abilities, and then I learned how to mod, and then I suddenly could use weapons. <laughs> well, the thing is, even when you're you're at that point you're learning and you don't have mods and, and whatnot, melee weapons tend to out DPS the guns. I would just use when I started. I was like, I was the Mark One Paris. I was like all the bows. Give me the snipers. I don't remember <laughs> really having like a whole lot of trouble. But the only problem with those weapons was like. This game isn't really a self game, so like how I'd like to yeah. slowly and methodically go through missions doesn't really work. Nope. <laughs> so, yeah. That makes sense. All right, what's the last mode? I forget. Let's see. Exterminate. Oh, well then. Exterminate. Okay. Um, who do I want to play? Mm. Uh, fairies. <laughs> Not a problem, you never listen to me. I see how it is, I see how it is. Okay, okay. I'm trying to decide what frame I want to use. Me too. What do we want to kill with? Uh, I don't know. I kind of want to play Equinox. Really? Actually, no, I'm going to be lazy and just play Zaku. <laughs> Another one of my favorite frames. Let's see. All right, we're good. We can go with this, right? You can do whatever you want. I'm faster than you, though. Apparently. Ah! I clicked it before you did. You sure did. All right. <laughs> Let's kill the like corpus. The most like. <laughs> you sounded like such a dad in that moment. Like, okay, kiddo. Like, <laughs> you're. Yeah. Here, yeah, have your cookie. Okay. Uh, I wasn't going for that. It just came out that way. Yeah, you know, sometimes, sometimes you just, just get there in your life, you reach that state where you just yeah. kind of just become figure, figurehead of parental. It's almost unavoidable. Ah, Pyrotic's going meatball all the way. Give me your weapon so that I may destroy you. <laughs> I just have to kill a bunch of enemies. Ooh, that was handy. That's locked. Who's gonna hack it? Right, Grindel, you got this. Represent. That's right, Grindel. Notch is good for meatballing. Good for poking. You know, I haven't approaching. tried Grindel since his rework. I used to despise Grindel before the rework. He's actually decent now. Yeah, I was always just very indifferent towards him. Like, you know, I can't, like, be mad about, like, a living Kirby frame, but... <laughs> <laughs> Never thought about that living Kirby. Nice. Really? I always, no, I, I was just, I, I just looked at him as Gluttony Incarnate who wants to do a Sonic impression. Oh my goodness. 
the first thing I saw, the moment they saw, the moment they did his like ability where he went like ah! and sucked people into him, I was like, that's Kirby. Nice. Okay, now I'm not going to be able to unsee it. Thank you. I'm surprised I didn't see that before. Yeah, I was just like, <laughs> Grindel is Kirby. Except, hey, uh, like, tight now, now, now you can, if you ever wanted to know, like, what Kirby was like, you if you were to go up against Kirby IRL, this is, this is it. Okay. Vaguely terrifying, am I right? A little bit, yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely agree with that. Which means Kirby Prime is coming later this year. Is it already that time? Yeah, the default order they could obviously deviate is going to be Pildren, Wisp, Gauss, Grendel for this year. Yeah, that's right. Gauss and Grendel did come out like at the same time. Honestly, I just don't remember them coming out the same year as Pildren. Apparently they did. Hey, look at that. We got a sculpture. Wow. I am so impressed with this sculpture. I stare at it and I think to myself, what beauty, what grace. What could the great Oricon have been thinking when they created a cybernetic pineapple? Uh, you know what? 10 platinum is 10 platinum, right? Yeah. I just turned them all into endo, honestly. I wonder how much I'm sitting on right now. Everything but those ones I do. Those ones, I think they sell for more than others, so I sell those. But all the other ones, yeah, they're just endo. I'm kind of curious. I do kind of want to see how much I have right now. Wait, I'm going <laughs> to place your guesses. How much endo do you think um, I'll get for all of these? Oh, I don't know how many you've got right now. Well, you're just gonna guess. See. Do you think you think? Just that... gonna guess. Yeah, you just have to guess. Okay. Without even without having an idea how many you got. Um. I mean, is that not just what you do when you buy a scratcher? You have no idea what you're gonna get. That's true. That's true. That's true. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna say you're sitting on, give or take ten. Let's go with right around thirty-four k endo. Thirty-four k. Okay. I don't like this. What? This is weird. <laughs> What's weird? You don't see my screen, but no. This I... ship did not blend properly <laughs> with oh. that landing so, enemy. You trading or gotcha. you some endo from Iatan treasures? You know what? Now that you. What? Oh, no, the the the, the scout, the Grenier ship from the back, it kind of looks like, oh. a, like a stuffed turkey. Yeah, that I can see. Yeah, I'd never I... thought of that until just this moment because someone said in jet. <laughs> nope, that that totally tracks. I, I'm with you on that. Whoever said that in chat definitely is. Definitely is right. Okay, so you're already very wrong. <laughs> well, I was saying 10, give or take, and you have 20 Anasa sculptures. So, yeah, I'm very, very wrong. Yeah, You've been yeah sitting I'm on almost 100,000. I have almost 100,000 in now. <laughs> I, I was going blind. Yeah, I, I know. I, I took my you scratcher, very... and I didn't, I didn't even yep, get my two bucks very... back. Yeah, you were very far from the jackpot there. Probably gonna wait until I uh, get a hundred thousand. You know what? Hey. Do you want to quickly do the uh, I ten hunt? I did it, but I can come along. Sure. I mean, if you don't want to come along, I can finish it in like twenty seconds. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, we can go. Uh, hey, anyone else need the weekly treasure hunt? I do have someone who I think you said you hadn't done the Archon hunt yet, so I have someone who wants to come along for the Archon hunt. They haven't done it either, but for sure. All right. Anyone need to the weekly treasure next, hunt? I guess, after this? Yeah, we can knock that out next. Hey, there we go. I got one who needs the, the same one who wants to do the uh, Archon hunt also needs the uh, weekly treasure hunt. So 
Oh, yeah. Boom. Treasure me. There we go. The dark fire. Did I read that right? I did. Yep, dark fire. You did. I like saw it out of the corner of my eye. I'm like, oh, did I? That was really fast. I'm not sure if my brain processed. Apparently, my brain does process. <laughs> Isn't that weird? Nice. How like your brain can 100% process something, but you like still doubt that you process it properly. Yep. You're like, wait a minute. Did that really? No, I must have missed something. Like, no, no, that that was correct. Oh, uh, the JM City uh, came in chat and said they're the one with the turkey joke and also mentioned that the tenor are the stuffing. Yep. Which is yep. <laughs> very accurate. It is. Except very I don't, accurate. I don't like that because I'm... Have a good I one, Biotic. I don't know. You don't I like, like thinking that. of yourself as entering a turkey that way? I mean, I've entered a turkey. You know, you, you, you kind of have to if you're going to stop a turkey. Yeah, yeah, I've done the same. Y'all also if you need, if you're gonna clean it out, yeah, you gotta do it. That's uh, yeah, you know, I was just associated from that part, honestly. Oh wait, 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 hold on. We got I got one more who can come. Let me get let me shoot a quick invite. I missed it in chat. We still got time to get you in Belbreth. If you get online. Don't go too far. Alright, let's see if Belbreth can hop on quick. Oh, there you are. Hold on. Invite. Boom. Right, I forgot there was an X in front of your name. Invite sent. No, yo, I was yo, looking man. in the wrong spot. I forgot it was an X in front of your name. Yo, 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 look up. Oh, what the? Yeah, right? <laughs> Unfortunately for you, it was also. Um, I didn't know I could get up here. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> That's. <laughs> I didn't know you could get up here. I played this game for almost oh, hey, nine years. Hey, look at that! Hello. Geronimo cool. to victory. To victory. Exactly. What else are we gonna go to? Failure? <laughs> Not in my vocab. What is nope. that word? A folier? 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 I'm familiar with this terminology. Yeah, definitely sounds foreign. And like in typical American fashion, um, I know just a couple of phrases in other languages, and that's about it. I mean, same. But I've also I've studied. I've like light. I should say lightly studied. I've lightly studied like five languages, Stay focused. and I never yeah, use them enough. So I always forget them and have to like relearn everything from scratch. But then I just have like random phrases and words that will come out in my um just general vernacular. And <laughs> it's always a time. It's always a time. <laughs> yeah. That reminds me, though. Uh, I don't know if you have a recommendation, lady, but uh, lady in chat. So I coming up in May, going on a family trip to Italy. Uh, Ooh, my wife's Italian. Know. She actually has family in Italy. So would like to pick up some Italian, Italian. for the trip. Yeah, so any good recommendations to work on that? Obviously, you know, uh, I got a few funny months. Funny enough, but... Italian was one of the languages I studied. <laughs> Not nice. that I can help okay. you very much right now. Um, honestly, like I said, I, like, remember, like... Oh, what is it? Like, Komoto Kiyami, which I think is, like, and really accented American, but, like, is, what's your name or something? <laughs> okay. And then, like, buongiorno. <laughs> All right, Mid saying Duolingo. So, Duolingo, I think, works pretty well if you're doing a language that's not, that doesn't have, like, a separate writing structure, like Japanese, because half of it is just going to be you trying to learn hiragana and katakana and kanji. <laughs> That's I'm speaking from experience. Your job's done. If that makes sense, yeah. And like the problem, and so like my experience with Japanese with Duolingo was the fact that like I was in this weird boat because I actually remember a decent amount of characters, but like it, it just felt like I was taking a vocab test and like had no real um like application. <laughs> 
So it was just like a bunch of random words that I was memorizing. And I'm like, yeah, I know that means that, but like, then you speak to me in a sentence, I'm like, I have no idea what you're saying. Like, I know I recognize yeah. like two words, and I'm gonna make, take a wild stab in the dark right now. <laughs> That's kind of how I felt when I was taking French in high school. Like, well, I got little words and phrases, and I know you, you can't just slip right into speaking it, but I was always it was so also, much better at reading. It was it was also like the uh, I don't know the, some of the words we were learning didn't feel super relevant, and I didn't. And you know, it was an older teacher, so I'm sitting there going, "If I ask if this word's actually used over in France right now, would you even know?" Because, I'm sorry, talking about going to the discotheque? That's not super relevant in today's society. Unless that's still used as a word for a club. I don't yeah, know if they I'm would call it that. I feel like they wouldn't. I don't think so either. I feel like there has to be like a, like a slang that's used or more than that. You're heading out, Henry. Have a good one. Yeah, that, that, it feels like that was a very dated term, and that already had me losing faith immediately when I was starting French The only school. thing I will say is that, like, every, like, textbook starts like that. They're like... That's true. Go to the dis discotheque. Go to the biblioteca. Like... <laughs> yep, exactly. Hey, Ultra Molly Wop. Welcome in. Ultra Molly says, This game feels the same, but it's so different. I haven't played in six years. Came back, like, two days wow. ago with a fresh account. Wow, should I just focus on clearing the star chart before anything else? That is what you're going to be doing a lot of early on. Um, you don't really get into the story without clearing a lot of the star chart. And a lot of clearing the star chart is just introducing you to different enemies, different um, game modes, essentially. So, yeah, you'll start that way. And as you progress, um, it'll unlock more planets, and eventually it'll unlock more quests and story for you. Yeah. But yeah. Yeah, I would say that sums it up more or less. I, I think my general approach, and my approach is very different because of when I started, which was pretty much at the start of the game. Um, but yeah, it would be focused on your, your star chart, especially for like those first like four um planets earth venus mercury and demars like all of that is technically the tutorial <laughs> because yep. most of the junctions that you have to do which are the ways that you unlock the paths to the each planet are going to be like introducing you to the various systems in the game you can of course if you get sick of that see if your codex has any quests that are unlocked already because you can just do those in between to get a change of pace if you want I am, but yeah, generally speaking, I would say focus on one thing at a time because there is so much that you can do in Warframe that it's very easy to get overwhelmed. I am. Yes, Personally, yes. I would also say kind of hold off on the open worlds. They're a lot, and I know you can, like, just kind of hop into them pretty much from the get go. But I've had so many people come in and be like, oh, I'm doing the Fortuna quest right now, and I, like, can't beat it. I remember <laughs> when I was new, and I was struggling with that quest. It was yeah. it was rough. And I was just but... like, you can you can hold off on it. You know, you don't have to clear it mm -hmm. right now. It's not like you have, it's not like you're going to get to rank 5 anytime soon either way when you're MM4. <laughs> yeah. About the only advantage to doing that early is if you are... You know, if you maybe you're a, like a, a returning player who's very familiar. No, we're not yeeting the dog. We've been over this fiery. Um, if you're a returning player who is kind of familiar, like it feels like just riding a bike again, you know, you're getting back on, everything's kind of comfortable. Um, because early on, if you can get access to those open worlds, hit guns are a great way to just immediately boost your arsenal. Like, otherwise, the guns that you pick up for a long time really suck. Yay! But kick guns are the exception. Also, kind of playing off of that, join a clan. That too, yes. Definitely. Because, like, that's where the 90% of the weapons are going to be that you're going to be farming for. Uh, so, you know, if yeah, you're and there's a clan some... with, like, a good, 
with, that's done most of the farming, then you'll also have access to some Warframes that aren't tied to bosses, like Neja, Zephyr, Banshee, Wukong, mm -hmm. Volt, if you didn't start with Volt. Eventually, your rally. Yep. So, yeah, some very good frames in there. Yeah. I feel like that was... I feel like that's enough. <laughs> yeah. Th hopefully that helps. Hopefully. All right. Did we want to go knock out that uh, Archon yeah, Hunt? Does anyone want to get an Archon to see? Right, I know Darkfire, who's with us, also wanted to come along. So we've got three. We've got one more spot for whoever speaks up in chat first. Either chat, I don't care. Oh, Molly, glad that was helpful. Uh, what platform are you on? Because if you're on PC, I've got room in mind and we've got plenty. We've got all the research done. Otherwise, if you're on other platforms, we've got plenty of people in the community who can probably help you out. Yeah, oh, you used to be a Valbin main. There you go. Nice. Oh my goodness, all the Valbin mains coming out in full force. Praise ah, the Squish no kidding. Daddy cult. No one knows why I call him Squish Daddy. I, should, I feel like <laughs> I should explain this. <laughs> Probably. You've done it a few times now, and I'm just like, okay, it's a nickname. Okay, we go so, with it. So, so, yeah, I have a lot of interesting nicknames for things, but Squish Daddy is very near and dear to my heart because he's built like a tank. Like, you'd think he could take a hit, right? But you look at his mm -hmm. stats, and the man is, like, a sneeze away from breaking. So I call him Squish Daddy. <laughs> okay, that's fair. That is fair. He gives, he gives daddy energy, but, like, very soft yeah. daddy energy. <laughs> and all of his skins, like, he looks like he can take a hit, but he really can't. I get it. Really, I get it. It was, it was a huge problem for, like, I wouldn't say it's a huge problem, mm -hmm. But, like, it was definitely a thing to contend with when I was, like, playing him before his rework. It was just kind of like, wow. You know, you look like you'd have higher armor than this. <laughs> yep. All right. So are we going to... When do we do go? Is Can we do navigation here? I forget. I don't think so. I don't think we can. Leave. Nope. Yeah. So, yeah, we'll head back Reset. and reform. Yep. All right. Yes, Dark Lotus, Pupper's in my arms right now. She just came over and wanted to be picked up, so. Hold me, uh, you're... for I am worthy of pets. Yes, so you're, you're cool with me doing the whole Archon hunt with just one arm, right? Um, who needs arms? Yeah, who needs to actually be able to move, right? Just use your feet. There <laughs> we go. pay you for that. Hmm. <sighs> Like the yeah, Stream Deck has pedals now, right? We can figure something out with that. Manifesting Tower Shard. Why? Why Ooh, do they yes. keep giving me all of these frames that I'll never use? Hydroid with 200 percent more strength. What am I gonna do? Turn into a puddle and sit there? Uh Hold on says gaming with feet, new skill. Actually, I don't know if you all watch Elden Ring at all, but uh, no. Miss Mika, holy crap, she has beaten the game on a dance pad, and I think she even did a challenge where she was playing one version on a dance pad while simultaneously playing one on a controller. So she's literally playing two things at the same time, beating the same boss twice at the same time. Insanely talented. I have no now idea how she did it. That sounds impressive. That is some like real split brain energy. Well, she did say she has ADHD, so I think that she may have actually been using that to her advantage there, because I, I don't think I could do that. And I mean, you gotta get something out of it, right? Make it work for you. If I only had to use, like, WASD, or, like, like half a keyboard, and I had another keyboard, that I only had to use, like, half... If I, if I could control it entire game with half a keyboard, I think I might be able to. Maybe. Depending on what game it was. <laughs> Nice. Ah, oh, Dark Lotus, thank you for the biddies. Sorry, uh, Streamlabs is, like, messing up. None of the alerts work, and I've checked. There's nothing I can do on my end to fix it, but thank you. Stream Elements was being weird for me last week. Just, like, double posting and being super delayed. Yeah, sounds about right. 
Oh, Vam says uh, they think Miss Mika has beaten all the Souls games like that. Dang. That is skill. See, I haven't even played right. a single one because they're like the only game franchise to make me rage out of my mind. Oh, really? I hate Souls games. I'm uh... like, the boss isn't even the boss. The boss is the easy part. Getting to the boss is the part that I hate. <laughs> mm. I'm like, these bosses, I'm just like, okay, yeah, one shot, I'm done. But, like, me doing every single, me getting to the boss was so freaking frustrating. I would just be like, I have died to the same random Polex dude. So many times. Yeah, honestly, Elden Ring was the first Souls-like I played. I really enjoyed it, but obviously the other you. ones I know are very different. <laughs> They were very different, not open world, and you had a very specific way you had to go about something. So I can see that being more frustrating, not having, not being able to say, you know what? This is not the way to go. Maybe I'll go try this way. Hey, Dark Lotus. Yeah, it is Laddie. Yes. All right. We got room for one more for the Archon Hunt. If anyone needs it or just wants to run it again for fun. I don't think I'm getting another bite on my side. Anyone on yours? Nah. Nah? Alright. So, you are fortunate that I already did mine this week because I am one of the few players left with zero Tau Forged. So had I been with you, you would have basically been guaranteeing yourself a regular shard. Or... But... Or my magical pixie dust would have rubbed off on you because RNG loves to give other people luck and not me. Ah. So now you just might be out of luck. Well, we I ran like into someone who first. was saying they had like, I want to say eight or ten Tau Forge, some, some ridiculous number. So their luck didn't rub off on me. I definitely dragged them down. Hold on, yeah, radiation is the the one that does the most against archons. Oh, you got your first tower force last week. Nice, Meliodas. Yeah, I've been swapping two tower shards. <laughs> okay, so you're not much better than me. And the blind worm deemed the scream of the Chondra to be madness. For she could not see how far and free it soared. You're still in the clear. No detection from enemy sensors. Nope. There we go. Uh, I didn't even notice my Smito was down. Shit happens. Friendship door! Oh, okay, you went for the... Obligation side. door. Oh, oh my we're God. on this side. Our friendship is clearly not... Almost out of time. Hurry. Keep shooting me, come on. Shoot me again. Stay focused. There's a heavy okay, you wait for me to actually do that to stop shooting me. What a dick. He says, oh, warding Halo's up. It's in the invulnerability period. I won't shoot you. Seriously? Too soon. Bite my head, pain off, mother. 
That's what the good meat is. <laughs> Suck the guts until the little legs kick, kick, kick. That is a disturbing voice line. I've got some scores. Oh, are you listening to Pazuzu? For some reason, I was that time, yes. Yeah, I tune him out. He just is, you know, he's very heavy metal. He's going through a phase and right now. Clearly. I will bring it to the surface. Oh. All right. Who's Revenant and looks low key like it's ready for Christmas? That, that would be you? Darkfire. Nope, that's Darkfire. Hmm, I see you've got I, the I was spirit all year round. That is, you're right. That is a very Christmassy revenant. Right? <laughs> it's, it's, it's because red and green is associated with that time of year. Oh, yeah. Okay, it's Interception. Ready for Interception. Uh, let's hold on. I don't know that I want. What do we want to go on there? Um, what do we want to go on here? I might just use. Who did I use last time? Did I use Wisp or did I use Equinox? Maybe we're gonna try Citrine. Maybe maybe we'll go with uh the citrusy. Yes. Squeeze that juice out. That citrusy <laughs> juice. Cause it cause it's citrusy. Hmm. Cause she's a citrus. I yep. <laughs> Caught that. Caught that. And then you know, I just had to make sure. Wasn't sure. Wasn't sure you got the memo. So, Do we want to yeah. open it up to random so that way we have someone to cover the fourth one? Even though, from what I was hearing, <laughs> from fourth. I don't know. I mean, from what I was hearing, people aren't really good at this with random squads. But I mean, least... I'll just say this: I literally have done this one solo. <laughs> okay. Well then. Then then let's not put ourselves through that. Okay, that works. Yeah, it was a long, it was long, I won't lie. It was probably the longest arc on home I've ever done in my life, but I did complete it solo, so that was fun. <laughs> all right, all right. Well then. Unless you just like feel like being that light at the end of a corner for some random tenno. Eh, you know, I've had randoms hop into a lich hunt, have their lich spawn. They screw up the stab and then just frickin' leave, so nah, I'm good. Okay, that answers that question then. Oh, let's carry on. Yes. Okay, everyone, we're now going to Jupiter. And next stop on our Pazuzu World Tour. Hmm. Darkfire's got the Christmas lander too. This facility is a communication. Oh, some people just really like Christmas. Valid. Listen in. I want to you know, know he's telling his Why wife. not? If it brings you joy, go for it. Do you remember, Natal? That first day, how our father lifted you screaming from the manifold. Oh, oh yeah, I need mean, all right. Yeah, if we, uh, if we struggle here, we can tag in. Oh, I should probably swap out my Smita, too. I don't need a Smita for these. Vulpophila would be more useful. I have a Vulpophila. I love getting Vertigo when I ground slam from high heights. I will not take this look. It's mine. Excuse me, what now? Sir, there you go. Let me strip them. Uh-oh. Uh Nairu. Get back up. It's not your time. We have 
have lost control of a tower. Ah, oh, nullifier. Of course it's a nullifier. Well, all we gotta do is nullify their life and it's all good, right? I like the way you think. We are dominating. Keep it up. Do enjoy the Tenant Archiplasmor. This I love this little shotgun. Oof. The enemy has captured a tower. They actually took Alpha. They never go for Alpha. That's right. That was good for the beat. Beginning stream decode now. We have lost control of a tower. All right, I'll take back. Oh wait, no, Darkfire's here. See, we got the. Probably, most likely. It's easy peasy, right. and squeezy. Let's see, Bravo's almost back. Okay, let's check Alpha. Slow down. Oh, they literally took it and then just moved on. What the hell? Oh, I got a Warblade oh. if anyone needs that. Nice. Hey, Lisbeth, how you doing? <laughs> Meep says, for me, they're always going for the D, and I'm not right, joking no, about like, that. Literally, they do. They do, That's yeah, right. they're... <laughs> they're all That's, over it's, here, it's, like... <laughs> yeah. I mean, look, that's what they're doing for us, too. Look, I... Always, I always go for the D, because that's what I want in my life. But also, apparently, everyone else, and I'm like, this is mine. This is the one D I can hold. So, <laughs> why are you trying to get all up in my business? Off. Oh, yep, yes, they haven't heard of boundaries, apparently. The enemy has captured a tower. Oh, they got C. Okay, okay, we're coming. productive today nice yes that does deserve some game time you're right you should reward yourself and i beheld a great ram and the horns of him were crowned with soul and with Look, tower Zuzu just shush and upon his tongue the zaraman flame and the mighty demon of the void cowered before him and he feared it not they are broadcasting another message. Make sure the enemy... Wait, you had damage reduced by 75% and one tap the Archon Meep? Jeez. Okay, you all with your little disco lights really need to stop there. The enemy have taken a tower. You must recapture it. Lost. 
Oh wait, we're doing this Viper, aren't we? I know, because she's the only one with Corp. Wait, what? Oh, we're, we're doing this Viper, right? Like, that's, that's who we're up against? Snakehead? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Little Miss Hitbot? The Poison Mama? Yep, that one, yes. That is the one for this week. You can keep going if you need more, uh... Names. No, no, I'm... <laughs> I picked up what you were putting down. <laughs> Says the person running around making rainbows. I, what's wrong with my rainbows? Rainbows mean love. All right, Turtle, are you, is that, is, is TF supposed to mean true facts or the fuck? I thought it was the second one. Okay, I was assuming the second one, but I just... Maybe like a shorthand for some sort of like... Oh, true facts, word. no. It was the first one that time. Wow. I really thought it was going to be the second one. Huh. Wait, what was the sentence? I actually don't know what I said that that was a response to, but I will take it. <laughs> the enemy has all four towers. You must I like hearing that I'm right. So we'll we'll just go with it. We don't question these things. If you poke too much, then people might reconsider, you know? The enemy is dominating. You must capture a tower. And we were doing much better that first round, you know? Are we? Oh, yeah. You know what? I need to, like, focus on this and not rechat so much. Wins. Oh, you. You're why I'm taking so much damage. Finally neutralizing Bravo. Oh. I'm a coming. He will never. Turtle's just not gonna elaborate. Okay. That's. Tower I don't know if I don't know if I want to know what you're agreeing with then. That. That's concerning. D, just in case. You still need help on C. I'm coming down. Claim that sucker. I'm trying. Okay. It's claimed. Bye. There we go. Yep, we're good. Ever fear Wisp is here. Right. I cannot wait for Wisp Prime. Finally, a Wisp that I can invest in. Oh yeah, I have already invested in this one. I have way oh, too many yeah. for man. And you're still gonna get Wisp Prime and form her, aren't you? Uh, honestly, probably not. Oh really? Nah, I've been getting really lazy with reforming, because at the end of the day, I'm like, I've done these level caps with the base form, do I really need to go through it again? No, I just need to level it. <laughs> like, we'll see. We'll see. If it's like a frame that I really it, like, the worst was not even a frame I play that frequently, so I'm like, do I really want to deal with this again? No. Well, no one said you had to level cap, but just forma and, you know, Yeah, but like, level. No, like, I, I will have some serviceable builds with, like, level. Yeah, that's fair. And if I want to do something more, then I can just go to the base form that already works and I've already spent enough time on. That is totally fair, yep. C is really popular. We have decoded the message. Okay, see, so oh, easy, hey, easy. We had no problem. Yep, now we just gotta kill them all. No, it's like a very uh, sociopathic Pokemon. I 
love that your pet is your pet's name just says this is named after Dan. Yes, because it is named after Dan. <laughs> Clearly. Instead of just calling it Dan, had to be this is named after Dan. Yes, because really I need to make sure that, that, that Dan knew that I named it after him. Yep. So when I was playing with him, I'd be like, yeah, so here it is. I named this pet after you, like I said. Now you're supposed to rename one of your weapons to be Lady. <laughs> Don't know if you ever did, actually. If you did, I really hope he names it. This is named after Lady. <laughs> Otherwise, missed opportunity. Uh, and, uh, yeah, Grumpy, we're doing the Archon Hunt. Lady and Darkfire hadn't done it, and uh, we're doing a ghost stream with Lady the Laddie, so... Hi. It's like, hey, why not? That's right. I'm here, I'm queer, and I'm serving you sass. <laughs> I mean, hey, <laughs> you gotta introduce yourself somehow. I just feel like, and you why had, not like, be honest? Look, it's not like people wouldn't know, and within two seconds of me speaking, anyway. So, I just embrace it. All right, yeah. I mean, be yourself. Exactly. Just embrace it. So, I got my reminiscence. Yeah, probably ought to get off Citrine for this one. Let's let's go Neje. Why not? Eh, Latum because Latum things. Sure, that looks good. All right. Let's go. Oh, lady, have you played um, High on Life? I was going to go with probably whatever you're going to say is a no, and the answer to that is, yeah, no, I haven't. <laughs> okay. Well, then. look at that. Even after waiting for for uh, the question, you were like, yep, that, that answer would have applied. <laughs> yeah. I'm just so big brain sometimes. You just you think in 10 steps out of me the whole way. Uh, I'd make a great chess player if I cared enough. Is that just the empty void of space? Or is that the empty void of my heart? The world will never... I mean, I think the answer is why not both? Yeah, I don't know how autocorrect would have gotten eaten when you were going for weapon either. Uh, summons. Sir? Really appreciate it if you wouldn't do that. summons Alright, 
one more. Oh, no. Naira, Nira, where are you at? There you are. Hi. Try actually going down. Huh? Maybe? There we go. We got Shut it. Me like you hate me, but you love me. <laughs> it's a song. If you do now. <laughs> I kind of figured. I, f I could just feel your confusion. <laughs> oh no. Um, I my crap. My uh, warding halo just got drained. Oh. And I don't have matter eye on, so I'm a little screwed. I mean, uh, just, where are you? Back where the Archon was. Just, ah, yeah, thank yeah, you. Just, there we course, go. That's the wrong one. Because I have, I have brought Rabinosity for a reason, so I could give y'all five stacks of the good stuff. Ah! I'm on there. measure. My Warding Halo should have done the trick, but I didn't apparently power it up I mean, enough to uh, withstand what was going on there. One of them is there. iframes and one of them is damage reduction. Okay, that's true. That, that, that is fair. High frames do beat out damage reduction, yes. This gate only opens to <gasps> Zuzu, you're so cute, cute. Tear the veils from Whatever. Use those. Did you ever watch Avatar The Last Airbender? Uh, the first one, yes. Not the new one that just came out, but the first one. Okay, that's good, because... Oh, wait, 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 wait. You know... Oh, wait, no, oh, no, sorry, I was... My brain, I like... You know that thing where you, you were, earlier you were talking oh, about... I, did I process that you? right? Yeah, I was thinking of the blue people. And then I AKA immediately space went, wait a Pocahontas. minute. Yes, Space Pocahontas. So, to answer your question, uh, the very long way, no. Okay, well, never mind. What I was gonna reference was gonna go over your head anyway. Probably, yep. Ooh, am I gonna have to do hacking? Oh my gosh. Are you gonna get to see me hack something? Oh my goodness. Free hacking with Lady? There we go. Okay, I got the good head. Backstab says, uh, you mean the Smurfs for the blue people? Oh, <laughs> I forgot about Smurfs. The OG blue people. Yes, the OG blue ones. There we go. Elven Smurfs. Much taller Elven, Elven Smurfs. Smurfs, yes. Okay, Elven That's... Smurfs if they were put into the Willy Wonka Laffy Taffy stretcher. Pretty much, yeah. Well, some of them are actually in water. Isn't that like the whole point of the way of water? I never watched it. I wasn't interested. I wasn't either. I was like, one was enough for me. I don't see why we're doing this again, but okay. There's apparently supposed to be like six movies in that series. Or something. A, 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 frankly, a seemingly high amount of movies. I yeah. would get after the one, but like, <laughs> guess not. Did we have the deacon? Was someone working on I thought someone had gone there already, do we not? I I I, I was coming back. <laughs> oh there we go. Okay. Nyra you were, alright. I was like, I thought you had gone there, and then I saw you in the middle area and I was like, Are you on your way back? Or did, did I misunderstand? Nah. At least I'm just a master of parkour. 
Gotcha. I was like, at least I didn't misunderstand. I thought something was happening. You misunderstand. Never, never. Yeah, so, like, they're clearly going through, like, all the elements or whatever. They filmed the water one and the next two at the same time, so the actors didn't age out. Yeah, that's what I heard. They didn't want the Stranger Things effect. Or what was it? Wasn't it Dexter where they had to replace one or both kids? Because of the amount of time that was act that was going by in the story. Didn't line Dexter? up with the amount of time that went by in filming. Yeah, Dexter. Showtime? Oh, you don't... Did I just date oh. myself? You're talking about, like, that old, like, serial, serial killer, killer show? Yes. Yeah, because I was over here, like, Dexter's Laboratory. <laughs> no. I've never seen Dexter, so I have no idea. Fair. I feel like I'm doing no damage to this thing all of a sudden when I was doing a ton before. Uh, the damage was quite solid the first part. Um, I enjoyed everything up to the last season, Grumpy. I don't think the ending did it justice, which I know they actually, like, obviously brought it back. Likely as a result of the fact that the ending didn't quite leave closure, you know, but... Yeah, I think a lot of people who were watching the show were really disappointed with the ending, but then, you know, I can say that about a number of shows, like, look at Game of Thrones. I feel like, I feel like endings tend to be really, see, third seasons and endings tend to be, like, rough. True. Although, I will say, I thought they did a pretty good job with what they had available for The Good Place. Like, Never watched like, that one. They kind of wrote themselves into a corner, but I think they, they handled it really effectively. I feel like if you're gonna end a show, either end it season three or make sure you really have it planned out. See, really having it planned out doesn't always help either, because they had everything planned out for How I Met Your Mother, and that that last season sucked. They had to plan that out, because just like, uh, was mentioned with the, the Avatar thing, that, you know, talking to the kids, like, you couldn't have those kids age out in the middle of the conversation. Yeah, Grumpy, yeah, they did. So the kids knew what was going on all from the beginning, and they had to adhere to some, like, ridiculous NDA to never talk about it until it aired. There we go. No! Seriously? Make it through all that, and then... You dealt with Archon Naira expertly, Tenno. Her kind may expect... Well, frick. No protection. Thank you. All 
All right, here's hoping you get that towel forged. Cause that was uh, a fight. Let's see, manifesting, manifesting, manifesting. Blue potato for the sortie. Nice, fiery. We got a pineapple. Just got a pineapple. <laughs> Oh, clearly I got nothing because I already did it. Oh, what's your result? Hey, it's a towel forge! <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> yes, I'm not kidding. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. I mean, I'm happy for you, but... I'm happy for you. Know that I am. But also, I'm kind of mad. <laughs> yes. Yes, exactly. I know, I've been there, you know, when you're like... Hi, I have been farming for this thing for the past 365 days. And you got it after one try. Ha <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of it. That's kind of the, hmm, I feel like I need a beer moment. Like, and it's uh, Darkfire's first Tau Forged. Hey, it's my second Amber Forged, so I'm probably never going to see one again. Ah, oh, Amber, nice. Ah, oh, you did hydrate me. Sorry, we've got... Some of the alerts are just not uh, helping. Okay, so we can move on to incursions, because I think you mentioned that, yeah? Yeah, I haven't hit those yet. The first one is... Yes, made. Fiery, that, that's right. I'm the meme with the crying person with the smiling face mask on, yes. that that That's right now, yes. You can, um... Oh, have you ever played, uh... I feel like the answer's gonna be no, but <laughs> Pokemon. Ah, <laughs> uh, like just any Pokemon game? Violet or Scarlet. Oh, no, no, I have not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <sighs> oh, yeah, Grumpy, but aren't you the one who has like ridiculous luck and you've got a crap ton of Tau Forge shards? Or am I th mistaking you with someone else? I swear, I thought I thought it was you who said you have a way more than the numbers say you should by now. Some people just be blessed by that iron Jesus. Mm -hmm. Well, I figure it's, it's like an... I, I just think of it me. as unbreakable. I suffer so that someone else may flourish, you know? I always say to my chat that like... I, I, I always say that I'm, I um, give my luck, and so they all get my luck, so I have no luck. There you go. Yep. See, the see chat, I, I, uh... I suffer on Archon Shards so you can have them. That's, that's what it is. You all take a piece of me with you every time you get a good drop. And no... That it is thanks to the grace of me that you have this drop. Nice. I like. Wait, Grumpy's saying uh, he's not even the lucky one in his group. When when uh, the group started doing Sisters of Parvos, one of them had four sisters in a row that had ephemeras. Yeah, that'd be me. <laughs> Ephemeras come in streaks for me, but I always, I almost, without a doubt, always have shit luck on the elements. I've had a couple, I probably had a total of three or four in the 30, 40% range. The vast majority, like vast, vast majority are under 30% for all of my Kuva and Tenant weapons. Wait, wait, wait. Drifter melee combat? I'm sorry, what? The next dev stream, they're mentioning Drifter melee combat. I mean, yeah, because we're going to get the swords. Because didn't, hmm. didn't they show that during Tenocon? That okay, Marriott well, Dax I didn't... Gave you sword? I Obviously, I didn't see that. I I was camping I'm, I'm, during Tenocon, so I did not see that. And there was so much oh. going on. I'm like, I'm 
I'm not I'm not watching all that when I get back. I'm I'm happy for you. We're sorry that happened, but I'm not watching all that. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I could be misremembering, but because honestly, the majority of my brain at that point was flying pony. Um, <laughs> gotcha. um, Fair. But I think, I mean, I, I think they, they've been heavily implying that we will because we can, at least we used to be able to see the um, twin Dax blades in the Zeraman if we were on Drifter, but not as operator. Okay, interesting. Oh, well, that'd be nice. Oh, Grumpy, you you want to do some incursions? Darkfire, since we just did the Archon hunt with you, I don't know if you were looking to stay for incursions. Would you mind uh, swapping out so we can get Grumpy Pants in? Since yeah, you I did get your Tau Forge. Jet. Yeah, I saw. Thank you. Much appreciated, Grumpy. Thanks we got you. Thanks for joining, Darkfire. You were an yes, icon, thanks for a legend. Joining. Yes, I'm sure your luck also helped grab that Tau Forged. So, congrats to both of you. Hate you both just a little bit, but congrats. All right. Yeah, I got a comment about shield gating. So, for anyone who's wants to tail the yard, look at the name shield gating. If you think about what gates do, they block. So what they do is block from getting directly hit on your HP. There are some statuses that will ignore shield gating, um, but that's that's the general gist. Shields replenish, HP does not naturally replenish on its own. So the mm -hmm. idea is to use your shields to block getting one shot. And so utilizing mods that, or abilities that allow for um, over shield gaining or just general shield regeneration are paramount and surviving in higher levels of difficulty so that you don't get um one shot <laughs> but yeah well, like and the, the I think if you mention if you mentioned it I, I maybe i just went ooh squirrel for a second there but the the thing is when your shield is depleted you have a, every frame has a momentary uh it's like somewhere between one and three seconds i forget but one and three seconds of like iframes so once your shield is depleted you are invulnerable temporarily and uh, that's why people try to run very low shields so that it will replenish faster and you can do it 1.33 seconds. Okay. Thank you. That's really, really specific. One and a third seconds. Oh, yeah. You have these invulnerability periods. So ideally, the, f the lower your shield is, the faster it can replenish and then rinse and repeat. Yeah, that's a better way of saying what I was saying. Hey, together we got there, right? Yeah. I was just like, it blocks you from getting one shot. With, but the specific answer is that when you lose your shields, instead of it just going... So, like, if you take a thousand damage and you have, like, a hundred shields, then you would take the one hundred damage. That would all go, but the rest of the nine hundred gets negated. Unless it's, like, a toxin proc or something, then it doesn't give a the crap. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, those things that just bypass shields and armor, those, those will still get you. Yeah, but for the majority of damage that you'll take, that's that's the general gist of it. Oh, okay, Grumpy has more specific info. Uh, I think the number is 1.3 seconds of iframes if depleted from max shield. Yeah, 0.3 seconds if, if depleted from... Them. Yeah. So that's why people... That's specifically why, because... You do technically get some if it's not fully, but the most is if you have max. So if you can get it maxed faster, which is also why people will use frames like Mag or Hildren or put Pillage on um, frames and will use like the Argon mods because those will give you shields back as well. Um, mm -hmm. and that'll help you replenish a little bit faster. So all of that goes into um, just not getting one shot. <laughs> yep. And yeah, you can pair it with Rolling Guard, but it's not necessary because Rolling Guard is technically like you still have the shield gating eye frames, but mm -hmm. Rolling Guard can help you replenish shields if you are uncomfortable or don't have any of the aforementioned ways of making the shields come back faster. Yes, yes. Like I personally yeah. don't really use Rolling Guard that much, but... 
Yeah, but if it's you are specifically, like yeah, and if you are specifically trying to shield gate, decaying dragon key is very common because that helps lower your shield so that they can replenish faster. Unless you're on like Haro, then you kind of just want to have more shields. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Har Haro, Hildren, and Protea all just want over shields. And then of course, if you're uh, maybe making use of parasitic armor, you want more shields. So yeah. So like again, there's obviously some exceptions. Again, there are some statuses that will negate shield gating, but that's like the general gist. And the shield gating effect is universal to. Everywhere from that has shields. <laughs> Use. So, so, uh, you know, there's... not an Aros. Uh, yeah. Yep. But Knight is technically health gates. It's kind of the same thing, just with stacks. That's true. That's true. But you need an arcane for that, basically. Uh, to do it easier, anyway. You can do it with his abilities. But yeah, he kind of health gates, you're right. Yeah, that's what um, I think of it is. Because once you get like 100, you're just like, yep, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Buse, there are a couple ways to do that. Uh, Buse is asking what the augment uh, used in Sortie for auto-spying is, and there's not an augment. There's auto-breach for the Parazon that gives you a 30% chance to automatically hack something, but mm -hmm. what... Um, what I was using lady... was Perspicacity, yes. which is a Helminth ability, um, so you have to have the Helminth segment, and it's unlocked at, like, level... I want to say, like, three or five, I, like it's... I could check. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty low. Oh yeah, here it is. Perspicacity. Just to replace one of your abilities. Automatically succeed at your next hack attempt. 25% drain, 100% hack chance. Perspicacity. It's right up here on screen, Buse. Yeah, it's third. And it is my best friend. Because <laughs> that is 100% chance as long as you have energy. Yes. Yes, that somehow, I mean, last I checked, it's been a bit since I've taken a math class. I think 100% is higher than 30. But with that being said, you can also make things easier for yourself. And there are a couple mods that I really like using on spy missions with the pairs on. Um, and so one of them will turn you invisible for a set amount of time as you do a hack. So even if you're not playing like someone who turns invisible, you can gain invisibility. That is untraceable. Run ah, yes, I use also that one. gives you 75% sprint speed after hacking. So you can just do that, have your perspicacity ready, hack the next one and stay invisible. Because it's usually a couple that you would, um... That is, you just literally described my loadout. Untraceable, runtime, auto breach. Except, yeah. obviously, you're doing perspicacity. Yeah, but... so I have, I've like, the third one can be auto breach if you're not using perspicacity or ciphers, or if it's specifically for sortie, then, you know, you could have auto breach there if you're not running perspicacity. If you are, then you can put whatever you want there. Like, I just have live wire, because, like, whatever. <laughs> um, but if you do have perspicacity, then another one might be... Yeah, honestly, uh, live wire like, is solid. Mm -hmm. There's honestly not much. It literally, it's whatever because, like, fail safe is nice, but like, if you have a hundred percent chance, you don't need it. Yep. I mean, there's also, I guess, if you don't, you don't have ways of making yourself, you know, protecting yourself while you're hacking. There's also firewall reduces damage by seventy five percent while hacking. So, yeah, that's know, a good option. Damage yeah, reduction. Yeah. If you're not already invisible. <laughs> So yeah, you know, you can work around that how you want. But once you like know the roots of um of the hacks and yeah, it gets pretty smooth, pretty straightforward. All right, I think we're good. Uh, which one do we want to start with? Did I lose you? No, no, I'm still here. I'm just oh. answering your question. Oh, gotcha. Sorry. Yeah, you can queue up. It's fine. Okay. Actually, I don't know if this... So, something I used to do um, mm -hmm. when it comes to avoiding statuses is... I would have the amount of time memorized, and I would just go into Operator. 
when my Warframe would have a, a negative status effect, and then I would just swap back when it's over. Oh, I do that a ton still. Honestly, yeah. that is like just a great all around way to do that. Go into operator, go into void mode, and then when it's done, hey, go back. Yeah. yeah. So you know, because then you won't die. <laughs> yep. Especially if you've got uh, what Magus repair. You're sitting there healing your your frame too while you're in operator. I mean, why not? Warduck, do I remember slash know what primes are coming up next? Yes. Um, the order is always subject to discretion of DE, but based on prior release order, we should see Hildren coming up potentially in March. Um, we should see Wisp around Tenocon. We should see Gauss around September, October, and then yeah, Grendel around release. the end of the year. They'll probably do the Wisp showcase during Tenocon because she's just so hype for the community. Oh yeah, she's the one everyone's looking forward to. I don't think Hildren and Wisp will change places. Yeah. I could see Gauss and Grendel ch changing places because Grendel may feel like a, uh, you know, if they push it back to October, maybe a Halloween frame. Accept your death. I personally don't care about Gauss this year. I'm gonna be real. Training. My intel suggests that is I'm fair. excited for. My caches in the area, but I am unable to pinpoint their exact location. And then I think is next is next year when I. Wait, who's You're next year? No Gosh, I do not sensors. have the have all the releases have blurred in my brain at this point. Uh, Aprodia is next year. Who are the other three? Crap. I think Zaku's is next year. Zaku I don't know this year? specific. I, I want to say Zaku's next year, but like. Yeah, I think it's Zaku. I think it's Protea. I forget the other two. Oh, I switched frames. Oops, whatever. I meant to use um Zaku for this, hive. but every hive is protected by a series oh, of grumpy. Has there range. been a leak? Destroy those, and you can destroy the hive. Yeah, I haven't heard about any leaks, and I don't think either of us can really talk about any leaks either way, well, considering our creator status. I mean, the video. I'm sure that it was the tactical potato video. So, oh, I haven't seen it. Like I'm not yeah. lying when I say I haven't I, I haven't seen anything about it. I heard there may have been one, but yeah. That did it. Here comes the juggernaut. But yeah, unless unless things change, Stay most focused. I would assume that next approach. will be healed. And which makes sense because even even without that knowledge, um they usually like to have a prime release like teaser during Tenocon, and what better frame mm -hmm. to use than Wisp? Who yeah, has been Wisp is probably like build. the most popular frame since she came out. Oh yeah, she's gonna build tons of hype for Tenocon. Okay, stocky boy. And it's just Shadow Stalker. It's not even an Acolyte. Yeah, I don't care about him. I just want my skill. Up. I'm just gonna let one of my uh, oh, remember deal so, with him. So, so War Duck, that no, the leak that they were talking about that was talking about Hildren. Yeah. I mean, honestly, I thought it was gonna be Hildren for months. So. I mean, again, we most generally can guess. Generally, that we it's, know. It's, yeah, it's, it's it's for the most part release order. There's a few exceptions, like Anaros can up Planasia and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But for the most part, the most that you'll get is like a swap between like the ones that like came out together. You know? Yeah. Like I said, I could see potentially swapping Gauss and Grendel, but I think it's pretty safe to say Hildren and. Wisp are set in stone. Tenno, there are still undiscovered supply caches in the area. Uh, oh, that's a lot of death. <laughs> I'm I keep forgetting to, to uh, swap out my Smita. 100% keep forgetting. There's a heavy unit approaching. 
Aha! Enter the Limbo Void Rift. Yay! Safety to the end. Being a completionist, you only need one more part for Rhino Prime. Ah. Wow, I love how I just have big booty in my screen right now. Me too. I was like, crew member booty. Oh, Hi. Yeah. <laughs> you saw it too. I wasn't sure if it was just yeah. doing it for me. <laughs> nope. Nope. They're like, you abandoned me. This sh uh, should have been Steel Path Incursion, right? Yeah. We got five essence out of it. Okay. Yeah. 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 Grumpy was asking so what, uh, if it was accidentally like a nightmare mode with reduced shields or something. It was getting much lower iron, iron skin than usual. Mm. Oh, what fun we're going to have together. It's my favorite game mode, survival. <laughs> oh, we're doing survival. Okay, hold on. Let's go and uh, let's see. This this seems like I'm gonna bring up the dreams coming out. Yeah, oh, yep, yep. I'm not going to bring trusty then. Why we can both bring citrus? Why can't why can't we go double citrusy? What's wrong with that? That's too much juice in one place. You can't handle <laughs> my juice. I'm gonna go Garuda instead. Oh, uh, Garuda works too. Of course she does. Demon Doctor, hey, yes, me to change out. Yes, we don't need the speedo. We're not farming right. No, I don't need the Hurus Kubro. That's not what I wanted to go for. That's who I want. Hey, hey Zircoin. Doing all right, Demon. We're hanging in there. How about you? We are currently hanging out with Lady the Laddie. Just doing some Steel Path incursions and then... I don't think we had a plan for after that, did we? I love how we talked about the scout looking like a turkey. And now we've got two we've people running now, the right? scout. Yeah. <laughs> well, it was like, just that they both decided to run it. I'm probably going to switch to the parallax soon, but... I love, you know, showing off my Jackson Pollock painting. <laughs> Thank you for laughing at that. I thought it was funny. No, it was good. It was good. It deserved the laugh. Either that or my demented ice cream truck. Life support has been cut off. They're trying to choke you out. Hold on. Yeah, that's better than the plain white panel van, you know. Oh wait, why am I? Oh, that's right, I'm Garuda. I don't need to sit here waiting for energy. I just use my blood magic. Yeah. Garuda is energy. Roar! I'm gonna cut your face off! You believe you can fly? Do you believe you can touch the sky? Chillin' Demon? Ah, did you have cross today? Or did you have a rare off day? Get ready for a capsule. Is there some, somewhere we all just want to post up, or hmm? is there somewhere we all just want to post up and basically uh, farm enemies? I am just 
killing things, and as long as <laughs> that okay. happens, I and we're not like suffocating, then I feel like we're Gucci. Okay, that works. I can roll with that. You had class, then you decided not to go to the next class. You're at home eating chicken and rice. Nice! Ooh, chicken and rice, okay. that's a vibe. Alright. We'll go down on some chicken and rice. Love that. Life support would you would you eat my uh, my cruise ship? Put some rice on that. Mm. Life support I prefer chicken to turkey, but I consider it. I'm just saying, um, you know, if you have concerns about the edibility of my ship, just remember that the ore can eat buildings. My bigger concern would be Tenno stuffing or no. I feel like that would be cannibalism, so, you know. Uh, I mean, wasn't made out of what? Like a variant of the Hellman's virus? So, like... Mm. I've delivered another light Still feels castle. weird. <laughs> yeah, you can take it without the stuffing, though, you know? Just, okay, just okay. Go, go, go for the outside and go the inside. That's what a lot of people do, you know? They just ignore what's inside. They just care about what's outside. Wait, 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 wait. What, what do you mean broccoli is the devil demon? You don't like broccoli? Broccoli is fine. I'm more yeah, what's wrong with broccoli? Myself. Wait, what's your opinion on okra? <laughs> I feel like I've, I think I've had it before, and oh yeah, yeah, we've we've had it in uh, Southern cooking. Like if you cook it right, it's really good. On its own, it's it's fine. Okay. Uh, there there are definitely ways. There are correct ways to cook it for sure. I I would agree with that in, wholeheartedly. They're cooked wrong, they just kind of start turning into a slimy mess. <laughs> Support incoming. Uh. Where the hell did my primary go? Might have gotten stolen by an enemy. Apparently. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, I see it. Got rid of the lunch. Hey, one down. We'll get ten. Uh, well, actually, no. That's a lie. I'm only gonna get seven. And it would have been nine, not ten. <laughs> I can math, Demon I promise. tried. Ah. When you Sorry, ready, go ahead. Go to extraction. Oh no, it wasn't relevant. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't even know why I would. Like, I, I don't know. My brain just didn't register for some reason. Like, I knew you were still talking. I was listening. And then my brain was like, hey, read this. And my mouth said, say this. No, like literally, it's, hard it's fine. I wasn't even like I wasn't even like I was finishing. I wasn't really saying ah. anything. Tenno, prepare for life yeah. support. Yeah, just uh, reading. Demon actually did try broccoli today, and hated it. Said said shit's awful, basically. Well, at least you tried it. I mean, I'll give you that. I just want to know, like. Did I have it some kind of way? Cause like, broccoli. Yeah, how was it prepared? That can make a difference too. I mean, like, I've, had it that, just... I've had that stuff raw and just dipped it in some ranch sauce and called it a day, so I'm not sure I'm the best person to <laughs> judge that. Yeah, like, was it just steamed, no, no seasoning or anything, or was it cooked in butter with some salt and pepper, like what? What are we talking here?
Well, I don't mind it in, in Chinese food, Warduck. I think it's got a place in there in certain dishes. Six seconds till extraction, unless we all step off. They fought well. Brook Prime finished Death cooking. Nice, Mystical. Home. Why wouldn't you steam it? Come on, man. So, okay, so you steamed it, you put nothing on it? That's why. Yeah, yeah, you see... I mean, I need, you, I need a raw, so... <laughs> there, there are people who like it that way, for sure, but... Oh, a little seasoning. There, and there are different ways to prepare it. Honestly, there are people who melt uh, cheese on top of broccoli, too. Yeah, like, the broccoli and, like, a cheddar cheese or something. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Are the you garlic a big fan of no, that's good. Or, um, oh, that is good. Hey, old Escorial. Hey! Dovakin, welcome in. Said, I hope the Operation Plague Star returns soon. You're missing the Plague Kiwar. It was at this um, moment that he knew. He You can up. actually get that from the Nabarus events too, but Plague Star... Uh, is, is Plague Star the one where you can get a bunch of Forma? Or am I confusing that with something else? Which one is it that you can farm a bunch of Forma? What? Forma? Yeah. Was that Plague Star uh, or is that a different event? Uh, Plague Star. It is Plague Star. Okay. I want it for that. But, so the Plague QR is the last Zaw you're missing then? Nice. Yeah, Nabarus comes during October, but I don't know. They didn't do Plague so, Star last year, so yeah, Plague Star so should come this year. Like it seems to be like they do it like every other year at this point. Yeah. And they've made like Nabarus like the the Accept yearly your one. And you may yet yep. avoid it. Trust in your training. My oh bid, your partner's a chef? That's that's area, lucky. But I am unable to pinpoint their exact location. Search them out if you are willing to shoulder the added risk. Uh why why does New War Wait, 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 hold on. Yeah, why does New War make Plague Star so much more work for him? Elberth, what am I missing? Having never done Plague Star. Oh, because Plague Star is on, uh... Uh, yeah, I can kind of see that. They kind of have to sort of rework it with the new map, but I don't think... I don't know. I'm not a game designer, so yeah, I don't know. At 300 plus forma from speedrunning Plague Star last time it was active. Uh, yeah, I could use that. Holy crap, that would be amazing. Yeah, the only th like I I only do Plague Star for the forma, and it is grueling because like you just do it for so long. It's, oh yeah. It's like worth and yet it for I'm the forma, but it's like not worth it for my brain. <laughs> mm. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. Uh, everyone has different limits for it, that's for sure. Don't you agree with this sentiment that if you have a friend and you and your friend like different foods? that, like, it's a great thing because you know that they're not going to ask to share with you. That's true, yes. Like, uh, like if you are, you know, the pickle friend, but you have friends who don't like pickles, you always get their pickle, right? Exactly. That would be me, except I, I, like, I'd be giving you the pickle. I don't like pickles. And I would take that pickle. I like the pickles. So, yeah, see, there you go. That is yeah. perfect. Yeah, no, hey, no. Kind of my crack. chat is How like, doing? is there banana bread slander? And I'm like, I'm sorry, I don't like bananas, and I don't like them in bread. Like, I don't like bananas either. I, I thought I was alone in that. Everyone I run into is always like, what, what's wrong with you? Like bananas the, the, are the, fine. The texture, the taste. Like, I can taste a banana when it's in a smoothie, and I hate it. I can, too. All I taste is banana. Right? That's all I taste. It's so strong. I'd rather you, it like, is. I need apple. I need apple as my base. Oh, yeah. I, I like mango. 
if that's available. That's a good base. Mingo's, Mingo's good too. Jupiter. Hey, if you like bananas, Meep, that's fine. It's just, it is too There's strong. For, it's a, I'm not a big fan of the taste, and it just is overpowering whenever it's mixed with something. Thank you. Which is probably Thank just, you. Thank you. Yeah. I, like, I swear, everyone, everyone, I mean, everyone always makes the joke, like, oh, you don't like bananas? Like, yeah, I don't. Like, I don't like nuts. <laughs> don't like pickles. Not a huge fan of cucumber by itself. Like, I'm picky. But like, cucumbers I, I are like, fine in things. Uh, by yeah. itself, no, I don't need yeah, it. Yeah, no, like, like if you have like if you put like a diced you cucumber and like a salad, I'll eat it. I'll eat it. I won't particularly enjoy it, but like I can tolerate it. Yep. Oh, uh, Lisbeth says it sounds like uh, her and spinach. She just she can't. <laughs> There's no way for her to not taste the spinach. I love spinach. It doesn't blend in, it's just... Yeah. Like, if, if you give me a leafy green, I'll probably eat it. Like, collard, bok choy, does that count? It's a leaf. I think it counts. Spinach. Kale. Like, those are, those are mine. Oh, you're getting updated the steak supply are getting local beef nice nice bid the enemy will not be returning anytime soon Tenno, there are still undiscovered supply all the lasers the as I just like go through four of them leaving. hey damage reduction go burr what are you are you waffles or pancake ooh like you can only choose one for the rest of your life. They Which one are you choosing? Well. Good dance, all. Probably waffles. Pancakes get a oh little too, wow, too thick. Oh my gosh! Wow, we have taste right here. I yeah. love a waffle. Yeah. Well, look at that. Like for me, like I like I respect a pancake. I respect I a do. pancake, don't I do. get me wrong, mm -hmm. I'll eat a pancake, I'll enjoy a pancake, but like, mm -hmm. I don't know, if I had to choose between the waffle and the pancake, I'm choosing a waffle. Waffles are more fun, like, what's a pancake? It's just, it just flops there. There's no artistry, it's just, it's just there. I know, I have had some, some good, like, specialty pancakes for sure, but the, I think pancakes are always, like, just, they're always going to be really rich, and they're always going to be like, I don't know, like, cakey and almost too filling. Like, you can have yeah, too can much of a that. pancake very quickly. Yeah. <laughs> My wife's going, shush, pancakes are delish. Lies. <laughs> pancakes are good. Like, like don't get me We're wrong. We're not I saying they're not. not. We're just saying if you we can only waffles. have if, one if, or like, the I'm gonna other. Choose one, I'm going to choose waffles. And that's not even bringing in, like, French toast into the mix. I'd still choose a waffle, I think. Because I could just make a French yeah. toast waffle. Oh, hon, was it was it a special pancake I had when we were in Philly a few years back that I really loved? I know it was some sort of breakfast. It was okay. See if I could it now if I could have that one that I can barely remember what it was. I would probably oh, go with pancakes. You know Craig, right? Kind of Craig. <laughs> yeah, he he just he, he's in chat. He said hi. He was talking about want to buy fire rate. Which are you saying my uh, my shotgun's too slow, Craig? So. Oh, lemon Craig ricotta is, pancakes, he actually just said. Yeah, no, Craig is out here being like one of those. I could change them. <laughs> I, I can change, change your, them. I could change your mind about pancakes. I'm like, okay, sure. Are, <laughs> are you offering, offering to make us some pancakes? I mean, if we're talking I mean, about Craig a get together and cook. Craig's making pancakes. I've seen some of the stuff he makes on the street. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I don't doubt that I'll enjoy the pancake. Because I don't hate pancakes. Exactly. Waffles. You know? <laughs> I get it. I get it. I think between a crepe and a pancake, though, it really depends on my mood, but I think I generally would go for a crepe. 
you can go sweet, you can go savory on crepes. I feel like pancakes tend to always lean sweet. And when it comes to breakfast, I, I lean go. savory. So I like crepes for the versatility. Yeah. I I like crepes because they're lighter, generally. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's also like, fair. Like, like pancakes, you get a stack of them and like... Yeah, you're done for the day. A crepe, yeah. I could like eat that and I could be full, but not too full. But, and also, like you mentioned, you can have them like dessert, you could have them savory, like... Yeah, versatility, it's easier to, uh, you know, feel like, yeah, you don't overstuff yourself, you can control the intake a little bit better. Yeah, I like it. Lots, lots of reasons to prefer crepes there, for sure. What, do you have an invigoration for your rally, Craig? Because I don't remember that in her passive. 200% fire rate on everything. Oh, you know Craig is the one tricky rally at this point. Oh, yeah. New augment. Oh. Two pistols. Okay. Yeah, you said everything just now, and I'm like, I'm, use I'm, I'm using Archiplasma. That's a shoddy. You sure? She doesn't seem to like shoddies. Zircoin says, since when are pancakes heavier than waffles? Just what kind of pancakes do you eat? They just, I, they, I feel like they sit heavier. It's not that they actually are heavier. Just once yeah, I've eaten them. I think them, they kind of are. <laughs> like if you were just to hold a crepe and then you'd hold a pancake. The crepe oh no, pancakes lighter. and waffles, I think was the oh. comparison on that. I think, uh, I think Zircoin was backing up going, wait, that, what you said makes no fucking sense. Streamer, excuse me. I don't know, for yeah. some reason, the, the cakey batter for pancakes just just sits heavier for me than waffles. For me, I think it's, it's, a, it's a couple of things. I'm a very visual person, and I just the look of a waffle. Like, a pancake, just like like I said, it just sits there. Like, it's a stack of pancakes. Like, okay, cool. Mm. Like, <laughs> a waffle, though, like, you have those divots. You can, you know, you can be like, it, you can have like an artistic experience. Like, would mm. I rather Instagram a waffle or a pancake? Waffle. 100% a waffle. <laughs> um, but two. Two. I think, like, portions are different. And that could be part of it. But, like, you know, you get one thick Belgian waffle and it's perfect. Mm. Perfect sizing, perfect amount. Like, you know, it's there's no there's no like big contest of like, oh, can I finish this? Like, no, you can finish the waffle. It's, a, it's like it's fine, and then you'll be good. But then the pancakes, you know, you have like a stack of like three or something, and you're just like, I should be able to finish yep. this, but for some reason I can't. And yeah. I want to. And but, I like, think that's I, part of it. Just culturally, we we stack pancakes, so we always are going in with. You can't just have one pancake. And a stack is rarely two. It always feels like it's three, though. There are some I places like where they do two. Yeah. And then it's just like, oh my god, I never should have had half that by the time you realize you need to stop. Because I think I think what they do is that like a waffle height is similar to like two or three pancakes. But like two or mm -hmm. three pancakes is not the same dimension as a singular waffle. Yeah, like visually <laughs> it tricks you into better portions. Yes. Oh, Grumpy, congrats. Qualified for rank 29. Nice. Hey, yo. Yeah. Oh, hey, uh, speaking of waffles, though, you'll love this. When we stayed in Belgium a few years back, one of the places we stayed was actually an apartment directly over a waffle shop. We had to enter through the waffle shop to get up to oh, the apartment. Oh, no, that'd be so difficult for me. <laughs> it was an experience. I would, I'd just be like, hmm, what are they cooking today? Like, what type of waffle should I... A wallet wouldn't like me and probably not my stomach either. Yup, yup, yup. It was a challenge. It always smelled great. My wife's just going, I disagree with so much of this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> Do 
but see, this is why you're good together because you mm -hmm. have the waffles, she gets the pancakes. Like, well, see, that's the thing. When it comes to breakfast, I always get the savory. She always gets the sweet, and she always nudges me into sharing because she wants both. And you know, I'm down for a taste of the sweet, but generally, I want the savory. So, kind of works out there, right? Do you have a favorite donut? My chat is is moving to next. I, I guess we're in a food day. <laughs> donut. Favorite donut. I um, think for me it would have to be like a jelly. But like, I don't know. I would pretty much eat any donut until... At least until you start getting into those like really weird donuts. Because like, a donut's just generally going to be like sweet. It could be savory, I guess. But like, generally it's going to be sweet. <laughs> I'm not like, huge on donuts. I prefer, I actually prefer like the ones that are more cake batter than the traditional ones. Cause I'm just, I don't, I don't know. I'm just not big like on the donuts. The heavier ones, like the old fashioned yeah. mm -hmm. I'm See, I'm generally a fan of the fluffier ones. Oh, uh, Grumpy's game crashed. If we can hang here for a minute. Let Never. Gump, let Why, Gumpy uh, you think I can relaunch? You think, you think I was born in the era of technology and internet to be patient? No. <laughs> no. I, you want it, and you want it now. Exactly. I only have to wait oh. wait one second for a website to load. You have a better connection than I do. That war duck. Well, you like apple fritters, huh? Nice. Ooh, apple fritters. I feel like I've had those before. But yeah, I don't really have a strong opinion on, on donuts. Like, I'll just, eat, like, if a donut's there, I'll eat it. <laughs> like, it's hard to go wrong with a donut, I feel like. Unless it's coconut on it. Oh, I hate coconut. The coconut works on certain things. I'm not going to just have it on all the time, but on certain mm. things, it can be very good. Mm -mm. Not for me. Coconut has been. I, I was already like on the fence with coconut growing up. I, I have a very distinct memory of coconut mashed potatoes and oh lord. Coconut mashed potatoes. I'm yeah. sorry. Did you? Yeah. You didn't misspeak. That was actually the, that yeah. combination of words was supposed to go together. Yeah. It was a holiday okay. meal, and I was forced to sit at the table until I finished what was on my plate, and I refused to because that ish was nasty. This isn't your regular vault job. Allied oh. sold the conduits with interference. And I'm guessing that came from family who did not live in the house. They they, they brought that over as their dish to pass, I'm, I'm assuming. No, that was my mother. Oh. Yeah, there's a reason that I... She's had many a interesting moment when it comes to cooking. She loves to, like, imply that she's a decent cook. And I guess she can be. But, you know, by the time we were, like... 10 we were probably cooking mostly our own meals anyway so <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's fair that's fair but yeah no it's because we have a lot of allergies in our house so like it was her attempt at like doing a mashed potato without like cow milk oh. and it did not hit and she's like oh i asked the type and like, saw they made theirs and they said coconut milk and i was like no no yeah, that that was rancid. Anyway, mm. TLDR, I do not like coconut. <laughs> Fair. Oh, so my wife informs me the uh, the pancake that I loved in Philadelphia was uh, apparently a Reese's, you know, like uh, it was basically a Reese's peanut butter cup pancake. So chocolate peanut butter. I can't peanut butter either. Very nice. <laughs> Oh, peanut butter is one of my favorites. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 I just. Oh no. Like. Oh. I get nauseous thinking about peanut butter. It's not gonna nope. break. Yeah. Nope. Conduit down. Oof. Oh, that was the donut from in town? Oh, it was cookie dough! Okay, never mind. I misread it, so, no. Reese's Peanut Butter Cup was a apparently a donut in town I liked, but in Philly, it was a cookie dough that was amazing. 
cookie dough pancake. Oh, cookie dough is solid. I'm um, afraid ice cream is cookies and cream. That's a solid choice. Well, I, I, I definitely my may have in ingested a fair amount of raw cookie dough against um, recommendations when I was younger. You know. I'm sure I'm not the only one. Okay, I'm Who needs to cook it? completely honest. Oh, are you talking about eating cookie dough raw? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, cake batter cookie dough. It's kind of a wonder I know like salmonella or something, but whatever. <laughs> exactly. You know what? We will cross that bridge when we come to it. Right? Blown. Mate, oh shit, we're not doing well here. Oh, we'll get to the next round, but yeah. Yes, peanut butter can be eaten right from the spoon. Agreed. Just like Nutella. Oh no. Don't don't get me started on peanut butter spoon. Okay, oh, what about Nutella? God. I assume you also don't like Nutella? I'm indifferent to Nutella. Okay. I don't eat it though, but like I don't have like horrible memories attached to it. Part this mortal coil and take you with it. Keep it clear of that conduit. Hey, Mordok says eaten. Okay, yeah, you don't quite really eat it off the spoon like that. I get, I get what you're saying. I hear you. You're coming from up here. This is a tanky motherfucker, and I didn't bring armor strip on this frame. Oh. Uh, actually, I did my Vulpophila. Someone stripped it. There we go. Not going home yet. We just got here. How do you say your name? Because I always feel like I say your name weird. Like your username. Oh. Alright, I just say Kodoma. I don't know why every time I say it, I feel like I'm saying it wrong. <laughs> And if it makes you feel any better, a uh, buddy of mine who, who streams, does some variety streaming, um, he's always been calling me Kodama, and I never bothered to correct him because yeah, it was always sure funny to me. Like, yeah. I, Kodoma I, I, is I, how I pronounce it. Uh, he was saying Kodama, so he's putting the, the emphasis in a different spot. Yeah, I feel like I have like a weird emphasis somewhere, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Ragamuffin. Yeah, we're doing the Steel Path Incursions. I think this is the last one. I think. Honestly, this uh, all turn into like a big old blur. <laughs> yeah, just did one after the other. Oh, red. Oh, crap. I'm nowhere near the one we need to be defending. Which one are we defending? I'm so confused. Oh, I don't know, but I see the dude in front of us, so I'm just going to smack him. <laughs> that works. I think I do not have Unaru equipped, so that's fun. I don't either. No, I probably should have switched Warframe before I started doing this. But I wasn't thinking. Yeah, I... It's... Oh, Teal. We're over there. Okay. What the heck do I have equipped for me? Teal, Cyan, whatever. What is my school? <laughs> I'm on Zeneric because I finally oh, swapped it up earlier when I was uh, when I was working with Rhino and I was like, this will help me get Iron Skin or I was sooner, like, I don't and then I never I have on it right now. Yeah, it's with zero.
Hey, buddy, old pal. Hey, What's doing, it's, violence? It's violent. Ah, oh, he silenced me. Uh, okay, I get well, I'm gonna see. I get, I get the phrase now. Gonna... Silence is violence. I've never heard that before. Thank you for enlightening me to this phrase. Really? You haven't heard that before? Nope. I have a feeling we're going to be resetting this one. It's looking that way, isn't it? Do we just want to do it? Do we, do we just want to reset? Nah, let's see what we can get, get away with here. I mean, okay. <laughs> oh, hey, house gas. Hi. Hey, pal. You're a jerk. I can't believe you really did that to me. I thought we were friends. No, I've been shooting you in the face friend. this whole time. Once is never your friend. Oh, he drained my energy. I see the violence inherent in the system. Yup. Uh, oh, energy drain. He didn't drain it. Of course, we, we failed the defense there. Aha, uh -huh. that's why. Reading is your friend, chat. Oh, of course, I actually get enough energy to cast my three, and then I go into a nullifier. That's skill. Isn't that so hot? That's, like, so hot of you. Yeah, th I love that is nullifiers. so hot. They're, like, they're just, like, all over me. Like, damn, they're, like, the biggest paparazzi. I get unpopular, whatever. <laughs> I mean, you do love Limbo, so you are familiar with nullifiers. I am familiar with a lot of things. Hmm. They're my biggest fans, they love me, they'll follow me until they think I love them, but I never will. Oh, he's coming up here. He's been armor stripped. Come on. Crap. Well, we are not doing well. Ah. Uh. We need two more. We just need... Two more successful, and we're not, we're struggling. Yeah, I I'm still playing hey, to reset. <laughs> if you all, if you all want to reset, we can do that. We're clearly not. I feel like, not I feel like doing we well. can just reset, fix our loadout, and be done. With it. <laughs> that works. Do we want to do that? Grumpy jam. You all feeling like resetting? Hey, I'm down too. It feels like we do not have the right loadout for this. Hello. One hit and Oh, okay. That's right on the zero and so I have an insta, right? Sorry, what was that? Oh no, I was like, wow, you got up real fast, and I was like, oh. Have a zero in. There we go. I killed things. I got myself up. Yeah, everyone's going down. I kind of say just. I reset. think we've got the wrong loadouts. We need to reset. Yeah. We have I energy agree. drain. We have magnet anomalies. Like I don't know how well any of y'all can cast things right now. <laughs> I can't cast a damn thing, that's why I keep going down, cause yeah. my survivability is my third ability that I can't cast. Luckily, so. I am Garuda, so I have infinite energy no matter what, but can't say the same for the rest. <laughs> Alright, so we want to abort, is that the plan? Sounds like I the plan. Am, I am clicking the abort button. Alright. Let me abort, don't just, come on, there we go. Hey, Giovanna. Hardest game I've ever played. Hmm. That like, is a good question. I, well, I have played Battletoads, and that's generally considered one of the hardest games of the like NES era, so... 
Possibly that. That grumpy says I feel like I french fried when I should have pizzaed. Uh, the internet has worked decently well today so far, huh? All right, let's try this again. Eighty platinum for a Nagana River, nice. All right, I'm not sure we want to go with Zephyr here. Maybe we want to go this route. Yeah, we'll give this a shot. No rush for anyone, just whenever y'all are ready. I'm going to shovel four feet of snow. Oof. I haven't even looked outside to see how bad ours is. Oh, I've heard like Snowmageddon is happening. <laughs> yeah, we're Can supposed we to be... SoCal. There's a reason we normally aren't around Michigan this time of year, but... Uh... Yeah, I, I probably should have told you. I told chat earlier, if I suddenly disconnect, like we were literally told it's an ice storm. So, you know, power line could be weighed down with ice. Could be an issue with like a breaker or something somewhere. So if I just suddenly disconnect, I may have completely lost Internet. We'll see. It's totally fine. Last time I was dying of COVID, so. <laughs> yeah. You know, things come up. Life happens, right? It is, you know, life happens, and it is what it is, you know, like, we just, mm -hmm. we just, big, we just we take it as it comes, you go with the flow. And see, like, that, that, that's just my general take on life, you know, you can have your yeah. plans, you can plan things out, but, you know, go with the flow, because you can't control diddly squat 90% of the time. <laughs> exactly. Really. Yeah. Like, and the best skill in life you can learn is how to adjust whatever the hell life throws at you, so... Very big mood. Yup. How quickly can you can you pivot once life decides to be like? Uh -oh. mm hmm. Grumpy, you okay. should be feeling very fortunate for that. Grumpy said, "I feel fortunate to have never needed to shovel snow in my life." Yes, you I've should. I've never had to shovel snow. Uh, yeah, I never did. I was. I they did snow down here a few years ago, and it was very bizarre. Um, I bet. <laughs> Galley, yeah. If you're not up yeah. in the mountains, well, that seems yeah, no, weird. Yeah, specifically just... SoCal. Like, NorCal so makes yeah. sense. SoCal, it was mm -hmm. like... I, I distinctly remember seeing Frozen 2 when it was snowing, and I was like, I never thought that would happen. <laughs> nice. Oh, Ragamuff, man, you picked up Citrine today? Yeah, she's she's been fun. I've got... What have I got? Three or four Forma into her. She's been fun. Giovanna, what do you mean at least we have snow? I would trade you. If you want snow, I do not want snow. You want to trade? It gets old real quick. That's how I feel. I like, you know, when I was looking outside, I was like, you know, this is kind of nice as long as I don't have to deal with it. <laughs> exactly. You know? If it's not a regular thing. But it only takes a day or two to go from fluffy white and pretty looking to dirty and gray and disgusting. And then, of course, there's all of the uh, all of the shoveling, the driving in it, the cold, the wet. Like, uh. yeah. Because I think I think what people forget is that snow is really just cold water, and the moment it hits you, it's just gonna start melting, and then you're gonna be covered in sloppy slush. Mm -hmm. And who wants sloppy slush? That's why I don't like rain. I don't like feeling wet, un like not under my control. Like I wanna be yep. wanna be wet. If I'm going to the beach, or I'm going to the pool, or I'm taking a bath or shower. Yep, exactly. Otherwise, I'm like, ew, water, earth, stop pissing on. 
Demo units on its way. Look at how quickly everything goes. E I E. Wait, I hear the first one. All right. I'm gonna. Oh, I hear him too. One down. One down, three to go. Oh, oh, oh. It's magic. You know. Better believe it's not so. There's so many darn nullifiers around here. Right? I'm trying not to go into them so my gloom stays on. I just right, I've got the white key. All of my stuff. I've got the red key. We're going to do yours first or mine? I'm already here, so me. You're there, <laughs> yours. All right. <laughs> oh, we got an electrified conduit. How do you like that? Really shocking, isn't it? But don't tush. I hear this bastard. Where are you? Oh, you got it. Okay, nice. All right, white next, I guess. If I can figure. Nope, not that way. I'm going the wrong way. Wait, you get you get hail, Giovanna. You don't get snow. You just straight get hail. That's messed up. Oh, I think one of my siblings was getting hail. That's what I was getting from like the family texts. I didn't really read them. <laughs> Part of it would like pop up every so often and be like, hmm. Demo Sounds like weather is happening. Oh, thanks, Ragamuffin Man. Glad we got the uh, the sounds balanced well. It's taken a lot of uh, messing around. You know, I never asked my key. chat if, if things were good. I'm assuming so, because no one said anything. Is that they're too nice to say that you're, like, overpowering me? Yeah, initially they were saying you were a little strong, but I had you up to 200% on my stream because you were, you know, not feeling well last stream, so I was boosting yeah. you. Yeah, I'm generally kind of loud. People need to turn me down. Yeah, now I've dropped you back to, like, 95% and we're good. Dan is going down. Not Dan. Not Dan. It's okay. Dan is a strong, independent Dan and can get up themselves. Good for Dan. Yeah. But don't you wish you had that capacity? Oh, wait, we do. <laughs> it's called, uh... What is it called, actually? Ah, that one focus school that we all have, but we, yeah, uh... Yeah, I, I just call it Bootleg Borderlands. <laughs> yeah, there you go. But like I don't actually know what the what it's actually it has a it has a name. Last gasp, I think. Yes, that one. That sounds right. Oh. Yeah. It's misery. Miss Airy. Oh well, okay, Miss Airy. Did you not want to tell me what you got on my report card this time? Oh, it's the last one. I don't this. know what he's into, but I'm gonna stand right here and punch you up. See, all we have to do is get the right squad, get the right uh, yeah. gear going. Poke you in the back. Or... Yeah, there we go. There, there we, we go. go. We're gonna stop him. Right. Same again. All right, gloom definitely helped there. I feel yeah, like that really last one wasn't on even this. moving. Let's see, hail happened once on a Sunday. Not even on the more popular area, just on the mountain. Oh yeah, yeah, that makes sense. 
Your will was greater. That definitely makes so sense. Hey, Mr. Chicky Dog Man. Welcome. How you doing? And it's just such a great series of emotes. I always love that entrance. Hanging in there. We're doing all right. We're hanging out with Lady the Laddie. And just ah. having some fun. So much fun together. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're getting me full power today. Hey, that yeah, works for me. <laughs> works for me. I I need a laugh. That works. You know, it's really oh. interesting. I, I was saying this earlier, but like, I don't know. A lot of people seem to find me funny. <laughs> Which is like news to me for some weird reason. <laughs> So I hope that's not an insult then. No, I mean, it's it... not an insult. It's just that like I don't okay. like think I'm funny. I just I just think I spit facts. <laughs> hey, I crack myself know? up, but I don't think I'm and funny that, to other people. But like I guess uh, I do. <laughs> other people disagree with you, so hey, you know that is not an easy talent to just naturally be able to make people laugh. So yeah, something to be proud of. All right, so I think we're at that crossroads of yeah. What do you want to do? What sounds like, good? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. What do you want to do? I mean, if, if if nothing else, there's always Nightwave, I guess. There's <laughs> Nightwave, popping relics. I'm sure we have people who still need to do the Dream Farm. Yeah, I could mind. Unless you're burnt out on that. that. I I mean. This is like the only time I'll do it because I don't have to do anything. I just hop around and mm. pretend I'm useful. <laughs> gotcha. Yeah. So chat, speak up. What all do you want to see or possibly hop in for? That goes for both chats, by the way. You still have to do Thermia Fractures and Exploiter Orb? Is 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 Thermia Fractures? Yeah, Thermia Fractures are going on right now. Huh. All right, Grumpy's saying if we're down, needs to do some Thermia Fractures and Exploiter Orb. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind Exploiter Orb. I'm not a big fan of Thermia Fractures. See, I'm not a fan of either of them. I have like this rule where I just don't do spiders. But if you want me to uh, um, sit in the lobby while oh. y'all do Exploiter and I just sit there because I'm not I'm not touching it. <laughs> oh, crap. You know, you know what? I just realized. So, you know how I, I mentioned earlier, Streamlabs alerts are not working. Yeah. Craig was hanging out, hanging out in my chat because Craig raided. Ah, well, that makes sense. I thought I saw Craig yes. um, around earlier. And I was Craig, like, hmm. if you're still there, I'm sorry I missed it and the alert didn't go off. It's Streamlabs, it's not me. I do appreciate it. Hello, Raiders. It's been 40 minutes, though. So. Oh. Oof. Wow. You gotta love it when your tech does not work with you. I feel like, like a jerk. You now. gotta, I mean, don't feel like a jerk. Just know that, like, as a streamer, your brain hardly works, so... That's Is true. it a surprise that tech, like, fails you? At least this time you don't have to blame the brain. Yeah. At least it's the tech and not me screwing up. It's normally the tech is set up to alert me. That's what an alert is for. Yeah. Let's see. You know, How much for a full squad of hydroid steel path survival? Zircoin's asking how much to have a full squad of Hydroid on Steel Path Survival. That sounds... I think, like, you said it best earlier. Like, what am I going to do? Go on a puddle? Like, what? Hmm. see. Imagine if they added Steel Path Empyrean missions. Osprey drones would be terrifying. Eh, could be for sure. 
All right, so so far the only vote for next content other than the, I'm assuming, Joe Kydroid comment has been Thermia I mean, and... Hydro unless, it's, unless, it's, unless it's Prime Hydroid. Hydroid is just Vayhack. No, no, it's like no, the the vote was... Uh, Zircoin was asking how much to have a full squad on Hydroid for Steel Path survival. You mean Hydron? Hy Hydroid, no, the frame. Like, play as Hydroid, full squad, Steel Path survival. Oh. You know, Piss Puddle Prime? No, no, I, I, know, I know, I know. I was just, I was okay. just, it was phrased weird in my brain. <laughs> gotcha, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, um, how much is it would willing? be a technical and spectacle? I'm just saying, I mean, I wouldn't be opposed as long as we split it. <laughs> if I'm coming. <laughs> How much we talking? Uh, like, yeah, yeah. How how, how much we talking, Zircoin? I still need to get myself a new PC. So, like, oh, Grumpy, you don't need to feel bad. You never know how people are gonna. You never know what kind of content people like. That's why there's so much different content. So. Grumpy yeah. was feeling bad for bringing up Thermia Exploiter. Oh, like yeah, I said, no, I don't, like, never I, I like, I actually bad. like the Exploiter fight. Yeah, you don't have to feel bad. That's why there's so much different content. Yeah, Just like, no, like... You can bring it up, and if we're like, and then, you know, maybe it gets shot down. It does, at least you suggested something. See, I always feel bad about shooting down the thing, because, like, they're like, oh, this is something I need, and I'm just like, ooh, but, like, I really just don't want to do that, and I'm now the the asshole like is this like that am i the asshole reddit now mm, i mean hello reddit um wait. someone in my chat asked if i wanted to do this thing and the thing is i really just didn't want to <laughs> am i the asshole yeah. i mean yeah we all have those moments but nah it's like like that's that's the thing you can always say no to things so it's it's all good uh, let's see. In my defense, my hate for Thermia comes out comes from the fact that I was around when Thermia Fractures first came out, and I know they've been made to be a lot better, but those starting ones, oh my god. That yeah. was not a fun grind at all. Clearly I didn't do them initially, but, um, okay, we have a couple other options. Maybe Farm Litcher Sisters and Barrow's Coming Friday, Relic Popping would be good ideas. Those were suggested. I was going to say for Thermia Fractures, back when I started, um, it was right around. Oh, what's that uh, summer event with Kayla to Thane? Dog Days. Yeah, the... Dog Days, yes. It was are right over. around Dog Days. Dog Days are over. So, yes, yes, Dog Days. So I, I, I was farming Dog Days, and then it ended, and, you know, I didn't quite get everything I wanted out of it. And then Thermia Fractures came up after that, and being a new player, I'm like, uh oh. It's going to be a year before these come back. I've got to grind the crap out of this. I think you all know the how quickly I discovered that was not true and how much I hated getting from rank 0 to rank 100 on them to get the Optic or Vandal within yeah. just a few days. Yeah. Yeah. It's really a thing that you want to do with the full squad because then you can all just grab the little thingies and you just shove them all in and then you do one big one for... The mm. four and uh, it was rough. Eh. Guess chat doesn't want to get in on that uh, hydroid thing and bully it and bully us into doing it. Sorry, Zork going. Oh, Ragamuffin, you did the same thing. Oh, I'm not the only one. Yay. I was, All you know, right. Since people were talking about fissures, I was like really like, oh my god, if they had like a steel path uh, fissure. But then I was like, uh, for COVID survival, because I need 30 minutes of that. But it was like, an oh yeah, yeah, that nightwave one. Oh, but there was a survival steel path fissure, and it's grenade. Oh, okay. If people really want to crack relics or something, we just like clear this one. Meso, yeah, Meso survival. Look at that. Look at that. 
Yes, you look at it. You look at it. Your eyeballs have seen. They have read. They have processed. They have put it in your brain. Hydroid. You say Hydroid and Limbo do it. Uh, Giovanna, I, n n we may not be Hydroid players, but both of us will play Limbo no problem. Like We're that's... not going to talk about my damage cap Limbo build. I haven't tested if I can go to damage cap, but I have a high DPS build for Limbo. I have four Limbos and multiple builds. Four <laughs> Limbos? I do. Dang. Okay. Yeah, I have my OG okay. Limbo and I have three Limbo Primes. Nice. All right. You, you definitely beat me on the Limbo love. I only have oh, just yeah. recently become accustomed with the wonder of Limbo. Like I've See, had, I've had him for a bit, but I've played him since that second came out. I've been around for every single tweak and slow nerf into oblivion that they've done. <laughs> so you've seen it all with him, okay? And you've stuck it out too. That's impressive. Yeah, he's still my most used frame. Let, well, let me see. Is my is my baby limbo still in second place? All right. So so is that what we're kind of leaning towards? Maybe steel path, uh, not steel path survival. Just go in there, kill stuff, and farm steel essence and relics. My brain no worky. I just want to press thing and watch it go boom. I like that. I like that. <laughs> you can do that. Oh, uh, Zircoin, that Q thing I was trying to add, I, I realized there's actually an extension I can just use rather than try to, you know, remake the wheel from scratch on my own, so it's there, yes. It's just not through channel points. I still have my Limbo and my 1 and 2 slot. It's very important to me that that happens. <laughs> nice. So, am I hearing, should we be going on Limbo? Is that what we want to do? Survival? Survival Limbos? I mean, it's Grenard, but it's a Fissure, so we're still going to be dealing with nullifiers on top of the XMI, but yeah, we can do it. Thanks, Ragamuffin Muffin Man. Let's see, what build do I want to use this time? St stream Elements, we need to turn that command off. Let me see. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? I... Ah, there it is. Okay. <laughs> it's exclamation mark join. <laughs> it's not rigged. You're just using the exact same command over and over and surprised that you're getting the same result. Not rigged. There we go. Okay. Yes, we hadn't opened it yet, but I can. Okay, now, yeah, now, now at least you use the right command. So. Ooh, I I'm assuming that means both of you would are interested in doing that steel path survival fissure. Is that is that what, what we're getting at here? Now it's rigged, yes, because I haven't opened it yet. There. See? Command. Boom. You've left, but you weren't even in. Okay. There we go. Yeah, that is that is talent to leave without actually having joined the queue. To 
too smart for bot. All right, lady, you have someone on your side who's coming for the survival. I use an antenna tetra. Nice. I have not farmed that one yet. I'm guessing ladies talking to their chat right now. Fair, Grumpy. Fair. All right, so Lazbet, I assume that means you want to hop in for the the survival. You down with that, or were you waiting for what we did next? You're down. All right. Let's see, there we go. Yeah. Hey, oh, I didn't never see. mind. Welcome. Never mind what? what? It looks like we're full. Oh, yep. Got someone on my side. I didn't know if uh, JM was staying in from your side or what, but yeah. We had, we had uh, someone on my side want to hop in. Yeah. Uh... Um. Just going to do a switch because... It saddens me that I can wear the protovire armor on my operator, but if I get sentient skills, if it's only on my operator and not my warframe, did I say skills or kills? I meant kills. Anyway, if I get the kills, it's only on the operator and not the warframe. It doesn't level up the armor. That saddens me. Holy crap latency, really? Yeah, I don't I'm I'm gonna be honest, I don't remember specifically giving you advice. I know we've we've helped a lot of newer players here. But that's awesome. Started out about a month ago, now you're MR9, you're grinding rail jacks and steel path, and you're getting ready for Eidolons. That's awesome. Congrats. I'm glad you've been enjoying the game. Hey, revive counts a thing, Lace Bet. I am trying to hundred percent this on Steam. What a school are you bringing? Ooh, um... We're not going to stay on Zenric. I tend to default to Matarai, but I could also go Oniru for Armor Strip. Yeah, because I'm going to run... I was going to run either Vizirin or Uniru, but if you're going to run Uniru, then I'll just run Vizirin. All right, then I'll go Uniru. Cool, cool. Okay, fourth is booting up, but they'll be on in a sec. Hopefully, if internet permits. That works. All right, fourth's booting up. The tentacle spectacle. One of these days, we will invest in Hydroid and actually get builds for him, but today is not that day. Yeah, I'm glad you've been enjoying it, Latency. Catch you later, Ragamuffin. Thanks for stopping by.
Oh, they announced the new resurgence rotation, Fiery? Really? Primes. As oh, Mesa in Limbo. Nice. Yesterday. Oh, I'm going to be using Surging Blades Limbo. Surging Blades? Okay. I'm going to be using... Yeah, Breach Surge. Okay. I thought about using that build, but yeah. Figured we'd mix, mix it up a little bit. Strizza and Piranha Prime, huh? Hmm. Hey, I'm some guy. Welcome in seven year veteran returning after being gone for four years. Feels like you're starting all over. It can definitely, I mean, you've missed a lot of content, but it's not as imposing as it seems. I mean, especially if you're starting out with some primes already, um, you're going to be starting off on a better foot than, than new players for sure. Well, for the most part, I would, I mean, in terms of like gear, but there are, it is important to also note that there have been some pretty significant reworks to. That's true. Um, That's true. Some systems. Um, so that's fair. You might want to take a refresher course on modding in particular, um, especially as it pertains to primaries and um, a little bit in melees, because if seven years ago, then builds are going to be pretty different. Um, so I, I would I would keep that in mind, um, but if you're just coming back, then you have time because like you're probably still on base star chart, where it doesn't matter as much. <laughs> mm. Yeah, some guys saying it's not the content that feels like you're starting over; it's the complete frame reworks that you just mentioned. Yeah, yeah. Like all the frames function a hundred percent differently. Yeah. Yeah. And I don't know if this would have been before or after movement 2.0. So that could be a thing as well. I don't remember when that was added, honestly. It's been so long. Oof. But yeah, I would just say that, you know, take your time with it. Have fun with it. Calls for a song. Do it in a digestible fashion. Use these to crack open a relic. Life support has been cut off. Okay, they're so where are we going? Hold on. Ah, they're all I'm the friendos. Life Here they are. You're near a fissure. Oh, okay, here we get our first batch of the enemies are dropping reactant. You are going to need more reactant if you want to open that relic. There's so many CC frames here right now. <laughs> yeah. See, this is why I went Surging Blades, because I'm like, you're also playing Limbo, so there's no need for me to be playing a Cataclysm-based Limbo build right now. That's fair. It's the main DPS build I have. I haven't gotten quite down the, the limbo rabbit hole that you have, so I'm like, hey, I found this, it's fun, it works. Yeah, I mean, my damage cap limbo build is the, um, Breach Surge Rift Torrent one, so, like, it's solid. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. I chose this one for the specific reason, though, that... It doesn't like rely too heavily on a physically dragging people into the rift, but I can still stack the damage up. I delivered a life support capsule. Whether or not I am in the rift, activating it will buy And then I'm just using the rift as like a shield at the moment. And his abilities like last for free. realized we had gotten all the reactant already. I didn't even notice picking any of them up. Oh yeah, we've been nuts with that. Oh, 
Yeah, we've stacked almost 100k damage. Then we can start using the shuriken. Yeah, most people don't know how Limbo works. That's basically why he's, uh, a lot of people really don't like him. Yeah, like, I, was, I was I was giving a real I was doing my Limbo 101 course um, <laughs> off <laughs> off mic, and, but yeah, that was like kind of like the gist of what I was saying is like the biggest thing you have to learn with Limbo is all of his interactions because he does have a lot of really specific interactions, and so you have to play around those and use them to your advantage or just to be aware of them. Some of them are just like they're not going to be an advantage thing. It's just going to be how it is yeah just something to be aware, aware of it like mm -hmm. the xmi yeah i'm on All right, Eximus, die, please. And like, there's the fact that more from abilities disregard or abilities in general disregard so like frames like mesa baruch you know that have like augmented um, weapons or just like high damage ability based frames all of those can take really good advantage of the rift as just like a cc yeah like if i'm playing mesa and i see a limbo i'm like banish me <laughs> <laughs> banish me daddy Banish me so that I may shoot them without ever being hurt again. Oh, where's Angus? Hey, Chimisen. Welcome. How you doing? Nice. Like so. Searching blades is fun. May have to check into that build. It's really not that complicated. It's just um, mm. a decent amount of duration and whatever ability strength you can spare. Our operative is making progress. This will help our cause. Having uh, ready, aqua blades in your helmet would help too, which I have not uh, yeah. burned up a second in your alley. <laughs> yeah, that, that was that was that was going with the the assumption that you had aqua blades because otherwise it's kind of moot. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no. Well, that is something I do not have in there at the moment. Anything anyone in the squad is actually trying to get out of Meso Relics? I have no idea what's in here. Oh hey, speaking of things limbos have to deal with, shit ton of Eximus right there. Yep, Eximus. You are not safe from Eximus in the roof. Yup. All that good. Biggest weaknesses. And don't forget, diminishing returns on stasis only on sentience. True. That, like, that makes me so darn salty. You're like, y'all don't understand. <laughs> hey, Bao, welcome back. Burn me! Burn me! 
this would be an example of me going into the um, operator mode to avoid death. I literally just did the same thing. <laughs> the relic has been cracked open. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. The Kengineer with the raid. Welcome. Hello, hello, everybody. Sorry, uh, Streamlabs is not cooperating with the alerts. Normally, I would notice that. I actually just, I'm lucky I noticed that. Welcome. Gorilla with a Glock. Can get you? Hello, hello. How you doing today, Ken? Hello, we are currently doing a co-stream with Lady the Laddie, another fellow Hi. Warframe content creator. Yeah, if you want deadpan um, humor, here we are. Yep, you've come to the right place. But if you all don't know me, hi, I'm Kadoma. I am also a Warframe content creator. Yeah. Uh, we've been playing... Honestly, I started back in June. Uh, we've hit MR30, so done a lot of learning. We do a lot of Eidolons here, some in-game content. Right now we're doing a Steel Path Survival for Relics. Um, play a lot with the community. And... Yeah, we do more Eidolons when Volt Shield works properly. Right now we're doing a few less until that gets fixed, but we'll be doing some. Oh, Volt well, Shield, Smote Shield. Just use Zephyr. Just use Zephyr. <laughs> I mean, it works. <laughs> have you still not tried it? I have not yet. Hey, Atari Hell. Kevonti, welcome. Look, we're going to do Eidolons down today, and I'm going to bring out my, my deep bring Zephyr out. again. Oh, really? Okay. It's just, it's just so far perfect. It's so perfect. If you're yeah, selfish so like it. me, you've seen it. <laughs> oh, I, I want to see it again because it's fun. It's fun seeing you work like that. So Ken says me have finally figured out everything going on with Citrine. Oh, really? What, what, what is there that uh, we may have been missing? Well, I guess you can't tell me because there will be a video for that. But very cool. Head of Cosmo, hey. You got very distracted testing her. Okay. Ooh. Narrowly escaped death there. You just kill them faster than they kill you. That's the goal. You submitted multiple bug reports on Citrine. Really? Interesting. Or at least related to your Citrine testing, I'm assuming. Oh, well, fun fact when it comes to Limbos. Um, our stasis is overlap, so... Oh, nice. One of us, yeah. So technically speaking... Um, as long as one of us has stasis active, it's always active. Okay. That's good info. That's me. Play way too much Limboy. <laughs> oh, but 2.6 million on that. That was nice. Some things stack and some things do not. Okay. And I assume that means they don't stack the way you'd expect them to when they do as well. Especially since some don't stack, like you mentioned. Interesting. Be interesting to see. I'm assuming I can check out the uh, bug section of the Discord server, or did you go a different route, Ken? Now I'm curious. Thanks for the lurk, pure evil. Um, let's see. 
Eximus, they are immune to... I don't remember that. I, and as long as they've got their... It's not quite overshield, but they are, are pretty much immune to everything. Overguard, that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They can go... They can attack me through the rift. They are... Yeah, yeah, so yeah. They're, they're immune to CC, and when you're playing Limbo, that's like all he really has. So, oh, we got a, we got nullified there. Oof. That sucks. Positioning and they made is crap on my abilities pass through the rip. Oh. Yup. Which wasn't the case before. It used to be that they'd have to. Before like, the Eximus rework, yes. Yeah. I really think they just need to reinstall. Get up on him. I'm not done with you yet. Oof. There we go. Oh, a hunt. Sorry, I didn't see it. I don't remember even hearing that that notification went off. Yes. Either get her on after we extract or I'll get you that refund. Sorry. Alerts have been real wonky today. Streamlabs has not been cooperating. All right, we can't go in the rift there because lip and nullifiers. Life support has been replenished. Let's see. If I do this now, I'm just getting nullified. Uh, of course. That's fun. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. Ah, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I just saw the request now. I don't it's supposed to make a barking noise when it's redeemed. I don't remember hearing that. Arf, 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 arf. Yes, exactly like that. You nailed it. I know. That's perfect. I know. I may be a cat, but I can be a dog when I want to be. <sighs> Alright, I didn't even see a nullifier around, and it's just like, no, that thing you did, that didn't happen. Love it. Support Let's has see. Yeah, I gotta hydrate for you, Fiery. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. It's harder on Limbo. He can be a little bit squishy, even when he's in the rift. Right, you got that angle covered. We'll go over here. Changing the mascot of the channel. What? Are we still? Is, how are is, we is still your, having this is your mascot conversation? A dog? Yes. Okay. Yeah, that, that's 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 all I was saying. Didn't have anything to add? I was just like, okay. Nope. Another 
all share in this bounty. Hold out as long as you can. Hmm. Hello, Goldilocks. Okay. Come to me. Okay. We take those here. What? We take what here? The golds? Oh yeah, I want to take gold. You know why? Because you deserve it, right? I do. And I also have expensive taste. Ah, okay. There we go. <laughs> Look, I may not be able to be, I may not be rich IRL, but I can be rich in a goddamn video game. Nah, that's fair. Fake it till you make it. Manifest. All right, how many more golds we get in here? And we got nullified again. Lovely. Yeah, bastard. Bane of this build. There he goes. How bad is negative projectile speed on a Bubonico ribbon? That would probably... Why do these darn fire people keep coming up behind me, hitting me with their darn fire farts? <laughs> Mind my own damn business, and then, oh yeah, here comes the most toxic flatulence ever hit me in the body. Burn through my HP. Stop it. Stop it. Sorry, I just had to get that out. It, it sounded like you needed to express yourself. Right. Because I, I swear, okay those are the ones that literally, like, the other ones you can, like, prepare for decently well. But, like, I swear the firefighters are the ones that, like, you turn out, you peek your head around a corner, you don't even see them, and there's just a wall of flames hitting you. And I'm like, I, yeah. where? 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 Let's see. Negative projectile speed on a Mubonico ribbon. I don't know how much it is when you max it out, but I imagine that's going to make it pretty rough. If you haven't tried the Steflos, the new shotgun, that has a very slow projectile speed, and it is... it's hard to get around. No, what are you talking about? I have, a, I have an amazing ribbon for my Dread. Um, it is negative draw speed or whatever. It takes oh, me a really? solid six seconds to fully draw, and it hits like a truck. Like, what's the problem? Like just so you're using the dread five. right now, right? No, I'm just using Aqua Blades. I'll bring it next time, though, if you really want me to. You want to see my dread? I kind of do now. Yeah, I'm, I'll bring. I'll bring Ghost. <laughs> uh, so isn't that cheating? What are you talking about? It's strategy. Is strategy cheating? No, it's called using what I have to my advantage. Uh, you, you said it's it, it, it's not really an issue because it hits for like a truck and, yeah, and then you're bringing issue. a frame that can specifically speed yeah. up your reload speed. It's not an issue because it's not. Be, be, because you have to use it with specific frames, okay. No. But why no, wouldn't I? Just... Uh-huh, okay, okay. It's not an issue. Okay. You're right. Not an issue. <laughs> On his 50% projectile speed, that seems like a... That seems like that's a deal breaker. Ooh. No. I'm telling you. It's fine. It's fine. Just if play it, it with Volta like Gauss. Train, what does it matter? Like, who cares if it takes you a year and a half to draw it back? Knock an arrow, you know? This really lets you appreciate the animations just as DE intended. 
Crap, I, I keep getting nullified when I'm trying to set this up, and I see no nullifier around, so it must yeah. be on the lower level. Yeah, that's, that is another reason why I didn't bring a bubble build. <laughs> because, yeah. Happened again, I'm like, yeah, no idea where this bastard is. It's because your bubble's too big. That's fair. Because unlike the, the likes of Gara, which would only destroy one portion of it, or whatever portion they pass through, the moment you get a little tickle tickle, it's gonna make everything go poof poof. I should have brought Gara. I've got that nice invigoration for her. And bigger bubbles, fun, but it also means it's a lot easier for a nullifier in two rooms over to just pop it without you having any idea. Yeah, I have no idea where this clown is. Like, I'm, I'm looking for... Oh, he's stuck under here. He's right underneath. That's what's been happening. And he's just standing there. I'm still standing. All right. We got him. Problem solved the next 30 seconds Look i said problem solved okay you know i'll allow it because it's not a problem exactly now you get it what are you talking about i get it i'm the one who said it you're the one who's acting like i was wrong <laughs> you understand now you understand <laughs> hmm well, we've got half a revenant. When is, uh, wait, when's National Pancake Day? What? That was yesterday. Well, 228 is National Pancake Day. Free pancakes at IHOP, apparently. Okay. Wait, then why, why was I told that it was yesterday? I don't know. Pancake Day? Well, if I use the miter for nullifiers, I won't be able to use my tenant archiplasmor. See, see, this is the thing that people don't understand. I'm like, we are aware that there are these things that are made specifically for that thing. Does that mean I want to do that? No, because I don't want to use that weapon. <laughs> yup. Like, if I do that, then I don't get to use the weapon that I like and enjoy, so... Why, why, why do that? And then and people are like, but then why are you complaining? Because that's not the issue. The issue is that, like, you don't even know it's there. The miter doesn't help you if you don't know it's there. <laughs> Never there we go. Yeah. Other support guy. Hey, Blind Bean. It'd be so nice if Limbo functioned on a center point to radius. Or as long as the nullifier doesn't touch the center of the bubble, it won't destroy the entire bubble. Something like that, yeah. Yeah, I've, I've like always said, like, why just... don't they turn it into, like, a, a weird... <laughs> Sorry, I can't even get it out because it would look ridiculous. But, like, if it just folded around. Can you Yeah, can something you like it? that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it just folds in around as, as the nullifier so takes out like part of it. It's like a giant L shape now. Yeah. <laughs> Take your L because that nullifier made you. All right, I will. Manaya! This area is bow. <laughs> Set your stuff. That's rude. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Grumpy. I think a lot of people dr will do that because, uh,. That Kuba just really adds up after a bit. You can't just keep sitting on one ribbon and hope for that ultimate god roll. Yeah, 
yeah, technically my Archiplasmor isn't, you know, it doesn't have all the stats available, but you know what? Even though I don't have a negative, I have crit chance, I have crit damage, and I have damage. That's a really good ribbon. I'm happy with it for now. Oh, if I do that, there's a nullifier right there. What am I thinking? I can see the nullifier bubble. Oh, you talked to Grandma, and your number came up as restricted. Huh. Okay. I literally thought you were talking about Deimos. <laughs> Wait, when I, from which <laughs> comment? You said you were talking oh. to Grandma. <laughs> nice. Okay. I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. Nope, that was my wife saying she called my grandmother. <laughs> Close enough, right? Yeah, who doesn't want a granny that skateboards? Won't let your call go through. That's so weird. Not on the special list. You want to try on my phone? Waiters are going. We will all share in this bounty. Hold out as long as you can. Void time. Ooh, if that's only worth 25. It requires you to walk to me. I mean, yeah, but... I really thought NM was uh, going to miss out on that. Got any gloves? Is this just a nullify this chillin' out of here? It def- Yeah, it- There are crap ton of I them I was here. like, how in the world is there a nullifier on top of this Horus Stringle Dome? I saw it too. That's no very surprise. Yeah. Open. Like, he wasn't sucked in, but he also wasn't eliminating- like, like, Yeah. Like, I don't know how that happens. Yeah. That's why I was like, huh, is there something there? Is this like a weird visual glitch? Like, what's going on? Alright, there's definitely a nullifier around here, because I just got my bubble popped. Yeah, I've been there. My bubble's been popped a few times. How big is this bubble that I have on me? Let me see. Oh yeah, nice and tiny. No nullifier will stop me. Wanna bet?
They will find a way. They have wow, I guess they could really teleport in. Wow. A sir. You are running out of time. Consider extraction. Oh yeah, we got a... I forgot. This is survival. We need to actually, like... Been replenished. Get Not life support. Asphyxiated. Yeah, you know. Oh, Details. You know, it's always really funny to me that like we would apparently suffocate in this. Activated. Even before the like lore came out, I'd be like, can we really like? Do you really think we wouldn't have our own oxygen in this thing? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hey, Dark. Welcome in. How are you doing? Is but uh, oh, you've been taken care of. E. Thanks for that, Idrick. Doing all right. We're doing all right. Just uh, knocking out some steel path survival, popping some relics, getting annihilated by Eximus out of nowhere. Yeah, you know, usual. Please don't. I'd like to not die. Thank you. Ooh. Seriously. I don't think there was anything that was actually attacking there. Well, you're in the rift. I can't even damage you. Okay. Thank you. Thanks, good work, Giovanna. Life support has been replenished. A hundred endo. Ooh, love those drop tables. Don't think we're gonna see cross save on the next major update, Dark, but they do have that uh, dev stream at the end of the month. But generally, from what I understand when they were talking about cross save, they wanted to have cross play, like fully in place and working well, and I think there are still some things they're working out on cross play. So while we could see cross save this year potentially, depending on how things progress, I don't I really think we're seeing it, see it before like December, honestly. Yeah, I was thinking, I was thinking late this year, if we see it this year, yeah. Yeah, I don't think it would be before fourth quarter. Yeah, I'd be really shocked. The uh, hell is damaging me? Maybe a stray electric ball? Could be. Hit. 
blind beans a little more pessimistic, saying they'll be happy to see it before their funeral. I mean, they made a lot more progress on crossplay than I anticipated they would in the time they did. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. So sitting here saying expect it to be end of the year, I mean, considering what they did with crossplay, I don't know. I, I wouldn't. Like, I could totally see them pleasantly surprising us. I, I mean, so... Is... Support capsule is now available. More... I don't know. So, like, we know that they were working on cross-save and cross-play for a while. So when mm -hmm. they got to the live testing phase, where they were just like, yeah, we can just leave it on. Like, that was in the works for, like, a couple years. I'm... But I assume that all the like cross save and cross play stuff has been worked on kind of simultaneously. So I feel like I would think, yeah. I feel like you know there there's there's definitely probably some progress to cross save that's been ha that's happened. Yeah, there just have to be. So I would you know like the earliest I would guess would be. Again, like, end of the year, but I wouldn't be surprised if it didn't happen this year. Oof. Side note, I am getting, like, the absolute worst lag right now. Which is probably just me, but... Um, if... Wait, I'm host. Let me... I'm monitoring... Uh, thanks for saying that. Let me monitor my ping. I've had some issues on that over the last couple of weeks, so... The ping looks I, okay, like, but I'll keep an eye on it. I don't think it's you. I think it's the fact that my computer is dying and it's on its last legs, but <laughs> figured I'd mention it in case I go down like that because I can barely move sometimes. No, like it literally, I was having ping spikes from 30 milliseconds to taking so long to ping the server that it was literally timing out and it stopped counting. So, Oof. yeah. And that when I was hosting, like people were saying, yeah, it's kind of like playing Schrodinger's Warframe because I don't know if uh, the thing I shot is dead until the server pings again. <laughs> yeah. It seems to be okay right now. It was just a really, really big spike. Yeah, my ping's been good, so I think that is on your end. Yeah, like I said, I don't, I, I, I'm not surprised. No, I mean, worth, worth mentioning. I'm glad you did, so I can monitor. Let's see. Anim says, really hate how people complain on all posts about cross save. Like, yeah, waiting is annoying, but you know what else is annoying? Typing Timmy? Losing all your progress because of a bug that didn't get fixed yet. Yup. Not, like, that is absolutely why I am totally down with them taking their time yeah, to do it right. Hey, y'all are using all of my insta -reses. Yeah, like the one thing I've said about cross save repeatedly is the last thing I'd want to do is have them rush it and then a bunch of people lose progress and yeah, they probably have backups, but by the time they realize that people lost stuff and they go and, and do a rollback, other people are going to have earned stuff and then are they going to get to keep that or since we're doing a rollback, did they just lose all that progress, so... No matter what, it seems like a lose-lose if they don't do that right. Yep. Look what our Tenno operative just found. They could not <laughs> Close the window, way. you're letting all the Wi-Fi out. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> what? Mm. When did it get this late? <laughs> yeah, it's quarter to six over three. here, so... I was just thinking to myself, wow, I'm like kind of hungry. Maybe I should like warm something up. And I'm like, why am I hungry? Because it's like 3 p.m. and you haven't eaten today. I had to do it. Yeah, no, I have some soup from this is Szechuan or whatever restaurant that I haven't had yet. That I can just warm up real fast. Oh, actually, I also have some pasta. It'll do that first and see if I'm still hungry. I'll have the soup. Probably should help you keep an eye on the time for that pasta, because I remember, I think it was your last stream, 
You want to go oh, low no, too, man. So I just have to oh, okay. Bit. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Oh, there's like, I remember there being a pasta issue, and, and you know, Italians yeah. in the family, like, uh, we, we can't overcook pasta. That is just no bueno. Yeah, that's just that's just not the way to do it. Yeah, like, I don't know. Like, I think it's like Italian pasta is like that's just the way to do it. Yeah, that's just the way to do it. Boiling uh, the water so that I could put the pasta in so I didn't like overboil it. And then I forgot that it was boiling water, so most of the water just kind of evaporated. But luckily, it didn't get down so low that it was like burning the pot. That would have been bad. Um, but yeah, and then I had to reboil water, and then I had to actually cook the pasta, and then I kind of forgot about the pasta oh. and the reboil. But it was fine. <laughs> it, it didn't turn into starchy mass, so like mission accomplished that's good but the downside was it did take me like an hour to make pasta that should have taken like 15 minutes yeah, a little longer than uh normal but you know these things happen i really don't want to get yeah, yeah. the um, ability strength increase <laughs> But yeah, I'm like a decent multitasker, but like I'm not the type of multitasker that like goes does particularly well with people wanting me to go at their pace. I'm like, you can give me a bunch of tasks and I'll do it, but like I can only like really put my attention on one thing at a time. So if like five people are talking at the same time, I'm like, you need to shut up and you need to talk. And when I'm done with you, the rest of you can or nothing yeah. is happening. <laughs> yeah. That is totally fair. And what yeah, Scrumpy and, and in my... <laughs> totally agree, yeah. Aren't, aren't all devs interchangeable? None of them... Like, they definitely don't specialize. I mean, come on. They can just move them from one area to another and really crank this out, right? Like, if they do that, we can have cross-save ready tomorrow. Psh, it's just so easy. I'm gonna quickly BRB and uh, warm up that pasta, and then I'll right. be uh, back, back, back. But now that I'm talking about, I'm trying to keep you alive. Wanna... Oh, don't worry. I'm in the rift, and I'm also standing on top of a block. So, um, if I die up here, honestly, I deserve it. And kudos to That's them. That's fair. They really worked for it at that point. Oh yeah, you are hiding. Nice. There we go. Yes, of course the skills that are needed to create skins that look good are definitely transferable to bug fixing and base coding, all that. Yeah, 100%. Like, voting for stability, yeah, that's all interchangeable. Hey, hey S'more. Welcome, buddy. Hey, Psych Reaper, we're doing okay. Hanging in there. Popping some relics, doing some steel path. Hanging out with Lady the Laddie, who is currently eating up some food. And found a good spot to hide out while doing so, by the way. Fifteen million. Noise. Just yellow crit. Look what our 
Arteno operative just found. They could not do this without you. I love this archiplasm more. Oh, lady's not gonna be able to pick. That is too bad. Yeah, we're doing all right, Psych. How about you? I believe that. I, I haven't done coding myself, Grumpy, but I have heard so much about how it's so easy to just have your own style to it. And yeah. I can see that getting hard coming back in and trying to work off of something someone else did. I am back. What did Welcome. I get? Uh, if you didn't pick, you got a uh, bronze Breton Prime blueprint, I think. Oh, it's so sexy. I love bronze Breton Primes. They're worth 45. I think. I thought it was Breton Prime. I could be wrong. It probably was. I've seen a lot of those today. It does feel like we've been popping a bunch of those. And runs are going okay. Psych runs are going pretty well. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. We've been here 40 minutes. Oh, hey, we have, haven't we? I didn't even notice. It was a day that happened, S'more. It was a day that happened. What was the day that happened? Oh, he asked how my birthday was. When was your birthday? It was Sunday. Oh. That sounds like I should do something for you. Nah, it's all good. No, I'm doing it. I'm gonna sing oh, no. it on your birthday. And you're gonna take it and you're gonna like it. You understand? Alright, alright, alright. <laughs> now I kinda wanna hear this. Here we go, everybody. <clears throat> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Don't burn me alive, oh my god. Happy birthday, dear Kodoma. Happy birthday to you. There you go. Very nice. Autumn's on his last life. <laughs> you, you are, you're actually very good. Yeah, you know, I only have a music YouTube channel because I love to embarrass myself on the internet. I mean, I think anyone who streams or uh, has a YouTube definitely, definitely is down with embarrassing himself. So yeah, makes sense. Yeah, you know, this one, I just want to like post me singing on the internet so that people can tell me how bad I am. Like that's what really gets me off. Just like knowing how much people hate my content. Oh yeah, every every content creator loves how many people. Can I not be stalked by someone who's burning alive? I just want to eat my damn pasta. Hey, Solid Blaze Barrow should be coming Friday. He always every arrives on a Friday. Yep, every two weeks, always arrives on a Friday and leaves that Sunday morning. Well, I guess time zones are a thing, so. He arrives roughly Friday 9 a.m. Eastern, generally. And then leaves uh, 48 hours later. That's probably the best way to put it. There we go. Time zones exist, I remembered. I'm proud of you. You can get a gold star. 
I'm pretty sure I just did 217 million damage to one enemy right there. Reach surge, go burr. Apparently. And that's why I love this build. Can confirm. Fun build. Did you, did you use a rift Uh, that's the augment for the three, right? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Good, good. <laughs> says, wait, people out. post on YouTube to not embarrass themselves? And then why the fuck have I been posting my tracks on that site? Right? Oh, I am down. Okay. Gosh, I'm just too hot. There we go. You revived yourself? Yeah, I'm good. I literally thought I went into operator before I got down, but I did not. But it worked out, so... No. Good things happened all around. All right. We'll take monkey systems. Oh, really? The toggle prime details on Inaros just make every skin look like Inaros prime. That's that's rough. I've got. I've got one of the Tenocon skins for Trinity. And the prime details, they aren't overpowering, but they don't... It's unfortunate that they can't... They weren't designed to... It looks like the artists weren't able to actually modify prime details to actually be more in line with what they made, because it just doesn't go at all. Are we talking about Tenogen skins? Tenogens, yeah. Did I say Tenocon? I probably said Tenocon incorrectly. No, oh, no, I just was barely paying attention, so... <laughs> uh, you're I'm eating, so you're trying to stay alive, I get it. Um, but yeah, I mean, it is important to know that, like, Tenogen skins aren't made by, like, CD's crew. So, uh, yeah, I, I wouldn't say they were necessarily built with prime details in mind. Why, thank you. Accepted. I will also say that's why I'm a, uh, another reason I'm a fan of the Limbo Prime design. Because I'm using Prime Details with the Vastiona skin and it looks fabulous. Ah, nice. Some lasagna soup. Where is this lasagna soup? What? Why are you telling me to get my wife some lasagna soup? I missed something. I clearly missed something. Oh yeah, that that would be awesome. And um, I agree. I, I I it would be cool. I get why they can't as well, but it would be very cool if they had a little more yeah. runway to play with. Yeah, so some of them some of them definitely fit more than others. Like if you were to look at my limbo prime, I think it has a nice meld of like the skin itself, but also the prime detail. So it doesn't look like the skin, but it doesn't look like like it looks like the prime version, and it's good. If I do say some more set. Replenished. So I do this thing on my channel where like every five subs I squat, but I don't can. So I just you just hear me squatting and getting out of breath. I don't know, I think it's really funny personally. But again, I have a really odd sense of humor, so uh, working on that honor system, huh? Oh, you can tell. Even if I wasn't doing squats, I definitely am getting active. <laughs> Which I think is the most important part. Joy. Yeah. Because I'm horrifically up. out of shape. Uh, I definitely have been in better shape, yes. Mm -hmm. I need to work out more. Oof. 
need to go outside more, but like the thought of that is horrifying. Oh, could be worse. You could have snow and ice to contend with as well. Again, are you are you trying to persuade me that the outside is a good place? I'm <laughs> saying there are there are worse things to contend with than being in SoCal. Okay. If you're talking about outside, you know. I, I'm just, you know, I rest my case. The outside is just no fun Additional for anyone. Unless you're an extrovert. Just full of people mm. and they all look at you and then they expect you to talk when you have headphones in. And it's like, ew, why are you looking at me? Why did you just smile at me? I do not know you. Yeah. Well, and, and then, I mean, you know, if you're biking, people generally aren't going to talk to you. You go hiking. Yeah, but then I'm the one that gets run over by the bike. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anim says, see, that's why I go outside at like 10 to 11 p.m. That's fair, but then my worries transfer to, am I about to get hate crime? <laughs> That's fair. I, I don't know uh, Adam's situation, but now on my end, like, going on middle-aged white. This is presenting male. Yeah, I probably wouldn't have problems. So, yeah. definitely a different world. Yeah, per is a person of color with sometimes very... Well, see, if I know I'm going out, then I'm just going to not wear any of my stuff that is distinctly gender non-conforming. But... <laughs> Yeah. Either way, I'm not a fan of the outside. <laughs> eh. I'm I'm largely an indoor cat myself too, but I do get out and experience things from time to time. Sometimes it's nice to I just. I need to think. like I try and make myself because I know like realistically I have to. It's just like getting myself to do so on a semi-regular basis. I was doing it okay, like going out and like walking for like 30 minutes touching grass or whatever, but mm -hmm. <sighs> the thought of dealing with it is such a pain. Yeah, it can be, but you know, it's, it's, it's nice to get out once in a while. I open the window and I'm like, oh my God, it's air. Okay. Mission accomplished. <laughs> Fresh air. Didn't even need to touch grass. Like, mm, yep, that would be the sounds of the city, and that would be air that hasn't been circulating in my home for the past mm. hour long. I don't know. So I think we did good today. Maybe yeah, there something. you go. Made progress. Oh, Anim says they uh, live in the Netherlands, so guessing it's a little bit different, which is fair. Anim? Like A N A M. Do you A N sorry A N Y M. I may be mispronouncing it slightly. Oh, okay. I, <laughs> Cause I have an onum, and I was like, huh, my onum isn't there unless you've been lying to me this whole time. Nope. I see why you wanted to clarify. Another life support capsule. 16 million. Nice. 600... 600 something million? What the heck? Okay. Oh yeah, you're uh, starting to see them, them, them big boy numbers. Yeah. We're having some fun. We're having some fun. It works even better if you pre-group them, and then you just pop the bubble, and then you prime, and then you prime again, and then you just pop. Yeah. I, I imagine. All right. I mean, I knew this was a fun build, but dang, these numbers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know what you... Wait particularly you have running on it, I would assume 
and not as much strength as I do for sure. <laughs> um, but, what really got me to actually make the build was when I had an invigoration for plus 200% strength and 75% parkour velocity on Limbo. Yep. That was a it. fun week. Yeah, that would do it. Yeah. I can tell just from the size of your arm. <laughs> The relic has been cracked open. That my strength isn't as high. Find out what's yeah. Gotcha. So I'm also assuming that you're running a decent amount of duration on top of that. I am, yeah. Yeah. Based on... Yeah, if I remember right, efficiency is probably my dump stat on this one. Yeah, that would track. If you're running everything else. Are you running a floor now? Ah! Bastard! Oh no! My bestie's on the floor! I better revive him fast! Thank you, thank you. I was working on it, but I didn't armor strip as many as I thought. Holy crap, we are doing some numbers here. I love it. It's funny, when I had that invigoration, I was talking about, you know, this is a lot of fun. I might become a limbo main. There were a couple people in chat who were like, Unfollow, unsub if you do. Well, I hope they don't follow me. Because hmm. they'll be disappointed very quickly. If that's their turn off. Just save yourself the trouble. <laughs> yeah, just... Know your streamer, maybe just yeah. Oh, really? You're rifted, huh? Hey, there we go. Oh, it just bounced over with one I didn't even shoot, took 26 million damage. I love it. I love it. Have a good one, Sander. That is a giant nullifier My bubble. Has been replenished. Look what our Tenno operative oh, and you're an Eximus. That's we cool. Do this you. Don't you love nullified Eximai? Yeah. Like, did you have Everything I like hate that? all in one. It's amazing. Right. Like, like you, like I already can't deal with you. I mean, I can't, but like I'm already like you're already something I don't want to deal with. Mm -hmm. That's what I want to say. So it's like that one. It doesn't really matter. And then you throw an Axmas ability on top of it. Like, okay, okay. Let's see. My name says, any news on what frame is next on the rework table? I haven't heard about... Yeah, I haven't heard anything, anything about reworks. Yeah, like, we knew Grendel a bit before he happened. Yeah, I don't remember them mentioning anyone else they were looking at. I mean, I'm not even going to fry and they need to rework Limbo at this point, but there's a lot of other frames that ought to get reworked first. That's oh, coming from crap. someone who mains this character. Yeah. Like, I enjoy Frost. I enjoy aspects of Loki. They both could use some rework. Like, the Loki, armor... Loki is, is... So, like, the thing about Loki is that he's kind of like... I agree. I do think Loki deserves to get, like, some love to his kit. But, like, the problem is that, like, he technically doesn't not work. Like, he does exactly what's stated on the 
and that's yeah that's also like the problem because he literally just does what's stated on the 10 and if you were to like look at wisp wisp like has his kit yeah like like she can turn invisible as a passive without spending energy she can teleport she can not disarm but she can blind and like cc them so it's kind of the same and that's only and you can only disarm Another if you're doing um the augment anyway yeah which really ought to just be a default part of the ability but that's neither here nor there remember what what is what what villain name i'm missing switch teleport and invisibility irradiating dis with disarm uh, decoy? Uh, I think you yeah. said decoy. No, decoy. Decoy is the one I was forgetting. But that's also oh, okay. confused with her tele- one of her versions of teleport, so like... And her decoy- I mean, his decoy has, um, HP. Whereas Wisps is just timed. Hmm. Yeah, he's just- he is a product of his time. He is dated compared to the current kits, and that's unfortunate. Yeah, and, and so... Meanwhile, you know, most other Warframes get essays for abilities, so... Like, yeah, yeah I, feel like, I feel like while, like, there's nothing inherently wrong with his kit, I do think that, like, you know, you could probably fuse a couple abilities, add some augments in as base abilities, add a new ability, and... It would just be a nice breath of fresh air for him. Fun. But I also think there's others that might like need it a little bit more, like Hydroid. Oh yeah. Like I agree with Anim. Like uh he Frost could use a little love, but especially with the armor strip rework, he's still very solid. I know you make a point. I Hydroid could what, probably like, use it more. I I don't, yeah, like, I don't the, the, and, and I don't think the, Loki doesn't need it, but yeah, you, there are... Yeah, no, and, and that's and that's where I'm at. Like, I agree, I think he does need it, but that at the same time, I understand that others probably should have a priority, because, like, even though I think that, like, he should get some more love because he is dated, like I said, the problem is that, like, everything doesn't... Like, everything works, and it works as intended, and there's nothing that's, like, glaringly like, oh, yeah, you can't do anything with him, you know? Yep. I mean, he is great for, uh, like, Steel Path Stealth Scanning if you want to get that Samara standing, you know? Like, he still serves functions. Got a request for a Terrorist Hunt if you'd want to do that. At some a when if, I, don't, I, I literally don't know when, um, the next Eidolon Hunt is anyway, so... I don't even have my. I normally have a clock on for the, in the for the stream above my mini map. I don't even have that on right now to uh, know because normally I just look at that and go, "Oh yeah, it's this soon." Yeah, so we might have to wait anyway. But I can get to a safe spot and launch that. See how far away we are. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. Let me see. Here we go. I found your your safe spot. Life support levels. Oh yeah. Extraction is your best option. All right. We were told. I'm being told 40 minutes. Okay. Let's yeah. See. That's fine. Yep, I 39 minutes we'll, 46 seconds. I assume we probably won't be in there here this that long life anyway. Cause I know Autumn's on their last life. Oh yeah. I don't know where you stand on the life front. Life support has been replenished. I think I've either rezzed myself with the focus school or had someone else rez me every single time, so I'm doing okay. Yeah, I'm at max as well. But you know, we can keep going as long as we can. I don't care. I'm used to doing long survivals, but just got to keep mm -hmm. an eye out. If you, if, it's assuming you're down to do an idol on when it pops up. Let's see. Well, you my wife did mention she was happy. starting dinner, so I don't know if I'll, if my stomach will let me stick around for that. Yeah, yeah that's fair, because it is later for you than it is for me. <laughs> yes, unfortunately. 
But yeah, I'll certainly be down to do one if uh, yeah. if nothing else. Because I'll probably still be around. <laughs> That's fair. Loki, invisible, wisp, open up portal to sun. Tell me how the shit out of enemies while still being able to have it boosted by her three modes. Yep. And also invisible just when she jumps, which, hey, it's Warframe. You jump. Right? Like, who doesn't jump? Grumpy, when you say use Loki for hunting, like, well, what do you mean hunting? When I hear hunting, I think Eidolons. Which is not necessarily what everyone thinks, but that's what I think, so. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. Additional life support has arrived. Oh, hunting beast for standing. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Well, that makes sense. You're Loki, Ivara. You don't jump, you only fly and glide. Curious what my damage output is. Oh, didn't expect that. Okay. Okay, you're in the void. You are too crap. Too many of these guys are in the rift. Thank you. I almost had it, but too many of my targets were in the rift and I couldn't shoot them. Almost. You just do the worm as your primary mode of transportation. I mean, that'll get you from point A to point B, but it'll also get some looks. Oh, hey, if you're okay with that. Here we are. I'm... Hmm. Nah, it was getting rough. Grumpy, you finished evolving Pelarx? Nice. How are you liking it so far? Oh, Mania just came after me. Oh, Mania's gone. Yep, Mania has been taken care of. There's only... Hello, 
love seeing hundreds of millions of damage just spreading like wildfire. successful we will be. Dang it is. I got them tooths. I got them teeth. All right. I thought no one just seems to have anything in particular they're going for. It's just, eh, prime junk. Like, okay. Um, she, if you hear her whining, she's not near me, no. Despite the hundreds of millions of damage I'm doing, I'm only at 36%. Anam is beating me at 38% damage dealt. Extraction is ready. Yeah, I'm at a whopping 14. Just going around slicing people. Oh, we got nullified somewhere. Oh, there you are, bastard. Way over there. Okay. And the handiest use of Twitch, checking with your significant other for things. Yep. Oh, that was quick. Thank you. I only got one shot off, and you were like, nah, just, just get up. That's what she said. <laughs> nice, pure evil. Compounding damage is a glorious thing. Life support capsule. We can do it. The relic has been cracked open. Oh, via lunch, Shayma. Wanna, wanna take me to lunch, Violence? No. He just crept up on me from behind. That is so rude. Yeah, you don't know what my life experience is. Like, that really could have just... That could have set me off. Come on. I, I, I have no idea what happen. I've been through. You don't know... Okay, so there's a thing that my... My family would do, and <laughs> it's probably it's not gonna be as funny to y'all because you didn't grow up with it. But there's this thing that we mm. would do, where if someone would do something, but we like, and we would just bust up and say, "You don't know me. You don't know what size I am." It's all I can think of. 
<laughs> it's a very, it's a very like. No one is, <laughs> I know no one. It's is a very, there. very much an inside joke to you and your it, family. Yeah, buddy. it is. It is. It is a family thing. I know no one else is gonna like find it as funny as I do. But I thought I'd share because you're gonna be hearing me kind of giggling in the background for the next few minutes. That's all I can think of when you were saying that. Yeah, but I had to stop myself from just busting out with that because it would have been even more out of context. Yeah, I was like, you are. I, I did notice you were uh, particularly enjoying that. And I'm like, I, I must have hit on something I'm not aware of. Yeah, <laughs> so that's, that's what it was. The longer you fight, the more Ooh, successful. a drop of credits. Yay! Hmm. Vault looks good. Oh, it's done? Okay. Okay. And an Aros rework would be nice. He... He's the frame that everyone goes, Oh, he has abilities? Nah. Yeah, he could use one. My droid could, for sure. So apparently food's done on my end. Oh. And I've been live for out? seven and a half hours. You yeah. yeah, we we can hit the next the next five minute mark if you want. Yeah, that's fine. Seven minute run, not too shabby. Has arrived. Yeah, I'd say that's that's a solid run. Can't can't feel bad about that. Damn yeah, false. I hope Pedro does something with him eventually. Do you mean Pablo? Yeah, Belbereth just corrected that. I'm like, <laughs> no, I was just well, Mufasa I was... wrote Mufasa wrote Pedro. I was like, I believe I know who you're talking about. I'm gonna roll with it. Because I was like Pascal. <laughs> Pedro Pascal. Yes, because he he definitely has some pull in the Warframe community. Yeah. <laughs> They're they're tapping him to play uh, the operator in the the drifter in the live action adaptation. So, you know. I mean, I wouldn't complain. <laughs> hmm. The guy with the P, close enough. I haven't really seen anything he's been in that I haven't liked, so yeah, I think uh, he'd be solid. I feel like he could give like new war drifter energy pretty well. Yep, I agree. I've delivered another life support capsule.
I don't think Patrick's the one landing. I think, uh, I think we nailed that early. What? Oh. There were more guesses on P names. Um... Patrick? Patrick was a guess, yes. Um... Wow, I can't really think of a lot of P names. Peter! Hmm. Bill? Hill? Phil. T H I L Phil. Oh, I was hearing Pill. I was like, who is would name them <laughs> Who would be named Pill? That that Pill? is a valid question. I agree with that question. Um Yeah, Phil works. Um Perry. Yeah, Perry the platypus. Not immediately what I thought of, but I don't want to say what I thought times, of because that's really gonna date me. I think I think I think the fact that I referenced Perry the Platypus is the first thing dates me already. Oh, mine would date me worse. Believe me. What's up? No, I was just trying to think if I can think of any more P-Names. Are we sticking with uh, the more masculine ones, or do we want to open it up to the feminine, too? I, I mean, Patricia is like the only thing that comes to mind. <laughs> Penny? Patty? Well, that's Patricia. It could be, or it could be a different name. Thank you. Yeah, no. Uh, Considering you just uh, picked me up there, then yes, you are right. It could be a different name. <laughs> That's right. Would you look at that? I got two dual Karis Prime handles, and I'm pretty sure that's what you would need if I needed to build another one. That is correct. There you go. Paul, Paul and Paula. All right. Oh, yeah, Paul. Who could forget about Paul? Me, apparently. All of us, yes. All oh, right. Penelope, there's one, there's one. I think Penny's We're short for that, but yeah, that works. Penelope? Yeah, extracting food. Yeah, you don't think Penny's short for that? I think Penny's just Penny. You think Penny's I mean, just Penny? It could be. <laughs> could but be. I think, I think Penny's just Penny. Penny feels like, like, I feel like there's just people that's named Penny. You are running out of time. Could be. Consider Pierre. Oh, yeah, Pierre. Perry. Life support activated. Oh, wait, is but no, I, I like a legitimately different name because there's 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 someone in Little Mix named Perry Edwards. <laughs> okay, yeah, I wasn't thinking Perry the Platypus. I was thinking Perry Mason. Who is Perry? When I Mason? came up with that. <laughs> Don't Google it. Don't Google it. <laughs> it's gonna Why date not? me so much. Because it's going to date me so much worse than Perry the Platypus. You know I have to do it now, right? Uh, you can't tell me not to Google this thing and levels. expect my Extraction my in, eternal option. itch for knowledge to not be... Yeah. And so we learn the importance of clarity and purpose. All right, that is a haul. That is a haul. I know, once the screen came up, Lady immediately started Googling.
from 1957 to 1966, a crime drama mystery classic. Now, in, in my defense, I was never actually alive when it was originally on the air. So I'm not that old, but the fact that I remember it and know it still says things. Look, I wasn't judging. <laughs> I was just curious. Because like, now it was like, I need to know. Jeez. Yeah, so you are wrapping up, yeah? Uh, probably, yeah, uh, because food smells good. And, yeah, this is, uh, this is, it's been a good, good size stream. Good, good size stream. So, yeah, um, gee, I wonder if we have a raid target. You're gonna, you're gonna be around a bit, right? You were talking about doing the next night cycle. Yeah, yeah, I'll do the next mm. night cycle. I have no problem well, look doing, at that. doing some terror listies. Alrighty, alrighty. Well, let me wrap up, and gee, I think I know who we're gonna raid. What? No. How could you this possibly is so surprising. know who to raid? Uh, like, what? This is so surprising, right? Surprise? What? You're gonna raid someone? Like, that's crazy. I, I know. Well, like, don't most normal people just shut off the stream and call it? I, I mean, that's all I do. Like, I've, what is this Rade? What is this Rade? I, 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 I know, know, I know, like, new, my new vocabulary. Yes, is it, you pronounce it raid? <laughs> yes, yes, like the insect killer. Yes. Mm, I am familiar with the insect killer. So when you raid someone, you are killing insects with them? Um, in this game, depending, sometimes I'm on Rhino, so I might actually be the insect doing the killing. It it gets a little weird in the game. Mm, so this is game related. Mr. It Rai. is game generally game related, yes. Hmm, yes but you I know, see. sometimes they the the person on the on the receiving end might be you know on the just chatting or what have you. But, I I do say that we must raid together. Raid, yes. I was getting really close to rawhide right there. <laughs> raid. Ah. <laughs> uh, Alrighty, one moment, let me wrap up here. So, chat, thank you all for hanging out. It's been fun. We'll be back tomorrow. If you haven't already followed, I saw we got some follows there. Apologies, Streamlabs is not working. Normally we have notifications, so I do want to thank everyone who's been hanging out and following, uh, lurking, chatting, hopping in the squad, um, subbing, rating, Appreciate you all. I will be back tomorrow. Uh, planning on 10 a.m. Eastern. I know I've been late, but internet issues. So it's been stable today. So I'm hoping we'll be on time tomorrow. Uh, I'll be hanging out doing some Warframe. Friday, we'll also be back at the normal time. We'll start on Warframe. And then we're going to check out um, High on Life, which looks freaking hilarious and fun. Uh, but don't go anywhere. We're going to run the credits properly. Thank everyone. And then raid Lady the Laddie, who we've been hanging out fellow Warframe uh, creator. A lot of fun. So we'll catch you later. Have a good rest of your night, everyone. <laughs>